Welcome to Let's Play Mega Man X for the, well, duh, Super Nintendo. That's the only system it's on. This is Ron Moore along with, uh, for the first time in about two years, returning to the S2K Raven. Yup. <laughs> and, uh, so yeah, we were going to originally review this game for the old school style SC2K show, but, uh, decided to make it a Let's Play instead. And as we look at a bunch of numbers and stuff, and yeah, this is all you do in this game. It's pretty fun. What do you think, Raven? Yup. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, yeah, so right here is like the introduction to the whole series. As Mega Man's been, or X has been asleep or something for like a long time in hibernation. Machine sleep? Yeah, I guess so. This is, uh, right here, it's Dr. Light. Uh, by this time, Dr. Light's dead. And this is him typing something to, uh, I guess Dr. Kane or whoever takes over, uh, Mega Man or X, X's body. They call him X now instead of Mega Man. Uh, and talk about, uh, how X is, uh, a new type of robot or has a new feature built inside of him where he can think and actually think and feel what something that, you know, robots can, couldn't do before. You know, here it says approximately 30 years will be required before we can safely confirm his real re reliability and so yeah it's Dr. Light explaining the whole thing right here uh, yeah it's kind of annoying right here though for a long time you hear the <laughs> it's always September 18 2000 XX <laughs> yeah <laughs> So yeah, Mega Man X is one of the greatest games of all time. Have you played this game, Raven? Yeah, a long time ago. I, I wasn't drunk, sadly, to admit that, but uh, <laughs> I wish I was now. Alright. And, uh, yeah, so here we go with the introduction stage. And what's different about this game than the, than the old school Mega Man is, when I first played this part right here, I'm like, um, where, where's the screen where I pick the robot master to fight but no here you what you do is you start out in the introduction stage and uh, then after that you go to the Mavericks uh, Maverick select screen they're called Mavericks now not robot masters so uh, yeah that right here is like oh where am I at <clears throat> who, who am I gonna fight but this stage is freaking awesome the just the, the music and the, and the environment of it yeah it's pretty ECW ECW what was that? Extremely crunchy waffles. <laughs> right. Yep. Extremely, cr extremely crunch. Uh, yeah. Extremely crunk waffles. Not uh. Word. What was that? Crunk is not a real word. <laughs> yeah. Crunk. Crunk cola. Crunk cola. What the? You never seen Angels Crunk Cola commercial? Uh, I may have. I just. Probably really drunk, like diesel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like the part where you kill that giant wasp and then it, it falls on the bridge and it collapses. <laughs> yeah, the music's a little over dramatic here, but it's pretty. It's still pretty ECW. What's saying ECW? Uh, Raven's been around, uh, around. He's been away for too long, so he's not familiar with the whole ECW term. Extremely crunchy waffles. Yep. <laughs> That's what it used to stand for back when he was around, but now it's, uh, it stands for extremely cool world. No, I don't know. Man, you should have jumped in that car. You can run over people. See, look, you're missing all those vehicles. You could have jumped in. Man, what, what the hell? <laughs> Actually, you can jump in that car, but I mean, I don't think you can really do much on it. Oh, yeah. Mexicans. Not sure. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> Immigration. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> and now you fight the boss of the stage, and you cannot win right here. There's like a room off from Golden Eye. You can't win. So I'm just going to die on purpose right here because this is part of the storyline.
Hurry up. Yeah, right here I'm like, oh, I'm gonna die, but then no, he grabs me and, and talks trash to me. You are this piece of sh Did you think you could defeat me? Actually, he wasn't talking trash. He was all like, beep, 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 beep. Uh, yeah. Oh, wait a minute! Here comes one. I mean, zero. <laughs> what? <laughs> that's the robot's name, Zero. And he has long, girly hair for some reason, but that's okay. He's a cool robot. Mega Man turns emo. I'm a loser. I couldn't beat him. Yes, you are, X. What is wrong with you? No. <laughs> Robots have hair? What the hell is yeah, yeah, well, Mega Man had hair. Remember, he, he would not have his helmet on, and then, like in Mega Man 2, at the opening uh, title screen, he would stand there without his helmet on, and he had black hair. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but right here, Goldilocks over here, and with his long blonde hair. I thought it was fire, but no, it's hair. <laughs> you mean blonde? As in gay surfer boy blonde? Right. Uh, yeah, I thought that was fire. Fire that stood still on his back. I know you can do it! He's lying. You don't believe in him. Ah, they both turned into pencils. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and that's the end of part one. We'll see you in part two. God bless and take care. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to part two of Mega Man X, where we get to fight some actual Mavericks this time. This is Ron Moore back with Raven. Yep. And <clears throat> how come every time I freaking record, I got something stuck in my throat? Oh, quit trying to eat the damn microphone. <laughs> right. Uh, all right, now we're going to pick the first Maverick that I like to choose first, Chill Penguin. It's a penguin. <laughs> yeah, it's a Dan DeVito. <laughs> this is a cool stage. Ooh, it's cool. <laughs> Why was that wasp trying to take a crap on you? <laughs> I don't know, man. It's weird. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I love the music in this stage. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, when I put the mic towards you, that, that's your cue to give your opinion, too, Raven. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and this stage is cool. Yarp. <laughs> <laughs> Yarp, <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Man, you know, Bear 13 has more words to say than you do. Bear. Arr. Oh, yeah. Uh, Raven's, not, Raven's not familiar with the new crew, uh, S2K. The new new crew. The new S2K crew. <laughs> crew. Come on, Jason Rockization has more words to say than you. Who? <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Bear's brother. No, not really, but, uh. Uh, here's Dr. Light, the ghost of Dr. Light. Or Santa Claus. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> and here Dr. Light is telling X about uh, how he's dead. No, I don't know. Um, I, I forgot. I think he's just telling him about, uh, you know, well, X, uh, I, I don't know what he's really telling him. I forgot. He just gives him an upgrade. Uh, I don't think he's dead. He just painted himself blue. He wanted to be a Smurf. Santa Smurf. And he's... He has the power to blink now. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Santa Smurf, yeah. <laughs> but uh, as he talks for a long time, well, this is kind of a... Uh, in the music right here is all, I guess, kind of uh, like emotional or whatever. Because, you know, Dr. Light's dead. And it's, it's Ghost talking to Mega Man. Or X, excuse me. Emo. Sonal. How about, how about Emo Man? Emo Man? He, he, you don't even have to fight him. He'll kill himself. Oh uh, yeah, you got wrist cutter. <laughs> and now here I got the uh, d the dash upgrade. Yay, new shoes! <laughs> yeah. This ostrich right here. <laughs> yeah. The hell are the flying things? They're like flying giant turtle heads. I thought I was gonna say turds. Is that too? That's what a turtle head is. <laughs> I've got the turtle head poking out. <laughs> All right, cool. Now this part of the game is really cool. You get to be in this little uh, uh, machine. Why does it not have guns? 
Yeah, I know, that'd be pretty cool, but uh, uh oh, look out. <laughs> Alright. Oh, snowballs now. I have a snowball's chance in hell beating this level. Were you really being chased by a snowball? Uh, yeah, <laughs> it's a snowball effect. Uh, yeah. <laughs> All right, now to fight the first ECW boss, Chill Penguin. Penguin. <laughs> and he looks at you real quick and says, "Yeah, I want to fight you." Real easy. Now uh, you can also use the uh, Flame Mammoth weapon to beat him, but uh, to me, he's always been the first uh, boss I want to go to. Wait a minute! Someone that fat couldn't jump that high. Yeah, he can. This is one of the best boss battle music I've ever heard. That's not punk rock. <laughs> Man, this boss is cold. Watch out. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Get it? He's cold. Uh, yeah. <laughs> He's cold blooded. Oh, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, man. <laughs> What's so funny? Just because my terms and yours are way different. <laughs> All right. You never heard the term "cold" when someone's dangerous or whatever? They can't be messed with. There's someone at work that uses that term, and I make fun of them for it. Man, this cold, Cuddy. Uh, you say Cuddy again, I will stab you. <laughs> All right. Now the next stage. Now I'm going to fight the eagle this time. Storm Eagle. Storm Eagle? I know someone whose name is Shadowhawk. Well, he's probably lame compared to Storm Eagle. This is probably the best stage music in the game. Well, actually, that's one of my co-workers. His, he named his son Shadowhawk. Right. Tony Hawk? He, yes, he eats skateboards. <laughs> right. So, Storm Eagle stage, you're at an airport. And that's it. Next stage. Nah. -uh. <laughs> Whoa. What the hell is that dude doing? I know he's using his Castlevania whip on me. This is Metallica playing. Metallica. <laughs> Are you just mad because they shut down Napster? What the hell is Napster? <laughs> okay. Never mind. Anyway. <laughs> I don't want to take a nap. <laughs> All right. What you going to do when the Napster runs wild on you? <laughs> Macho man. <laughs> that was Hogan. Oh, that, that, I've been, I hadn't watched wrestling in years, bro. <laughs> Macho man. <laughs> oh, no, let me go back and get the uh, sub tank up here. Yeah, uh, yeah, almost. I've got gas. Oh wait. <laughs> All right. All right. There's the my first sub tank. There's four sub tanks in this game. It's kind of lame though. In the old Mega Man games, you get nine of them. But oh well. This stage really reminds me of a 16-bit version of Airman stage. I don't remember what sub tanks serve as. What the purpose is? When you run out of energy, yes, the energy refill. Uh, okay, so pretty much it is gas. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I destroy these little missiles, explosive batteries, or whatever they are. They look like propane tanks, which I, I would never run that close to one. Not unless I was throwing it at zombies. Not unless you were Hank Hill. Bobby, damn it. Mm, Bobby? This song makes me want to fly an airplane. It makes me want to beat up emos. <laughs> this song should have been used for Top Gun. Top Gun? Whoa. I hadn't heard about that movie in forever. Here's another run in with Dr. Light. 
this time he's gonna give me the helmet upgrade where I can headbutt <laughs> bricks and stuff. As it rains all over me. <laughs> Did you just headbutt that ceiling? Yep. <laughs> I want to headbutt a ceiling and make holes. Not really. <laughs> Okay, R Ronnie went to go book uh, the emo. Uh, <laughs> now there's little helmets sitting on the floor, and they're looking at him. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, I'm back. What I miss? Helmets. <laughs> Alright. Oh, I thought I was gonna die right there. Got jumping on things quickly. All right, now I'm getting towards Storm Eagle's chamber. And I'm on a giant airplane. Oh, no, I'm not airplane. I don't know what the heck I'm on, but it's flying. This part reminds, this part reminds me of Wing Fortress Zone in Sonic 2. You can't run on an airplane. You would fall off. <laughs> Whoa! What happened? <laughs> you ready to fight Storm Eagle or Shadow Hawk? Shadow Eagle. <laughs> Fly like an now you can also um, you can also use the Sting Chameleon as a weakness on Storm Eagle, but he's uh, not that strong, so you can use a regular Mega Buster on him. Ow! I know on the old Mega Man games it was recommended that you always start fighting somebody else. Is this who you're recommended to fight first? Uh, yeah, this, him, Chio Ch Penguin, are two people I, I, I fight first. I mean, in Mega Man games you can go in pretty much uh, different orders. Yeah, I remember that. It's just been years and I drink beer now. Right. Uh, Alright, so that's it for part two. Stay tuned for part three. I don't know if Raven be here or not, but oh well. God bless and take care. Waka waka. <laughs> but well, welcome to Mega Man XD Part Three. This is Ron Moore along with what Stone Cold Steve Austin apparently and J Man Four Six Two Four One and we got the run on. Hey yo. Yeah. And who to pick next? If I can remember. Um. Oh yeah, Spark Mandrill. Pick the one that looks like a robot. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> we say J about this game. Oh, it sucks. It says Mega Man X, but there's no X Men. And it's not number ten. All their all their names <laughs> yeah. don't end in man. Snow. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> now Spark Mandrill stage. This is a shocking stage with a lot of shocking elements. That's pretty dark. Ha ha ha! It's going dark. It's it? damn it. <laughs> I see, mm -hmm. depending on what stage you beat first, it affects the uh, the atmosphere of the next stage. Since I beat Storm Eagle stage first, that airship or airplane, whatever we were on in Storm Eagle stage, crashed into this stage right here. So that's why the power is going, going out. And you saw fragments of the ship right there at the beginning of the stage. Ah, uh, creative. It's like, it's yeah. like YouTube maintenance. I thought we were doing <laughs> <Yeah>. Donkey Kong. <laughs> Does this look like Donkey Kong? I don't know. <laughs> God. Donkey Kong X. <laughs> okay, Country X. You guys seen the new one on the, on the Wii? Oh yeah, I'm so getting that. It's pretty awesome. It is gonna be awesome. Yeah, but you're so getting a boner tonight over monkeys and time. Yeah, bear. <laughs> now this bubble mini boss right here don't have any electricity because of the Bull power boner. outage going on. Because he's in a bubble of water. It's not gonna be no electricity. <laughs> Yes, it does. If, if you don't beat Storm Eagle stage first, this stage has you know all the electricity in it. So I'm sorry about because the bubble of thing. that, huh? Bubble man. I'm talking about the bubble thing. He's in the water. He can't have electricity because electricity and water is and, uh, and the death. Well, you can. On. Logic. More on. Physics. More on what? <laughs> more on. Yeah, more on. Uh, <laughs> oh, more on. More on what? I don't know. More running. <laughs> more on. More. <laughs> 
I gotta have more than one, though. Ron Bob, we're here now. <laughs> oh. Not like you, Ben. <laughs> yes, yeah, you're stage. worse than me. <laughs> I'll do it again. We don't think the stage music. It's awesome. Uh, it sucks. Don't get this Mega Man 2. <laughs> you're 1 out of 10. <laughs> An X out of 10. Yeah, pretty much all the music in this game is awesome. Yeah, it's kick ass. Yeah. Yeah, really. All deserving of 1 out of 10. You're a 1 out of 10. Well, your mom's a fag. <laughs> okay. Well, you know, you're a bundle of sticks. I like sticks. <laughs> hey, listen to sticks. Alright, guys, only losers get off topic. So, anyway, yep, did you watch the news earlier? <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the news about Mega Man X. The news fun. about how, how, uh, gay this game yeah. is. <laughs> no way. Oh man. Ooh. What do you know about tasting games? You like Action 52? <laughs> I don't like yeah, Action like... 52. <laughs> you like, you like Finding Nemo. Nemo. Yeah. I don't like Finding Nemo? Nemo in my pants. What? I like Finding <laughs> Nemo in my pants. Anyway, here's the colorful, flashy Spark Mandrill. I guess Sparkman's uh, younger brother from Mega Man 3. He looks ridiculous. He's like his uncle the or bigger, something. The bigger little brother. Ah, crap. Yeah, so keep doing that, and it's pretty easy. Much more challenging without this strategy right here, if you choose a regular X-Buster or whatever. When I first fought this guy back in about 93, 94, and I first played this game, man, he pulled me big time. Until I figure out the strategy right here. Yeah, if you don't use the ice thing, it's pretty difficult. Yeah. He had a cool entrance, though. Well, it's dark, and then you see him, you know, all the little lights on him, and he drops down. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's like wrestling. <laughs> yeah. Except I don't watch it. Yeah, he's about as big as a freaking Can. big man Vader. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, next. Armored Armadillo. Oh yeah, I love the stage. Me too. Yeah, I love the stage too, except the music yeah. kind of Isn't this weird. the Screw Attack music, this one? What? What? No. Or like, they had a little no. radio show and they would have this music at the beginning. Yep, oh. it was this music. I like this song. Yeah, this song's weird for this stage. It's like... It makes me want to dance or something. I don't know what the heck <laughs> <laughs> it is. It doesn't make me want to dance. <laughs> I know what music makes me want to dance. Tim Fulian. Yeah! He composed it, the music in this game. Oh, he didn't, you stupid... Yes, he did. Look at, look at the bottom of the video. What does it say? It says no. nothing. It's stupid to put in this video. <laughs> don't Why don't we just shake Wii Guy? Oh. Here's Shaking a little trick to get a... Here's a little trick to get a sub tank right here. There you go. That, that bulldozer is a one-hit kill. Yep. Ah. Now you can touch it from behind, I think, but not. don't let the... Uh, Watch out for the spikes. <laughs> Yeah, the spikes thing touch it. That's the one hit kill. Gee. Yeah, the spikes from touching it in behind. <laughs> I was waiting for Bear to say something. But uh, the me tools are in this game now. Doctor Wally created those. Is that right? He's not in the X series. Hmm. Anyway. Well, hmm. we should file a copyright claim. <laughs> Actually, Doctor Wally did create Zero. But you don't know about that till X Four. Spoiler alert! alert. <laughs> I'm trying to watch it. I think man. after like 10 years, it's okay to spoil things. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, yeah we guy get max. Yeah, I spoiled, uh... No, no, it's Viper. My bad. Viper got. No, he didn't really get mad, but he was like, he told me the ending to Rambo 2 or whatever it was uh, the other night. <laughs> <laughs> he was actually joking. He's seen that, that movie before. <laughs> I know. Or the, uh, yeah. <laughs> anyway. Oh, oh! Oh, I'm so close, man. Alright, here we go. Look up. Thank you. you gotta get in front of him right here. Hurry yeah. up and get the heart. Of course, you don't have to, but. You know. Are you ready again, heart? No. Watch out for the reach around. No, how dare you mention. <laughs> how dare you mention that game? In this LP, I always you're, have tarnishing, to you're tarnishing the great game that is Mega Man X compared to Target Renegade. He mentions it. Kills he mentions it. it in every video game. <laughs> yeah, every every LP that 
We got yeah, a sense that I've always had to mention target Renegade. Renegade. Oh, oh. Renegade. Cool background right here. Awesome. Waterfall man. Don't go chasing waterfalls. Now, isn't there a secret up there, but like it doesn't work every time? Like you have to die a couple times, and then like. That's how you get the Ryu's Hod Hodoka right, thing, right, but you got right. something else also. Okay. Uh, I don't know how to do that, and I'm not going to do that in this LP, so if you don't like it, unsubscribe right now. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, okay. Here. Unsubscribe. <laughs> Here's the boss battle with Armored Armadillo here, and you, you got to use the, the electric shark. Uh, shark? Shark. shark. <laughs> electric spark. You say spark. But um, I, I beat Armored Armadillo with just the X-Buster, and man, it was a long and hard battle. That's what she said. Um, and <laughs> I'll be fair to it. <laughs> Hit him. Uh, awesome battle though right here. I mean, it's pretty challenging, but you know, you get lose the electric spark. It's not really that hard. But if you find for the first time and don't know the right strategy, he'll pwn you. That's a she's... No. Damn it. No, no. <laughs> uh, <laughs> don't know the right strategy, she will pwn you. That's crappy music right there. <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> now I get Rolling Thunder. I mean, Rolling Shield. Rolling Rock. But he should let it fuck. Rolling the Rock has come back to Mega Man X. Okay. Um, oh, boy. Next is... Yes, Launch Octopus. Next is that guy. <laughs> yeah. <With> the glasses. <laughs> That's me. No. You're that... I'll break glasses or shut up. That Texan with the glasses. That dick in glasses. Hey. Now, now, hey. now this stage now this stage is pretty easy to It reminds me a little bit yeah. of uh Dive Man stage in Mega Man. Yeah, it's much better. Yeah, Dive Man stage on steroids. Oh, this is the ECW Dive Man stage. Now this stage is on the cover of, of the get uh, the cover box. On the cover of the cover box. <laughs> oh really? Oh really. Oh, Dang it, freaking Toxic Seahorse is here. This isn't Toxic Seahorse. Oh, no, that's, 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 a that's Mega X3. Man. Yeah, yeah that's X3. Omni Sporting. Um, um, no one's supposed to know that yet. Um, <laughs> Kazoon um, Tank. Um, Um, <laughs> um, Oh, speaking of that, I seen somebody try to do a Rick Roll, but their thumbnail was the video, so it was like, fail. It's like you're supposed <laughs> to, you know, trick people. <laughs> <laughs> How's the ah, thumbnail gonna be Rick Astley? <laughs> well, speaking of pwn, I just pwned myself here because I thought this was the best, fastest way to yeah, kill this thing. I guess you're like not. giving him energy. Oh, oh there we go. God. Oh, yeah. Back. <laughs> energy, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So. You gotta find that thing again here in a minute. Man, these blowfish suck and blow. Hey, uh. All right, guys, run out of time here as I Whoa. as I try to beat this thing. We'll see you in part four. Or... Oh, thank God. <laughs> God bless. Take care. See ya. This is Fuck Vance. Off. Welcome to Let's Play Mega Man XD Part Quattro. This is Ron Moore along with J Man, and oh yeah, that's it. Yep. <laughs> and let's see if I. If I can survive this time against this uh, water ship or water vacuum, whatever the heck it is, maybe that, maybe this thing can clean up the oil spill. Put the uh, cover the spikes with the oil. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Two birds with one stone. Yeah. <laughs> All right, now let me get up here and destroy the ship. Bloop, 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 bloop. Ah, dang it! It's on the other side. <laughs> Yeah, let me swim through here. Clap, 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 clap. Look, look, look at this, Charlie. We're swimming. Clap, clap. Oh no, <laughs> not again. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let me get up here. Here we go. Oh. Oh, maybe not. Oh, oh. come on. Grr. Grr. If only you had the Mega Man Six power thing. Yeah, really. All right, here we go. Destroy this so I can get to the bottom of this level to get the. Uh, Next heart container, or whatever you call it. Zelda heart container. The secret. Yeah. Yes. Ow! <laughs> oh, come on, man! 
That's not supposed to hurt. Yeah, I destroyed the ship. There we go. All right. Now, before I get the hard container, I gotta fight the first giant water snake anaconda thing in the stage. Real easy, just use this, and then that's it. And so, uh, storm tornado actually works this time. Yes. <laughs> I learned that trick from Vim a long time ago. I used to always use the Eggs Buster to do it. It would still work, but that was yeah. a lot quicker. Yeah, I had, I had actually never knew about that. That was yeah. pretty awesome. Cool. Well, I know some tricks on here, like like you do on Mega Man 2. Yeah, that's years and years of deep con con concentration. Yeah, there's that's the word. Conversation. <laughs> See, we learn <laughs> from each other. <laughs> and we all learn from Skip. Oh, absolutely. Alright, here's the second battle with uh, Anaconda. Snakes on a... not plane. <laughs> Snakes underwater, Phil. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa! Whoa, I killed it on the ground, that's cool! Yeah, it was like a, a glitch or something. Yeah, I, I've never seen that before, wow. I couldn't get that little... or that tiny little power-up that matters so much, but... <laughs> who cares? Right. That's pretty cool. Alright, now we get ready for the battle with Launch Octopus. Now watch him right here as he does his little pose. Oh yeah, you're going down. Yeah, I like how he threatens you. You're going, you're going down. down! Yeah, I thought that was pretty cool. <laughs> no other Robot Master did, or Maverick has ever done that, that I've ever seen. They stay with their original pose that they do in the intro screen. But he went the extra ball and said, no, you're going down! <laughs> <laughs> he got mad sitting there waiting all that time. Yeah. About time you're here. Yeah, really. <laughs> well, I'll tell you, enemies stop killing me. <laughs> okay, I'm get a sub tank right here. Now, notice I'm, uh, you'll notice that throughout this LP, I'm getting more power ups and stuff without actually showing it because I don't want to waste time by grinding in this LP. Oh, I see. So I cut all the, a lot of the grinding out. Cheater. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's just game genie codes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, see, this is the actual speed run with, uh, like, the title of the screen that the video was a uh, speed run with all the weapons. Then you know, I would have to leave all that in there to prove that I really did it. It's a speed run without the speed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Our 100% run. All, all weapons run, including the Hodokin. Hadouken! And I honestly don't know how to get the Hodokin, so... And I'm not gonna do that here. I think yeah, I've seen a couple of times. Yeah, yeah. It's something like that, where, like, even the speedrunners can't get it without dying. Yeah. And I don't understand why they made it that way. I mean, it's... Like, how did somebody figure that out? Like, was it... Did it have to come down to, like, Nintendo Power, or...? Yeah, I, found, I first found out Nintendo Power. Yeah. Okay, now here's Boomer Quanga stage, and as a friend of mine told me a long time ago while we were playing this game, this game makes me want to work. I mean, this this song makes me want to work. <laughs> work it, work it, push it, yeah, this, push it. This song makes me want to. When I think of this song, I think of two construction workers, one one on each side of a rock, hitting it with a sledgehammer. <laughs> dun, 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 ding, dun, 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 dun. Yeah, it's like that old eighty song. Let's get physical. Yeah. This makes me think of uh, William Regal's Titan Tron. We we had that uh he's a man gimmick. Oh okay, yeah. <laughs> oh man, that's a bad image. Yeah. <laughs> so I don't know what a quanger is. I guess boomer means because he has like boomerang weapons and a quanger, I is that some sort of animal or it's what? Gotta be something Australian. <laughs> yeah. Quanga mate. Uh, uh, boomer Faustus. Yeah, that's a robot master name. I think actually there's there's a, there's a Maverick in X4 named Split Mushroom. Oh man, and that's gonna give me a splitting headache just thinking about it because it's so stupid. I mean, Plant Man and Dust Man and Char and Charge Man's better than that. Come on, Split Mushroom. Just another example of uh, Capcom run running out of ideas. Yeah, they not a milk a franchise of death. They somehow, but they can still manage to stay in business, though. I mean, at least they're, at least the games that they make 
20 times over again, or 20,000 sequels to, at least they're still playable. Yeah, and they had a good idea in Mega Man 6 where, you know, they, they let, like, kids choose the couple of the names or whatever, yeah. designs and all that. I wonder why they didn't try to do that again. I mean... I don't know. I mean, it's not like it failed or anything. Winter Man and Nightman were good concepts, and, and I think Capcom right. designed the stages, not the... Yeah, well, yeah, the, I mean, probably just, it, they, you know, like, drew a little shitty cartoon of what it should look like, and Capcom was like, um, okay, we're not going to use that, but... Thanks for the name. Yeah. <laughs> now you saw the heart container over there a little bit. Um, I'm going to later on. Oh, I'm surprised I didn't cr get crushed and die right there. Um, I'm going to get the uh, super X Buster that I didn't get to get the last time I was in Flame Mammoth stage. So that oh, okay. I can charge up the ice weapon, the chill penguins weapon, and then ride over there and then hurry up and jump up there and get the heart container. So more, more invisible grinding. Yeah. <laughs> Now, I did a shut up and play of this game a long time ago. I think I showed, I don't know if I sh showed, recorded the grinding also. Actually, I did in Sigma stage, last stage, I know that. It took me a long, I filled up on sub tanks before fighting Sigma. And that took a long time, someone posted a comment about it. I'm like, yeah, I know. But well, anyway, once you get to Haldukin, it's all over. <laughs> yeah. Alright, here's a boss battle with Boomer Quangers. Freaking easy, all you gotta do. Is just do this. Right. Pretty much climb the wall and then, yeah. But if you're trying to fight him with the regular gun, he is annoying. Yeah, I was going to say that. Extra um, annoying. Oh. You fight any of these robot masters, except like Flame Mammoth and Shield Penguin, it's freaking right. easy. Or uh, but, even Storm Eagle. Yeah, Storm Eagle, but I think the rest is hard with, with just the regular X Buster. Yeah, damn near impossible. Like, people can do it, but, you know. Takes yeah. a lot of practice. Yeah. Takes a lot of something Skip would say. <laughs> a lot of intestinal fortitude. There we go. Sounds good enough. Uh, JR would say that, not Skip. <laughs> Alright, well, now we get the boomerang cutter. Boomerang cutter. There's the emo cutty. there's the emo emo man weapon. Yeah. <laughs> <Risk cutter. laughs> Alright, real quickly I quickly quickly Whoa. real quickly I'm going ahead and uh get the super X Buster. Wow, that was wild. Yeah, I just want to show this real quick, just to, because it's cool, I guess. This oh, is what I messed cool. up earlier in Flame Mammoth stage. I think it was part two. I didn't get to get it because I messed up. So yeah, and then here it is. ECW. All right, let's escape out of here and go to part five. Yep, we'll escape out of this video. Yeah. <laughs> but then, God bless and take care. See ya. Peace. Welcome to part... I think it's part five. I'm not sure. Uh, This is Ron Moore along with Venom22. I love this game. If it was a woman, I would make sweet, make sweet love to it. Sweet, passionate love. Yeah, this game is truly ECW. And here's the ECW Maverick with the ECW stage with the ECW music. Sting Chameleon. And it looks like a 16-bit version of Woodman stage. If, if Mega Man 2 was remade to a 16-bit version, this is probably what Woodman stage probably looked like. Yeah, I remember this, first, this game first came out, man. I was just playing just the hell out of it. It's an awesome game. It's got many secrets, like this, this part right here. You can come up here and get the capsule to fight this boss right here. So this game's pretty much pretty fun. A lot of secrets and uh, a lot of replay value. I never get tired of playing it. I saw Nintendo Power magazine a long time ago, probably about six months to a year before this game is supposed to be released. This boss right here, you fight in the highway stage at the beginning, but I guess they just changed, sh scrapped that. Yeah, it's probably like the beta version. I mean, they just like put it in there, but you know, there's always last minute changes how they want to do things. I mean, this boss is pretty easy. I mean, if, with the tornado weapon, you just keep doing that over and over. You know, just uh, don't stay too close to him or use that little claw thing he has. And his nipples are red. Yeah, red. Really? <laughs> what the heck is up with that? <laughs> well, this is actually my first time trying this strategy right here. I thought it'd be quicker, but it don't seem to be working as fast as the X-Busters seem like. Maybe it's just me. Well, it's a little bit safer. I think I used to use the fire on him. It's just been a while since I've played this. I think it was the fire or just regular... Charged Mega Buster. I forgot. It's been a while, like I said. Okay, now it's starting to show weakness. 
I forget this. I'm gonna go with what I'm used to. I think Mega Master Yo Hadouken every time every time he powers up his uh, Mega Buster. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. It looks like a Hadouken right there. And I don't know. I'm not, I know there's a way to get the actual Hadouken in this game, but I don't remember how. I know you do it in Armor and Armadillo stage. Do you remember how to do that? Uh, you gotta play the stage. I think about like five times. Uh, you gotta keep doing certain things. Uh, I don't remember. I think it was like you have to have like full sub tanks and reach all the way to the end with like full life. And you jump on that one top cliff. Then when you get when you get up there, I think you quit the stage and do it again. I think like on the fourth or fifth time, like there was a capsule with a duke in. And like I said, it's been a long time, so I forgot. But it's pretty cool how they added that. Even on next two, they get they got like the Shoryuken like hidden in there. Yeah, that's a weird way to get it. You complete the stage five times and stuff, but but it's really worth getting. Well, yeah, it pretty much kills any balls I can want to hit. And uh, here's the music, epic music with Dr. Light. It's kind of weird, though, how he just has capsules, like, back in the... Like, he died already, and he's got capsules in the future, like, conveniently placed just for Mega Man. Kind of dumb, but, you know, funny at the same time. Yeah, Rudy. Um, and now I got the, uh, was it, I think it's called Super Armor? Yeah, I think, what, it just reduces damage or something? I don't know. Anyway, yeah, here's where you can get the Hardy, like, dash up there and get that. Yeah, it's a, like a super armor. You reduce like damage by, I don't know, fifty percent, or I forgot. We didn't even pay attention to what he was telling us. It's like blah blah. blah. Yeah, yeah. Just give this up, great. Oh, you know, he talks too much. Nobody likes to listen to old men talk. I mean, half the time it's usually nonsense anyway. Yeah, he would talk a lot in part two where he goes, "You got so and so." Flash, flash, flash. Screen flashes. Epileptic seizures. I, I don't want to complete. Ready or whatever. He's <laughs> like, hurry up. And this part right here, if he didn't beat that that. Um, robot at the top to get the armor thing all these rocks will be he'll be jumping up and down on all the rocks will be falling on your head and everything yeah this is a pretty cool stage was that Woody Woodpecker out there that's his dad and his mom and his cousin but yeah I mean the graphics in this game are you know pretty cool I mean big upgrade from the old 8-bit version of course this is 16-bit but man I remember man I love this game so much every time I play it I'm just like I think I cry a little bit you know I don't know why. And uh, he's got vents on his nip for nipples on here. Yeah, I remember having a dream about this game before it came out. I was like, oh man, I gotta freaking get this game so bad. I mean, Mega Man on Super Nintendo? I mean, that's gonna be freaking awesome. Yeah, I remember uh, uh, when I had Nintendo Power and the poster for this game came out, man. I used to just, just sit in front of the poster and just masturbate. I mean, this, this game was just, man. You have a masturbate right now, hold on. Oh, man, watch out, man. Okay, anyway, uh... You owe that for me, hold on. <laughs> now, I remember when I first played this game, I lost the Nintendo Power Magazine, so I didn't know, like, what order to fight the Mavericks in. So, I would fight some of these Mavericks out of order, including this one. I would get my butt kicked. But now, I mean, when I first played this game, it's freaking hard. Now, it's like, pfft, freaking easy. Yeah, it's it's pretty... I forgot the order, too, but usually what I like to do is just go to uh, Chill Penguin stage first just to get the upgrade. Then I always get all the upgrades first, and I go back and just beat everybody. But I just like playing this game so much that I do that. So, you know, I don't know. But yeah, he's pretty easy. You just keep throwing the the boomerangs and uh, hitting them in the penis like there. Yeah, and the boss battle music is freaking awesome. Yeah, you neutered that guy. <laughs> And now I've obtained the, uh, yeah, I've obtained the, uh, Sting, Stinger? I forgot. It's the Chameleon Sting. It's like herpes, only that is bad. Hey, I was right, it is a Chameleon Sting, I was just guessing. Yeah, so that stage is pretty awesome, and, um, that's the end of part five. We'll see you guys in part six. God bless and take care. Uh, yeah. Welcome to part six of Mega Man X. This is Ron Moore, along with the Unknown, Venom 22, and Archangel Zero. What up, what up? My name is Zero. My name is Zero, dude. Ugh. Finally at Sigma's Fortress. His name is Sigma. Look at him. Oh my god, he's got a nipple on his forehead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mega Man, you gotta do all the work for me when I go over here and smoke a blunt. Uh, yeah. 
Yeah, what's with Zero's long surfer here? That guy's lazy as hell. Nah, but he's he's a powerful Reploid, or whatever you call him. He's got green nipples. <laughs> yeah, that is true. <laughs> I think Mega Man's really a girl. I think Zero's really a girl. Might be. I'd bang a robot chick girl. Robot <laughs> chick <laughs> This stage, this stage is pretty hard. Awesome music in the stage, though. The music in this game is just so epic. I get a boner every time I hear it. Yeah, it's pretty ECW. Look at Mega Man X thing, y'all badass. I bet you can't take out the Terminator. <laughs> oh, blah, 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 blah. oh, almost died right there. I'm gonna get invisible for a minute with the st uh, Sting Chameleon, whatever it's called. I think uh, I think Wally could take him out. Hey, who the heck is Wally? Shut up. <laughs> He's got the touch. He's got the power. You got the touch. You got the power. I think Mega Man's actually Optimus Prime. He's Optimus Prime in his prime. <laughs> hey, yeah. Nah, uh, that's uh, that's uh, Robocop's baby. <laughs> I think this is like the longest stage in Sigma's Fortress. Which the whole fortress is pretty short, by the way. <coughs> Wait, hold on. <coughs> I think Mega Man's mom was uh, a robot. <laughs> okay, what makes you think that? Mega Man, I got him, dude. This guy's pink. I I got, I, I got this guy. <laughs> I think Mega Man's mom is filled with BP, that uh, British Petroleum. Mega Man's mom's got a big vagina. <laughs> I think uh, Zero's got a big mullet. <laughs> I remember there was a time when I actually wanted to grow my hair like Zero, but I just couldn't do it. His hair is epic. And now Val here, he pretty much pwned Zero right here. Say, Mega Man, he's got me, dude. I can't do anything. I'm in this capsule with the rape all over me. Rape? <laughs> 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 so dirty. And now right here, just like in the beginning of the game, you can't beat Vile, so you might as well just stay here and get pwned. Nah, man. He, nah, man. You gotta fight to the death. What are you doing? Parry it. Parry it. Parry it. Parry it. Parry it. Parry it. Shoot him in the nipple. <laughs> now nah, I'm, I'm just gonna lie down and take the punishment. Oh! Just like most girls. <laughs> there I get Bob by, by, by by Val again. I find a generic Robocop. Say, like, dude, I'm gonna come on his back. Oh my god, and there's an explosion. Did you say explosion? That's pretty cool. Bob's a pretty cool boss. He's been on this game and also on, uh, I think he was a boss on Mega Man X3, like a, like a hidden boss. Yeah, he was in X3. I think you gotta find him in, uh, was it Crush Crawfish's stage? Now, on that stage, and I think he was like a hidden boss on another stage. You're gonna get like some kind of unlockable. I haven't played this game in forever, so I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. Now here's where the real fight begins, where you can actually kill him. He's got cool pants. <laughs> I think those are uh, spandex with armor. Pants of the future. I'm use the hormo tor hor the hormo torpedoes right here, whatever. <laughs> yeah, use the hormo torpedoes. But anyway, pretty much in the future, everybody's gonna wear spandex because homo is like a regular thing in the future. Yeah, it's pretty easy here with the homo uh, homo <laughs> to <laughs> torpedoes. <laughs> Mega Man <-aid. laughs> I think this game takes place in San Francisco. What? Like zero. 
Mega Man, I can't find the ha lower half of my body. What's going on? Yeah, he's got a bunch of slobber on the side of his uh, uh, mouth. <laughs> like, why am I drooling Kool-Aid? I can't... Where's my legs at? Oh, my legs. <laughs> <laughs> I need a rabies shot, dude. Why oh, just fades away? What the heck? Like, before I fade away, I'll give you my Mega Buster thing. Oh, look out! Whoa! Oh, he seed up. It's not the earth strike. <laughs> I parried all that. All right, let me use my chameleon sting right here to be temporary invincible to get past this part more easily. Why are you so lazy? You always want to pass pass everything so easily. Because I'm smart, not lazy. Because you're, you're white and lazy. White and lazy. White and lazy. Oh, we get up there. Mega Man uh, shoots and jumps like a girl. That was that was, that was dumb. Uh, <laughs> now, throughout this fortress, you fight the Mavericks again. Here's the first one for this stage. Here's Boomer Mexican. <laughs> well, no, well, the first one for this fortress. This is the only Maverick you fight again in this in this stage. Boomer Quangers stage music makes me want to work. Just keep you shooting with the homo missiles. <laughs> yeah. He looks like a retired matador. <laughs> yeah. I like how the Mavericks blow up in this game. He said blow. <laughs> I why Mega Man has blue uh blue suit is because he has blue balls. He's uh he's Mega Man. <laughs> Now I get ready to fight the uh, boss of the stage. If I can get past all these, Mewtwo is pwning me. Man, you suck, man. You should let me play this game. Every time I play this game, I like make it look easy. You went all fucked up. All right, so here we go. Finally, the first boss of Sigma's Fortress. You gotta fight Spider-Man. Yeah, this boss was so hard to me when I was a kid. I don't really know the right weakness. I just use Mega Buster. Hey, you gotta use the ice, the ice uh, thingy. The ice thing takes off the most damage. Oh yeah, sure. I forgot about that, but oh well, it's pre-recorded. Too late. You gotta use zero the ninja. Zero the ninja. He does have a lightsaber or something, don't he? Yeah, that's all about uh, X3. You can actually use zero. He's pretty badass. Uh, he's badass. Man, Proto Man's better. Actually, Zero's badass. He can use them all. Uh, Tatsunoko versus Capcom on the Wii. They just show how they just show how badass he is. He's bad, but he's uh he's blue. <laughs> like a uh, Zero on SVC Chaos. I mean, they made him look like off the Game Boy, but he's still badass. Nah, man, Zero on SVC Chaos is like a gay Zero with diapers on. <laughs> Those are man diapers. But zero is not a zero in life. Yeah, watch out for the spiders. Why aren't you using the ice yet? Because this is pre-recorded. I can't stop and do this and use the ice. We'll just record it all over again. All right, let's stop the video right here. It'll be a part two of this. No. Uh... Why is the music so epic? I don't know why. At least I'm not being lazy this time. At least I'm fighting like a real man. Even though I'm about to die. But wait a minute! Oh, you suck. What are you going to use your sub tanks for? You... Maybe my little sister uses sub tanks. What's wrong with you? Oh, that's who trained me. Ugh. I think if you look at his eye, whichever eye is open, that's the direction he's going to go to. No, nah, never mind. Fail. You gotta use your dash more. I don't see you dash at all. That's because I'm not lazy. I just do things like a man. But dashing it, it requires effort, so that means you're. you're shut up. <laughs> so dashing through the snow and the one horse. <laughs> she uses Mega Buster like a Hunger Buster. 
Man, I got him right there. Man. Finally. Good chirp. That's the end of part six. We'll see you guys in part seven. God bless and take care. I uh, yeah, just uh, make sure I wipe, wipe good. Welcome to part seven, Ete, or how do we say seven in Spanish? This is Ron Moore, along with We Got Three Hundred Nine and J Man Four Six Two Four One. Hey yo, I think it's like uh, seven O or something. Yes, <laughs> dummies. I, th I thought there was six. Say fail. Anyway. Well, yes, yeah, there we go. I got it. Part seven of Mega Man X, and we are in Sigma Fortress Stage Two. What those? We're Sigma Fortress Stage Two. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. Cool. It's cool. Speaking of cool, show up one again. This time, I'm going to use the Fire W. Fire Wave, I think, is what it stands for. Yeah. Firewall. <laughs> Firewall, yeah. <laughs> that, that should have been a uh, Sheepman's, I guess, weapon. You got Firewall, his like, computer type boss, or maybe Cyber Peacock's weapon from X4. You got herded. <laughs> you got Hut. XP yeah. Man. The Big Hurt. Who was the Big Hurt? What baseball player was that? Um, Jimi Hendrix, please. No. No. <laughs> what? I'm just oh, kidding. I'm just effing around. Okay. Could that be a baseball player? Could be. Uh, I think it was uh, Bo Jackson. I don't know. Um, Jose Cansego? No. I think he's a black guy. Uh, but that's racist. What's well, yeah. got to be black? Yeah, exactly. What's up with that? Yeah. Ooh. Okay, we got a Castlevania background. You got the guys from Boy, the original... turning into Mecha. Those the guys from the original Mega Man. Guts Man stage. The hammer throwing guys. Yeah. Yeah, the pick guys. Uh, uh, bear man. Bear man. Or Gus man. <laughs> no, I'm saying how this is turning into Mecha man. Ha <laughs> ha. Boo. Oh, shut up. <laughs> I love Mecha man. man. It's Mecha man. Come on. Like, even the video got quiet when you said that. <laughs> <laughs> it, like, paused. The game paused, like, um, fail. At least I talked. Oh, shut up. Shut up, Bear. <laughs> At least talk more, Mark. Views, Jay? Congratulations, well, Jay. I... Have 5,000 subscribers now. Right. <laughs> He's still freaking what? out. <laughs> <laughs> Someone hacked What's me. Going up? Someone hacked me. Alright. Storm Eagle again. Gonna use the uh, Storm Tornado. I mean, uh, Chameleon Sting. Storm Tornado. That's what he has. Idiot. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> oh! Wow. Please refrain from of, running uh, directly into him. <laughs> yeah, really. Reminds me of Judas Priest screaming for vengeance, like the album cover with it. Like that, you know, Mecha Eagle's like, <laughs> or he's going up, but like, yeah. Evan, yeah. <laughs> and the game got quiet again. So, <laughs> shut up. Yeah. The Storm Eagle set the structure because yeah. you thought that joke was so we couldn't stand it. Quit talking Judas about Mecha, Priest. I'll kill myself. <laughs> How about you, this place, man? How man, about you God. just shut up? Oh. How about I'm trying to be funny? It's not working. Try hard. You fail at being funny. At least I'm being funny. I mean, at least I'm making jokes, J Man. <laughs> at least I'm making funny. Oh, I, I guess you got me there. You got home. So you get me this drunk. time. Wait, oh, where are we? Are we Dr. Dude. Wiley? No, um, we're at some machine. Some eye, eye guy. Oh, it's like, oh, it's in Mega Man X, is this like the Dr. Wily stages, sort of? Except it's yeah, not Dr. Yeah, Wily. Except this is Sigma's Fortress. Sigma! That's what I mean, yeah, Here we go, Sigma's Fortress. Oh. <laughs> yeah, down. Oh, I wish it was Skull Castle. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is more like a Sigma Castle, I don't know. <laughs> you, know you know, you see what the fortress looks like. This is like it's a Mega Man 1. This is Castle of Fortress. <laughs> well, they did show it in Mega Man 2. Yeah. Well, you know, Mega Man 1 is like the hybrid of the Mega Man series. It gets it started and stuff. Uh, I was oh, going to say, man. watch out for the spikes. 
Dang, I just wasted my sub tank. I forgot the spikes to kill you. Because I fell down the spikes, but I was. That's because I got hit. Yeah. So it's temporary. Yeah, invincible. invincibility. Yeah. I'm invincible! Uh oh. <laughs> you will shoot your eye out. You will shoot your eye out. <laughs> this is like I want to be the guy. <laughs> I want to be the wee guy. Oh, oh not again. <laughs> Dang, I slid too far down. I forgot about the spikes. How stupid are you? Yeah! That depth looks like the one in Super Spy Hunter. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, that ripped off the Mega Man depth. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna Except say with, that. in Super Spy Hunter, it's more exaggerated. Yeah, it's like triple Mega Man depth. Yeah, I know. Check that out, check out Let's Try Super Spy Hunter on J-Man's channel, Jameis Plug. Yes. <laughs> okay, uh, round three, <laughs> a fail. Really? I thought this was Mega Man X. <laughs> no, it's called Fail. It's called Fail uh, X. Fail Pawn? Fail X. <laughs> Felix? Yeah, Felix the cat. Uh, oh. <laughs> oh, come oh, on. Oh, that hit. That was whack. Oh, come on. You'd hit that. Yeah. You better. <laughs> That's what he said. Oh, oh no! It's a big set. Oh! Grr! It got invincibility. Uh oh. Come on. Ah. Come on. Yeah. Yes. And no spikes. <laughs> Right. No, you're wrong. They came back up right yeah. there. <laughs> what did I do wrong? It, it, it's a glitch in the game. You can't like control yourself after you win. So like you just automatically fall down right there. <laughs> yeah, it's like an action 52 game. Yeah. You won, but did you? Did you really? <laughs> no. Ah, Sigma. Yeah. See, I hate that. You have to select it again. Why don't just take it to the next stage? Why do you have to select it again? Yeah. I know in the Mega Man games it plays the music, dun, 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 right. dun, dun, but at least you have to select it again. Yeah, yeah. I guess, oh, just in case you want to go back and get the power-ups, I guess. Yeah, maybe, but, you know, still. I think by the time you get to, you know, to the other stages, it's too late. You should just keep going. Yeah. I find finding armor and armadillo again. This time, no dancing music. Yeah, awesome. Sweet. As we, as we hear, J-Man's uh, computer fan, I think. No. Ooh. Here's, here's, something, here's something rattling. Start over. Time out. Stop the call. No. <laughs> <laughs> we can't have that. Yeah, no timeouts. Oh, Probably the coolest Maverick. Steve Chameleon. Oh yeah. He's this cool. Long intro. Hurry up. Almost as long as Will Gator from X2. Use the butt hurt cutter. Oh, ah. Oh. Watch out for the spikes. Holy oh. spikes. Give me a tongue lashing. Boo, get off the stage. Oh. <laughs> Perfectly Listen. easy right here, once you figure out I the know. strategy. But when I first fought him, you know, when you first play this game, you don't know what order to go into, what strategy. That's when the game becomes freaking hard, but once you beat it 10,000 times over the past 10, 15 years, it's freaking easy. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's one, well, it's one of those games that once you learn it, it's easy, but games like Metroid, to me, no matter how many times you play it, it's still freaking hard. Uh oh, it's a maze. Now, this is your FCE 100. Yeah, right. Well, then you just then uh, you just quit and you leave YouTube. So. Whoa, whoa. Well, well it's true. FCE you alone. <laughs> He's cool. Well, he was cool like a year ago. Last time we talked to him. <laughs> that means not a cool person now. The boss here is cool, because he's chilled. Ha. Uh, uh, damn it. God damn it. <laughs> Fail. I gotta stop those he, pun jokes. He needs to jiggles. chill out. He, took he needs a chill to take pill. a chill pill. <laughs> <laughs> I said it first. Dr. Pepsi. Oh. No! Dr. Pepper. <laughs> no, pizza. Dr. Pizza, Dr. Pepper. Yeah, you're a drink uh, pizza's Dr. burning, we got. There's a drink called Dr. Pizza. It's nasty. Well, yeah, it's it sounds gross. A pizza drink? That's awesome. Oh man, you lied to me. There are pizza Give chips, though. It's stupid. Oh yeah, pizza chips. Yeah, pizza chips are pretty good. 
Alright, here we, here we go with the uh, non-verbal trash talking. You're uh, going topic. down. Wait! Okay. <laughs> I did that. Okay, I want to try what Venom told me to try here. Use the, uh, no, not that, you idiot. The boomerang cutter. To see if you, uh, cut off his tentacles. Testicles. Uh, whatever. <laughs> Hold on. There we Wow. Oh, yeah, it works. I did not know about that. Now we can't use the, uh, now we can't use the sucking power. That sure sucks. <laughs> oh, well, dang it, I think it's easier the way it works. Yeah, I was gonna say, he's, uh, yeah, bombarding you now. Yeah. That's what you get for not listening to him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's why it's called Venom, he's, yeah. he has a poisonous, uh, Poison personality. Bell. Bell. Poison. <laughs> But he did not poison this playthrough. That's right. So we'll see you guys in part ocho. God bless and take care. Bye-bye. See ya. Welcome to part 8 of Let's Play Mega Man X. This is Ron Moore, along with We Got 309 and Jman46241. Hi. Hi. This is stage 3, where I'm still fighting all the Mavericks. Go Mavericks. Wait. Dallas no. Mavericks. Yeah, find the Dallas Mavericks. Yeah, that should like be that. easy. Ooh! <laughs> Almost fell on the spikes. Oh, watch out there. Alright, and... Yes, got the extra man. Ouch. X. You'll need it. Oh, yeah. no, wait, you have eight of them. Yeah. Don't hurt for It seems too work. easy. Well, yeah, it's easy now, but when you first play it, it's hard. We first getting used to it and stuff. Of course, every Mega Man game you play first time is hard. All right, here's Big Fan Vader. I mean, Flame Mammoth. Lame. <laughs> well, you don't you don't watch old school wrestling. You don't know anything about old school wrestling, so shut up. You get no points for oh, reference. I don't even like wrestling. Well, that's because oh. you're that's because you're smart. Because uh, now it's <laughs> okay. uh, yeah, fake and gay. Yeah. Well, I was not gay, but it's fake. I actually want to say fake, fake is choreographed. Saying fake is disrespectful. Okay, fake and homosexual. Is that better? <laughs> Not <laughs> really. Sexual. Okay. Untrue and heterosexual. No, wait. Right. Never mind. Sliding to victory. <laughs> All right. That's the last map. Right now, we fight the boss of the stage. The boss. The boss. You fight some sort of possessed car. Whoa! I think we're fighting we got here. <laughs> yeah, nice uh, sim uh, similarity to me well, in this thing. Well, look at you. Ooh, oh, chomp. Look at you. <laughs> I got pwn right there. I don't know what weakness oh. to use. I forgot. The homo miss hormo hormel <laughs> missiles. Hormone <laughs> missile. <laughs> homo missiles. Is it the rolling shield, the rolling rock, whatever? Oh. I know, this thing is bare because you have to use the homo missiles. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> oh, God. Forget it, I'm just using the X-Buster. I'm out. Oh! Oh! Ooh. Ow! Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> Remember when I first fought this thing, man, I'm get pwned. Ouch! I'm gonna get pwned now. Oh! Oh! There we go. Om nom nom. <laughs> I don't get that reference. What was that? Like uh, someone eating something? Yeah, yeah. it's like the, uh, the pizza rolls guy. Oh, yeah, uh, JC Heard. Yeah, whatever his name was. Oh, yeah. No, you gave out his private information on YouTube. He mentioned his name in the video, you idiot. <laughs> whatever, it was the, the, it's still real to me guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh. That's hit and run. Well, not, actually, not run, he's still there. <laughs> hit and stay. I'm gonna hit the Adoken, you idiot! Oh! Uh, one oh, more hit! Scott, come on, don't die! One more shot! Yes! Final death shot. Final no, destination. Sucks. No, it's not really. <laughs> I like the first two. Well, well, the next stage, okay. well, the next stage is the final destination in this game. Ha. Huh. <laughs> Write down the password. Oh, you're not ready. Oh, that was a password with those things? Numbers? Yeah. We don't need don't no damn that. password. <laughs> we have safe states. We don't, we don't need no education. Well, you're a sissy if you're using safe states, J-Man. Sissy. Whatever uh, 
round, sissy. <laughs> Real man, Joe, you save states. Rough cut. Yeah, I yeah. did a rough cut because right here yep. is where I was grinding for sub tanks. So I'm going to need them. Yeah. Wow, it's so cool. Oh, good. There's oh, Sigma's no. pet dog. I guess it's Treble? No. Ah, uh, Darth Sigma. I first seen Sigma, I'm like, I thought he's bigger than that. And that's what she said. <laughs> Thank you, Steve Carell. <laughs> yeah, Michael Scott. No, his name is Steve Carell in real life. It's not Michael Scott. Where'd you get that from? I'm talking about his character in oh. the office, because just little jokes on it. Hey, doggy. Oh, hi, doggy. All right, use the uh, Super Ice, whatever the S stands for, I forgot. Yeah. And he's using the Mega Man 2 move where the dogs shoot far at you. And then dogs will shoot bees in yep. their mouth and the cars will shoot bees at you. Use your freeze power. Yeah. He's not freezing, but it does damage though. Oh. Yeah. Oh. You killed my dog! Got it in the ass. Had to die. You killed my dog, X! I have no arms! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. What is with these villains and over yeah. and their over exaggerated cape sizes? Oh, there we go. <laughs> uh, I did the inbox oh. thing. Yeah, and we got to fight a uh, Darth, Darth Vader unmasked. Darth Sigma. Yeah. Really. Oh. What? What? Oh, what? Oh, okay. what? This music so does not suck. Yeah, really, it's like a mosh pit music. <laughs> Pretty nice music, though. Go, go. It's kind of like uh, Fester's Quest boss music. A little bit. Except it's not 8-bit. I, I don't want to reference that story game. <laughs> hey, there's some good music in that game. Yeah. Well, I don't know. I couldn't hear it because we got kept talking about it a lot. Well, at least I could be able to play through the game and do it. Yeah, because you can not do it saying, the best. not saying a lot, though. not saying it's, a lot. Yeah. I mean, we have lives. So we don't play sorry games. It is a difficult game. It's a game nonetheless. You beat it no matter what and how hard or easy it is or anything. You play it to play it and dominate it! Okay, well, play Action 52 to play it. No. <laughs> Well, that's a different story. I mean, everything about that sucks. Yeah. <laughs> well, at least Fester's Quest does work. Yes, it does. And it is made by Finally! Sigma. Finally, the Rock has defeated Sigma! Yeah, Rockman. And his head magically <laughs> floats to the top. Uh... As we fight the final boss in Ghouls and Ghosts? <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> Without his legs? <laughs> yeah. Oh, my legs. <laughs> Alright, ouch. Ooh. Yeah, Rolling Rock, I, I think this is the best weapon to use. This one I've, I've always used. It's a 2D and I to use a uh, sub tank. Yeah, I always need all three or four sub tanks. Ah, oh, especially right there when I get flamed. When you get fired. Yeah. When you get flamed. No, I mean, it's like one of the hardest bosses to me to this day in, in video games. <laughs> Well, I'm sure he's pretty difficult, but come on, the hardest final boss. I didn't say he's the hardest, I said he's the hardest to me. One of the hardest to me. He's one of the Hard hardest to me! Harder than, uh, Silver Surfer. Games. Well, again, I play cool games, so... That game's cool, man. Tim Foley did the music. <laughs> that means the music that may be cool. cool. The music may be cool, not the game. Let's see. You and your painting of games that aren't actually really bad, you hater. I will never forgive you. <laughs> <laughs> the game is good and you're gonna have to deal with it. What? Yeah, that's right. You listen to what I say. Listen to what I say! Listen to what I say! Oh, well, almost got, got him now. Him. Right here, I was at the point to where I, I don't look at the, his energy bar. I'm so concentrated on not getting hit by the fire and stuff. One more hit. You can oh do it! God! It's over! Nothing is over! Nothing! 
He don't just turn off. It's not possible. I'm a rip lord. I can't be destroyed by you. Why, X? Might be just us. For the lols. We have the humans. My rip lord brothers. Could have ushered in a new age. Dr. Riley will be back soon. <laughs> And that's it in part eight. We'll be back in part nine for the ending and let's discuss. So God bless and take care. See ya. Bye-bye. Welcome to Let's Discuss Mega Man X. This is Ron Moore along with DeadFan93 and Raven. No, it's Mr. Bastard now. Hey, look, explosions! Boom! I'm only here because he couldn't find anyone else. Well, Raven. Uh, besides him. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, the war has ended for now, and peace has been restored up until, uh, and then like seven more times after that, Sigma returns. Oh, yeah. Just like Dr. Wally, don't know when to die. The war has ended for at least five minutes until we go yeah. back and get McMahon X2. Yeah, and we've seen the beginning of X2. Yeah, it says six months after Sigma destroyed. You know, so I think it takes X2 takes place, you know, six months after that. But in between that time, they're still fighting the Sigma's followers. So the war never really ended. <laughs> mm, I love Capcom, don't you? Yeah, I do. This They know how to milk a fan franchise. If you come out with se um, five sequels to one game on the same system, yeah, it's milking to hell. Okay, this is the part I don't get. Okay, even a robot would get bored just standing there on a cliff looking at words coming up from nowhere. What is this, Star Wars? <laughs> yeah, well, Mega Man's a uh, rip boy now, I think, so he actually has human feelings. So I, mean, he, I think he is tired. He even said it right here in the story, in the ending, he said, Exhausted, X gazes over the cliff. Yeah, maybe his X Buster only knows for sure, because uh, obviously the gun on his frickin' hand is a lot smarter than the robot himself. Yeah, I love the music right here. Awesome ending music. This is my rifle. This is my gun. This is for fighting. This is for fun. Right. Right. <laughs> Get off that rock candy, Raven. Apparently you've never seen Full Metal Jacket. No, I've never seen Empty Rust uh, T-shirt, whatever it's called. <laughs> More awesome ending music during the credit screen as X runs uh, for for his life or runs to find himself. He has the freaking dash boots. Why doesn't he just use those? He, he's exhausted. He's exhausted and yet he'll run down a street. Yeah. <laughs> I like how he goes back to the beginning of the game right here with the ending. Shows the credits at the highway stage level, the intro level. He got his second wind. Yeah. <laughs> wow, I got sunlight real quick. As the game reintroduces the Mavericks as the game lags. I love Storm Eagle. Awesome music. Yeah. You like Storm Eagle's music? I think it kind of pales in comparison to oh, waiting, to real life waiting, Metallica. waiting for him to show up. Uh oh, Unless yeah. Unless he already <laughs> showed up here. There he is. There's that prick, Mark Mandrill. Yeah, he was hard when I first fought him. Boomer Quanger kind of gets in my nerves. His stage music though makes me want to work. <laughs> Vile. What the hell? And Sigma. And Hero. Zero is not a zero in life. Explosion! <laughs> and me as Megman X. Uh, I didn't know I was in this game. <laughs> you? So he's Asian? <laughs> right. <laughs> Capcom knows exactly who you are. Yep. As we listen to this 
drunk music, or whatever type of music it is. Saka, Dewey, Iki, uh, Aka, Iriko. <laughs> Enrique. <laughs> Elf. So sound designer is Elf. So what does that mean? Will Ferrell worked on this game or something? Yeah, I guess so. Yes, he did. <laughs> Professor X. Professor F. So does that stand for for Professor? F? <laughs> <laughs> Cabe. Special thanks to Capcom all staff. I thought that was all the staff you just showed. <laughs> No, they're, by that they mean, like, the custodians and all that shit. Oh, yeah, like, because without you cleaning up the building, we wouldn't be able to make these games. Exactly. Empty my trash can! <laughs> yeah, you gotta empty out the trash can, clean up the windows, and the computer monitors for them to work on these games. But well, dusty computer monitor means you can't see what you're programming, I guess. They invented something for that. It's called a hammer. Right. Yeah. As we see the Street Fighter ending here. Thanks for playing. Presented by Capcom. Uh, wait a minute. What? You have won a temporary victory, X. What you destroyed was only a temporary body. My spirit remains intact. In time, I will find other bodies strong enough to do my bidding. And I will return. I shall see you soon, X. Very soon. Six months. <clears throat> Make my next two. <coughs> <coughs> <Not> yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I have a really bad cough. <coughs> <laughs> okay, so, like, why was Sigma looking two different ways? Like, you can't see he was cross-eyed. His eyes were, like, looking left and right. <laughs> I didn't notice that. But, uh, anyway, Mega Man X for the Super Nintendo. Uh, me and Venom really anticipated this game coming out when we were kids. I remember seeing it in Nintendo Power Magazine. That's when I first heard about it because that was before, like, the internet and stuff. And now when I was subscribed to Nintendo Power and I seen that in there and I was like, whoa, are you kidding me? Mega Man for Super Nintendo? And I seen it. I seen the beta screens for it and, and I would have, like, dreams about it because I wanted to play it so bad. And I finally got to rent it um, at Blockbuster a long time ago around the time it first came out. And I played it all night. I played it from 12 a.m. to 7 a.m., seven hours straight. I played it nonstop until I finally got to Sigma's Fortress, and that's when the game was real hard to me at first. And because I didn't know the right strategies, I lost that magazine, so I didn't know what order to go beat the Mavericks in. And like I said in part one of this Let's Play, the intro stage threw me off because I was like, "Um, isn't this supposed to be the part of the game where it takes me to the Robot Master screen?" And I didn't know them as Mavericks back then or anything, but. And I was like, oh, okay, anyway, uh, Ron, cool music. Ron stage. wasn't anticipating yeah. there being a story. Yeah, what? Well, yeah, to show the story at the beginning of the game. Dr. Light was typing, you know, talking about don't, don't disturb this capsule until 30 years from now. And all of a sudden, take to the intro stage, and, you know, that was something different Capcom put in there. So, uh, yeah, I mean, the music is awesome in this game, and the graphics, the gameplay controls were awesome. Uh, so, yeah, this game is ECW. I give this game a 9.5 out of 10. Raven? Yes, extremely crunchy waffles. Um, I don't know, man. I thought it was total crap. I'd rather play like Majora's Mask or Tic-Tac-Toe. Not really. Um, <laughs> now, I remember when this game came out, like, man, we were in middle school, high school, something yeah. like that. And, I mean, y'all were talking about it. I was probably drunk or something in high school or middle school, yes. Um <laughs> <laughs> no, and then they got me onto it, and I played the hell out of this game. And, I don't know, I'd like to play it again. So what score would you give it? <laughs> Tic-tac-toe. No, I'm just playing. <laughs> I'd give it at least a 7 out of 10. Okay, Jay. Uh, Debt fan? I'm just noticing here on the cover art, Mega Man looks like he's having trouble controlling his buster. Yeah. <laughs> um, I've I've always loved um the early Mega Man X games. I could never really get premature Buster. <laughs> <laughs> I could never get into the X series after X four, whatnot. And the first one isn't exactly my favorite in the series, but I still have to give it a nine. 
Yeah, uh, I stopped getting into us. I didn't really care about the series anymore after X2, really. I mean, X3 was a good game, but I just didn't like X3 as much. Um, but speaking to X2, that will be the next LP on this channel. So until then... Yeah, six months from now. Yeah, six months from now. We have to wait six months. We want the story to be realistic in real time. Mm -hmm. So uh, <laughs> so this is Ron Moore. Yeah, Raven, a.k.a. Mr. Bastard. Stick with that. This is the random teenager who just joined the call. Yeah. <laughs> so until then, God bless and take care and stay tuned for Let's Play Mega Man X2. See you later. Mm. Welcome to Let's Play Mega Man X2 Part 1. This is Ron Moore along with Raven. Mr. Bastard, do you? And so, yeah, finally, we get to do this game. I've, this is my favorite in the whole X series. Who's chasing him? That's like his partner or something. Some generic guy that don't matter at all in the game. Oh, uh, midgets. Right. Anyway, as a story to say right there, and as we said, and then let's discuss Mega Man X. Uh, six months later, this this game takes place. Six months? Didn't it take like two years to come out? No, actually, no. I think it took like a year after X came out. Oh, okay. So six months. All right. Anyway. <laughs> And a cool opening right here in this game has ECW music. Why is he trying to pick up trash? <laughs> pick up trash? Oh well, yeah, he's picking up something right there. Now, um, and in case you haven't figured it out already, it's Mega Man X2. Wait. Okay, yeah, X2. <laughs> Weren't sure there, were you? Yeah. Wait a minute. <laughs> Playing the right game? Uh, did it edit the right footage in here? Um, all right. <laughs> Why do those beams sound like they wouldn't hurt at all? Well, they just heard that one guy, that one robot, he's dead. <laughs> what? <laughs> Yeah, here's the opening stage, the, uh, I think it's the Ripoid Factory. With awesome music. <laughs> you just walked through that explosion. Oh, I guess I'm a robot, so it doesn't really matter. What was that? You're a robot, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Yeah. Ow! Now what? All right, here we go. You ever feel like the walls are closing in on you? No. <laughs> <laughs> this opening stage is a lot shorter than the opening stage in in Mega Man X. As we fight the boss of the stage, Bear Thirteen. Okay, I was trying to figure out what those huge things were. They're like Sentinels or something. Or the X-Men. <laughs> this boss is freaking easy. As you can see. He, he already beat you. What are you talking about? See, he exploded. Just, yeah, it's falling on you now. Right. <laughs> Now, we're getting to more of the storyline here. These are the three, uh, I think, Mavic Hunters. Yeah, Surges, or Sergis, whatever. Vi violin? Or vi violin? Why is Mega Man con continuously running in a bubble? Uh, it's a, a witch, man. They're, t they're getting their, you know, their palms red, and, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You got Agile or Agile, whatever his name is. Who? Agility. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> ah, talk too fast. Slow down. Collection is proceeding as scheduled. However, I talk real slow. I need to hurry up. 
beep, beep, boop, bop, boop. <laughs> Betty boop, what? Beep, boop, bop, bop, beep, bop, boop, bop, robot. Beep, bop, rock, <laughs> beep, bop, rock steady, what? Yes, cowbunga. <laughs> <laughs> All right, finally get to fight some uh, Mavericks here. And I'm going to start with Water Sponge. It's a stupid name, but anyway. How do you combine a robot with a sponge? That's... Yeah. Well, it's sponge, not sponge. Sponge, sponge, same thing. Uh, I guess it is. I don't know. Cool stage, though. and Cool stage, cool music, and the Maverick's not that bad either. And you can get the heart up there. <laughs> Wire, sponge, bob, square butt. Yeah, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is the weather control stage. Yeah, I don't know what those crystal balls do. I, I mean, I guess if you shoot them, they do change the weather. I don't know. I never mess with them. Is it raining? Yeah, it's raining. This is the weather control stage. It changes the weather in this stage changes more than the Texas weather. That's impossible. <laughs> Get the E-tank up there. Ow. <laughs> what the heck? Now it's clear, sunny weather. Yeah, it just shows you're a little accident prone there, right? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> do, 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 do. Is that the kind of music you listen to in the way to work? Um, yeah, sure. Uh, <laughs> what, what, what is, uh, what's the name of that little hip-hop artist? A little doo-doo? <laughs> right. <laughs> okay. What? I'm about to die against these little robots. Does he still explode the same like he did in the old games? Yeah, he does. Awesome. <laughs> I just hope I don't explode right here. You see W. Alright, now we get to Wire Sponge. Sponge uh, SpongeBob Square Ass, yes. <laughs> okay, as he does his little sting entrance. <laughs> this is not the NWO. <laughs> no. <laughs> wire spawn wire spawns not that not that hard, just uh uh I guess decent challenge. Hey, you can see the game lagging right there when he's twirling that thing. I love the boss battle music in this game. Not as good as the first uh, Mega Man X1 uh, boss battle music, though. And he's shooting wires at me, I guess. I don't know. Ow. Pretty much easy pattern. He cannot hit him right there, so you gotta watch out for the lightning that's coming down. What? I should be able to dodge that. I didn't know when he turns yellow. All right, pwned. This time, this time they 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 explode with blue fire now. Did you say pwned? Yeah. Okay. Oh, raffle. <laughs> Lol. Uh, yeah, I don't know anymore. Uh, la mal. All right, now I've acquired <laughs> the strike chain. He's a he's acquired the gay suit. <laughs> All right, so that's in part one. We see you guys in part dos. God bless and take care. Take it easy. Welcome to part dos of Mega Man X Dos. This is Ramor along with we got 
Tres, Zillo, nine, and J Man, cuatro, six, dos, cuatro, uno. Wow. So, yeah, here we go with Bear Gator. I mean, Will Gator. <laughs> Gator O. Gator Raid, what? No. Um, there we go. All right, so this stage reminds me a lot of Rampage. Are you on top of, like, Puff the Magic Dragon right now? No, we're in like a dinosaur tank. A giant dinosaur alligator tank, whatever. Ah. Yeah, it's weird, but yeah, it just reminds me of Rampage. All the buildings in the background and some giant monster tank or monster going through the city, whatever it is. Dude, that's WCW. I mean, ECW? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the music in the stage is weird, but it does fit the stage perfectly. I like it. Yeah, yeah. it's alright. Shut up, you're alright. You're too Yeah, serious. exactly. Sorry. Sorry, I'm a fanboy of this game. Um, ow! I'm not a fanboy getting hit like right there. So, are, were, were those like the reincarnation of Sniper Joes? No, I guess so. Sniper oh, yes. Joes. Now, this is freaking ECW. Forget about the one in X1. Look at this. Oh man, I gotta find nothing. I gotta find some of my own size. It's not fun no more. Leave me alone. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. <laughs> MCW. <laughs> what? MCW, Mega Man Championship Wrestling. <laughs> oh, cool. Yeah. Oh. That is this has this uh MCW right there, the spikes and that thing, and it's cool. Now I missed the heart back there, I can't get it yet. I gotta get a I think an X Buster upgrade, so I'll get that in later parts of this LP. You have to do an edit? Yeah, I do a, a grind edit, a grind quick cut edit, just like I did in the X when I was getting the upgrades. Yeah, it's like uh, Boomerang Joe now. Yeah, really? Oh, they, oh, they should have killed each other. Damn. Yeah, I know, right? They actually didn't touch, so well, whatever. I'm not going to try and put physics or logic into the game, a game, this game. You wanted to see them touch each other? What? <laughs> <laughs> they just didn't touch each other. <laughs> well, touch this. This uh, touch upon this topic. Um, as we get further in Wood Gator stage, can't touch this. Yeah. MC Axe Hammer or whatever it's called. <laughs> we guy hammer. Hammer time. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I think there's a club near my apartment complex called Hammer Time. I'm, I'm not kidding. Sounds like a gay bar. I don't know what it is. I've never been <laughs> Uh, I've never been there. Time to hammer me! <laughs> oh, that, that's not the end of the stage. Yeah. Nope. But my sub tank is full. Sweet. That's pretty ECW. Down here, I think, is the end of the stage. What, I get that four? I didn't need it. <laughs> Ow! Okay, well, now I need it. <laughs> I just love right, how you actually say, Ow! <laughs> here we go You're with the intro, to, uh, the intro to Will Gator. Cool intro part right there. Yeah, it's like Super Metroid. Whoa, it's blood. Ridley Never. stage. Yep. I guess... I don't, know, I don't care if it's artificial blood or what. This is ECW right here. ECW layer. But this battle is kind of boring and repetitive. You're boring and repetitive. <laughs> <laughs> Bear would totally say that if he was here. Yeah. Okay, I just, I just did a quick cut. I cut half the battle. Because it's boring and repetitive. Then speed it up! Speed it up! Or cut that one too, you know? Whatever. Once you, once you shut it up. Well, we've, we've seen all your videos, we guy, and we want to stay away from speed. Well, yeah, really. <laughs> stay all stars. Especially <laughs> all stars in Cave Story, for crying out loud. Hey, check out my channel on that playthrough. Shameless plug. <laughs> <laughs> See, it's the long term side effects. And you use the strike chain as Will Gator's weakness. Oh, watch out, try to do something different there. Strike chain, strike man. Yeah. Now, there's where I'm jumping on the walls like a jackass like this because when he shoots the second wheel, you gotta watch out because right there, he can snatch you up. Yeah. And start oh. shooting you up. <laughs> I got chewed out. No, no that makes me you think. Get why chewed out. Make... You wanna get chewed out by a wheel gator. How stupid are you? Oh, no, yeah, that really? Makes me think. <laughs> they did not create chain man. Like, Ouch! There's, there's no chain man in the, in the Mega Man series. That would be uh, cool. yeah, that's, that's now it's good, coming soon. <laughs> that's a, yeah, thanks. It's big copyrighted. Chain Man. Watch out. And 
ECW. Oh. Whoa! As, as the game freezes for a second. Um, notice that these Mavericks blow up with blue fire instead of the yellow. I think blue fire is more cool. Yeah. I agree. Cool. Get it cool? This is blue. Looks cool fire. Cold. Ah. Oh. Anyway, as Mega Man picks up more trash, you get... You got, um, Sailor Moon. Yeah, spill. <laughs> Sailor <laughs> Moon. <laughs> oh, man. Moon Man. Sailor Man. <laughs> Sailor Man. Oh, man. Okay, now we take a look at the X-Hunters again, or whatever they're called. Agile. Agile. Yeah, Agile. That's not. That's the we got one. We got on the left. Bear Sir in the middle. No, Bear Sir on the Gis. right. Serges. Yeah. Yeah, Sergeys. Sergeys, I think. Sergeys. As they look through the Power Ranger portal of uh, Crystal Ball thing. Does look like a Crystal Ball. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. All right, here's the, here's the first time we take a look at Doctor Kane, Mega Man's new boss. Doctor Kane. Yep, Doctor Kane taking over Doctor Light's work. Looks like the Gordon's fisherman. <laughs> <laughs> What's my fish sticks? Yeah. <laughs> and right here, the uh, Maverick Jesus. Hunters are... Not Maverick Hunters, the uh, X-Hunters. I think it's what they're called, actually. X-Hunters are telling Mega Man and Dr. Kane that they have Zero's parts. So, okay, Dr. wait a minute. Is this like Castlevania 2, where you have to get the parts of Dracula and then put them back together? Yeah, you have to possess his parts. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, kind of. Except you only get three parts, and you don't have to do it in this game. Uh, you, don't have to, you don't have to get Zero's parts. But it's pretty ECW if you do. You get, like, an Xbox achievement. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, wait. <laughs> uh, story, story, story. Can we just go to gameplay? Isn't that what Mega Man's all about? No, it's all about the story also. I mean, you gotta know what the heck's going on in this world. You have yeah, to just... have the slow-moving text. You have yeah. to. Move there. All right, now one of those X hunters landed in Overdrive also stage, the desert base, and that's where I want to go next anyway. Me, me. More like os, <laughs> os rich. Yeah. Well, the better LSD. than better than sheep man, right, Jamie? <laughs> exactly. And just Pump man. man. And uh, strike man. And oh yeah. Plant man. How about one strike and you're out right there? Because that name was terrible. <laughs> one strike game. And I use the, wheel, the spin wheel here to get to the battle with one of the X hunters, Violin. Violin. And not Violin. violin not Violin. 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 What's the difference? Uh, I spell different, and he's violent, so I don't know. He's the difference. I mean, violin is yeah. spelled the same way, just like that. Violin. No, it's, it's not just with like... an I. It's Robo Bear. No. No, Whatever. violin spelled with an I. B I O L I N. It's spelled with an I. Oh, okay, anyway, shut we're, up. we're fighting uh, Big Bang Vader here. Haven't seen him wrestle in a while, but here he is. Yeah, these X Hunters are fairly challenging. Oh, really? Yeah. And, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, there's. That's the crazy attack right there. Yeah, yeah really. Seriously, it comes from his ass. Yeah. Yeah, that was an epic hit right there. Yeah, really. The game had a pause. It was so epic. Why does he keep doing that? Because it's can. working. <laughs> yeah, really. I mean, <laughs> the CPU don't care. They don't fight cheap and spam you. They don't care. Just like kill, 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 kill. This Maverick has been marked as spam. Yeah. <laughs> and yeah, big mm -hmm. step tank right here. And ow, ow, I don't know the weakness. To some of these X hunters, I gotta do research again. It's been a while since I played this game. Okay, here's his bear. Shut up! <laughs> You're tearing me apart. Well, we jumped right through the ceiling. Yeah, really. Got to your part. Hey, number two, just like part two and Mega Man X two. You twos. got, yep. you got number two. Four six yep. two, four one. I mean, it's all the twos in this part. Fail. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> it's true. Come on. It's true. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> <laughs> as we proceed further in Old Drop Monster Stage, or further, it's still beginning, pretty much. All right, yes, Shinobi Three Tom. Oh, sweet! You don't have to watch out for the spikes. Yeah, really. 
Well, yeah. <laughs> jump, yeah, jump, this is, slide, this is on the cover box right here. We you're on this thing. Now this yes. reminds me of a. Uh, dang it! What's it called? Commando Man stage from Mega Man Ten. I was thinking. Um, I don't know. I forgot. I think it's sand. A little, a little bit of a uh, Pharaoh Man stage in the daytime. Yeah, you know it is kind of like that. Yeah. Okay, let me go back and get the uh, futuristic motorcycle, whatever the heck it is. <laughs> that guy ran right into that pipe. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> How stupid is he? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Skull Castle. Oh, wait, no. Oh, oh. it's not in the X-Series. Oh, ah, oh, try to jump up Skull there. Desert. Get... Oh, oh, you missed it. Oh. And, oh, yeah, I know what I need to do now. I can't go back now once you're in this section of the game. I can't backtrack. See, I need to go up there and get the heart, but no, I can't do it now because I failed. So I have to do that in a later part. You have no heart. Yeah, really. But I do have spin wheel to get to the first Doctor Light capsule. Sweet. Do, 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 do. What? what? Oh. Oh, this music. This is not. This this part of the music is part of the music. This part of the game right here with this music where you talk to Dr. Light is not as epic as the music in X1 where you talk to Dr. Light. It's like Chrono Trigger or something. <laughs> yeah, really. The X2 is a big but, to X1. Yeah, but here's what's ECW about this. I get the air dash. I can now dash in the air. Airman? Yep. <laughs> there we go. Sweet. All right. Happy now, day, can Tom. you... I was going to say, if you think about this, it's a short stage because here we are already at the boss. Sweet. Now, can you only dash once in the air? Like you jump and you just dash once? Um, yeah, I think so. I think there's another upgrade later where you can jump high, higher, and then do the air dash to get to high places. But uh, we'll have to get to that later because it's really been a while since I played this game. Yeah. I don't know this game as much as I do X X1, and this game is more challenging than X1, by the way. Here we go. Yeah, it looks like it. Yeah. Overdrive ostrich. Beep beep. <laughs> <laughs> meep meep. <laughs> All you right, so the, yeah. uh, the bird seed weapon. The bird seed weapon. Yeah, watch out. If he hits you right there, he'll knock you across the freak uh, the room. Well, not in the room, but you know what I mean. Across the screen. Yeah. Yeah. They can't hit you in switch rooms. Yeah. I thought he was running away for a second. Went in the, off in the background. I'm out of here. No, I'm coming back. <laughs> and he, uses, uh, he uses a sonic slicer attack. Uh oh. No, Plagiarism! No. <laughs> yeah, really. Sonic. I don't know the weakness to overdrive bosses really, but the Mega Buster works good enough. Oh, oh. but they're like uh, boomerangs. But yeah. No. <laughs> oh, man, it was a harder dodge. I mean, I could push pause and all that, but I don't try to yeah. play too cheap. Use the pause trick. You could toss it. <laughs> oh, look out. Ooh. Oh! DC up. In overdrive. Yeah, yeah. Overdose ostrich. <laughs> That's what Angel would say if he was here. Over overdose ostrich. Okay. Oh. <laughs> overdose. Never mind. Anyway. You need to overdose the sub tank. Oh, that no, was like, it? That's all you had? No. Yeah, that's all I had. <laughs> overdose ostrich, you use like a syringe to like inject drugs in you or something. <laughs> <laughs> you got Kill your him. shot. Oh! Come on uh -oh. now, you're almost there. It's getting close. ECW. Yeah. Kablowie. Tough belly. Uh, bluey, Kishuk. did it blue? Bluey? Oh, oh yeah, the bluey. The greeny. Oh, fail. <laughs> Walls. ECW. <laughs> yeah, that victory music isn't as good as the first one, I don't think. Definitely not. But anyway, as you piece up more trash, I get the Sonic Slicer. We will see you guys in part three. God bless and take care. See you later. Bye oh, boy. Welcome to Let's Play Mega Man X2 Part 3. This is Rob yeah. Warren with Parent13 who didn't even load this video. 
Jman four six two four one and Gunstar Hero twenty one. He's falling asleep. Jeff. <laughs> yeah, shut up, Jeff. All right, now we are in bubble crap stage. Bubble this crap. Stage is, this, <laughs> these na these maverick names are lame, but I mean, the mavericks themselves are pretty cool. I mean, this stage and music's pretty cool. Just listen to it for a few seconds. How was that? <laughs> Capcom was already like, we already got you hooked with, with Mega Man X1, so we're just going to put out with it, whatever for Mega Man X2. Oh, I got to let it you works. This is my, my... Yeah, this is my favorite game in the X series. Beats Chip and Dale X2. <laughs> oh. I still think X4 does. is my favorite one out of all of these. There's definitely ECW. Alright, now let me get the heart container up here. There we go. I don't miss. And it did almost nothing. This is like 16 bit Bowman stage right here on steroids. With jellyfish. Yeah. Ah! Kill it! I'm trying, I'm trying to get past, I'm trying to beat it. I, I, I gotta kill it. And then, uh, go to where it's trying to lodge at. Because that's where I gotta fight X Hunter number two. And then X Hunter oh. number two is agile. And then I'll, after that, we get zero part number three. They have to shoot the bottom. Shoot the what? The bottom. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, yeah, you gotta shoot everything. You gotta destroy everything on it. Shoot Except the for bottom. the tail. Yeah, you gotta shoot the tail, too. You gotta destroy every, every part yeah, of his body, too, to make it blow up. Yeah, but you can't shoot the tail yet. Well, not now. It's dead. There we go. Alright, here we go with the battle with Agile, or Agile, Argyle from Die Hard, whatever his name is. Sonic Save Boom! Me. Sonic copyright claim. <laughs> yeah, that was yeah but it's Capcom, so... Yeah, really. Sonic and creativeness. Oh! Ouch. <laughs> Once again, Capcom! <laughs> Can't wait for smokes, man. Bus can be awesome. Oh, yeah, he pattern. Pretty decently challenged uh, Maverick right here. He's like Ninja Gaiden Man. Yeah, really. Ninja Man, there you go. He does Ninja Gaiden Man. <laughs> Ninja Braid Man. He just wanted to say gay. Shadow Man after the classic series. Oh man. Oh no. Uh, oh, close. Now I get zero part number three. That means you have all three? Nope. I just think you don't have to give an order. You don't have part number one. Yeah, I need part number one. I gotta face Surges. Or Surges, South Dakota, whatever his name is. Dr. <laughs> Wiley? Zero. No, yeah, it looks like Dr. Wally. As we're already at the end of the stage, so we get to fight bubble crap. Yeah, what kind of game is that? Bubble crab. Well, I mean, uh, it's Capcom for you, and they're Mega Man characters. You use Wheel Gator, the, the spin wheel, or whatever it's called, as the weakness. Makes perfect sense, because, you know, a wheel, sharp wheel like that would pop the bubble. And I hate to burst your bubble there, bubble crab, but you're mine. I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> Terrible. <laughs> <laughs> I've used it before, I think, it's Bubble Man. I was like, wait a minute, we're missing a horrible pun. Oh, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 no. You got crap. I don't think I have any sub, yeah, I I have any sub tanks either. Ruh -roh. Oh, man. Ruh -roh, Raggy. <laughs> Ruh -roh. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Safe state. Come on, what are you so surprised <laughs> that I played this? TAS. 
<laughs> it's been a long time, and number two, it's a good battle. Number three, I'll handle so tanks. Oh, there we go. ECW. And he got killed by the explosion. <laughs> they messed up. Double KO. Yeah, that's why we told you to use save states. Double fatality. Yeah, we guys. Yeah, bear. Oh, sh <laughs> shut up. Oh, you save states on time. Shut up. Tim Fallen. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, we guy can't, we guy can't be here because he um, had a bunch of shots of tequila and too much pizza and Dr Pepper. He wanted me to mention that, so there it is. As I make a big splash in this game, I get bubble splash. So meaning he didn't want to do this because he doesn't like us, or he took half baby town on, he's passed out. Well, probably because he's puking like uh, like Angel. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he he should have been on here. He, he, he want to be in this LP. Then we, have his, then we could have his puke as a coach, as a special guest. Okay, I'm gonna like never mind what I said about bubble crab because flame stag. Yeah, well. What the? What if, yeah, but he's ECW uh, though. His name's not ECW, but he is. It's like a stag. stag. He could be sissy man. It'd still be cool. I can't beat the fire and get one up. No. Oh. 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 You got to be cool. Okay. I was like, <laughs> to get owned by that. I mean, the, you know. You got flame. But I did fish. not want to be in this video because he didn't want to hear my horrible puns or J Man's either. <laughs> well, I'm 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 just trying to catch up to you. <laughs> <laughs> What? Why would Dr. Wiley or whoever the hell it is make a robot out of a dung beetle? It's not Dr. Wiley yet. It's Sigma. <laughs> well, how would Dr. Asshole make a robot out of a dung beetle? Actually, we're not supposed to really know it's Sigma yet, but spoilers. Oops. Is there a uh, dung, dung man? But there's oh, Pole Man. Cool. Thank you a lot for ruining the spoiler, J-Man. This game has been out nothing more than 19 years, and we can't reveal the story. J-Man. And that's why we should have gotten the one to support it. With, well, whatever. With my more appropriate name of Asshole Man. <laughs> <laughs> Easy double, yeah. I think Easy everybody man. now understands why you're quiet all the time. Yeah. It's <laughs> when you talk, it's man, that like, makes you think of me <laughs> It's like Kevin said. I said, Kevin, you don't talk that much. Oh, it's better... To know when to, uh, it's better to be quiet than not know when to be quiet. You got the heart. <laughs> you got to the thing, thing again. Oh. <laughs> well, at least I got the heart this time. <laughs> at least I got the heart, so I don't have to worry about that now. Oh, use the Mega Bus, you idiot! You're the idiot, idiot. Yeah, You're Ronnie. The idiot. You're the one that. <laughs> no, plays, jump in uh, the fire gives you hell. Chippendales three. The heck? Whoa, oh, Green's still here. Oh, of oh, course. Yeah. I just watching Ronnie suck for a little bit. And I just like we got the other night. Uh, yeah, well, <laughs> at least people can hear our commentary. Mm. <laughs> Dean Fallick. You know, we need to upload that video on Retro Prairie Green on the, on our own channel. <laughs> yeah. Wait, what the hell did I do this time? Master. You're less manure on Double Dragon 3. Oh, oh. yeah. Yes! Oh, special yes! guest train. The Pony Express. <laughs> yes! That was done on purpose. <laughs> I know, I set it up. Jamie hit the train sound effect in his computer. <laughs> yeah, put that as your Skype call uh, sound when someone calls you. <laughs> and it has to be that I'll be confused all the time. <laughs> I'll think people are trying to call me on Skype all the time. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Jeff trying to call you all the time. If, if you use the metric system, the trains would run on time. If I use the metric system, that would be horrible. This is an SAT test. This is an SG2K test. STD test. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, okay, maybe that too. Now let's see, Ronnie get pwned. No. 
And he got pwned by the doors. No, he's gonna win. Him in. Nah, I think I can take this guy. He's ECW, but he's no match for the fearsome, deadly, piercing bubble oh, blast. <laughs> Cause kind he gets soap like, in his eyes and he can't see, so... Kind of like rubbing, like, lightly splashing water at him. Yeah, stop yeah. it! I don't like it! Yeah, Mom! <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Be oh, sure no, to use the bubble head on Dr. Wally. Oh no, he's countering with his uh, SC Johnson Wax. Yeah. Wow. Watch out for the Q-tips. <laughs> That's why his eyes aren't oh, that was easy. Yeah, it's yeah, easy for Bubble Splash, but without it, it's, uh, I mean, he's, he's ECW. Yeah, Mom, he beat me up, he destroyed my robot suit. <laughs> Play nice, X, or Zero, or whatever the hell your name is. X. Mom, um, he beat me, E-Lawyer him. E-Lawyer him. Take him to E-Jail. <laughs> uh... Now I acquire... Speed Burner. What? Which is useful. Yep. So that is the end of part three. We'll see you in part quattro. God bless and take care. It should have been called Flaming Asshole. <laughs> awesome. Just like yours. Goodbye. See ya. See ya. Bye bye. Welcome to Let's Play Mega Man X2 Part 4. This is Ron Moore along with We Got 309, Bear 13, and J Man 46241. Hey yo! Oh, you lie. Oh. Now it's time to How's go to... How's it hanging in these chairs? Now, here's the uh, intimidating Maverick, Morph Moth. <gasps> oh. He's scaring me. Actually, he's kind of cool. His stage of music's not bad. Maverick himself, well, we'll get to him when we we'll get to him. And Okay, the Robot Masters, their, their names in this game are giving Mega Man 10 a challenge. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> oh my god. How do you beat him like uh, a bright light or something? Get him confused. Yeah. <laughs> um, a fly swatter. Yeah, yeah giant fly swatter. In this stage, I'm getting ready. To, in this stage, I'm getting ready to fight the final X hunter, Surges. <laughs> Surge soldier. <laughs> Surges. Surges, North Dakota. And uh, Ronnie uses YouTube power. Yeah. Michigan. <laughs> no, Michigan. No. Patrick Swayze. Tubular. We got too late. Too soon. Well, no, it's too late now. <laughs> it's too late. It's too late because that was funny like a long time ago. So now I know. But I like Patrick Swayze too. Right there? I know. He's awesome. Exactly. This bug right here gets into uh, these dead robots and brings back to life. And, well, this game has some bugs in it. Yeah, yeah that da, bugs. Da, 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 da. Whoa! Uh, stupid laggage. That's it. I'm getting sick and tired of this computer. I'm getting a new one. Finally! It's the Rob has time. come back. <laughs> Finally! The Rob Mower doesn't have to wait 10 minutes to restart. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alright, here we go with the battle with the Final X Hunter. Yeah, I think I think maybe you can get like a uh, new computer from the government. Just tell them that you're a CEO of GM and they'll give you billions upon billions of dollars. Yeah, yeah there you go. Whoa, okay. he looks like uh, Dr. Wiley in the face. Yeah. And yeah, the hair and everything. This is, uh, I was going to say, this is the robotic Dr. Wiley. And this Maverick, um, uh, X-Hunter, wherever he is, he's a freaking pain. He's the hardest of all three uh, X-Hunters to me. Yeah, that's a His pretty cool attack. Steve. 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 Steve Weeby? <laughs> Steve Weeby guy? Steve yeah. Weebles wobbles, but he doesn't fall down. <laughs> <laughs> Man, his attacks are hard to dodge. Ow! Oh, the landmines on the ground. Yeah. What do you think they were? Pizza. Uh, I, I thought he was just, thought his little thing was shitting, taking robotic tech, <laughs> mechanical shits. Oh, see, that is Taco Bell. <laughs> exactly. There isn't, like, a weapon you can use to pwn him? You probably could, but I'm not sure of the, his weakness other than X-Buster. 
Use the power glove. No, <laughs> yeah, don't use the power glove. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're really helpful. And welcome back to part 10. We're still trying to beat this boss. <laughs> so Alright, there we go. Trying to get past the first level. We have merely delayed the inevitable. We will meet again, dot, dot, dot. Ellipses. Now, I finally have all of Zero's parts. Come hither, Zero. Oh, whoa. Well, that's easy to there. Anyway, I think I missed something. What's with his boots? They're, like, different color. Yeah, they, I got, that's one of the upgrades I got. That's the only upgrade I got, as a matter of fact, right now, is the, uh, mid-air dash. Oh, yeah, oh, I saw that. Never mind, yeah. He got the power boots. It's so bad. Yeah. And so, yeah. like, now you're kind of, like, going back in the stage? Yeah. Kind of like, uh, Castlevania 3? Yeah, I guess. I'm, I'm not too well, familiar with Well, you get Grant in Castlevania 3, and then you have to go back through the level. Yeah. Ah, it's aliens. Ah. I get freaking. Ah, oh, come on, stop on freezing <laughs> computer. Ridiculous. And no, that's not YouTube this time. That's yeah, actually on the video. Yeah. Dummies. Hey, what is this contra now? To look at the ceiling. Intestines. Was this a uh, junk junk man stage at the bottom? Yeah, this this is a junkyard. So yeah, I was like junkyard man here mixed with a moth. Ow. <laughs> you got pwned. Now fight one of these bugs. It's uh, Bear the Robot. <laughs> oh, we shut got up. Just because I live in a dump. <laughs> <laughs> in Canada. Hey. Whoa. It's still better than hey. Detroit. Detroit? Oh, Detroit? Detroit? <laughs> it doesn't live in Detroit. Destroy it. Fine. Still better than Flint. Happy Dead Fan. Dead Fan does live in Detroit. You can't be happy about anything, can you? <laughs> oh no, he's happy about a lot of things. <laughs> Death Band and Star like Soldier, Death Band and Star Soldier have now unsubscribed. My Star Soldier, I love him. Those are made fun of Canada. Oh, oh uh, yeah. Well, only yes, my channel Canada. may surpass the S2K. And here's so more mock. Star, Sol Star Soldier, I'll, I'll patch things up and we'll go to Tim Hortons and enjoy some Tim bits and double double A. <laughs> hey, anyway. Uh, <laughs> anyway, any a more more moth here. Oh, you don't get a bug zapper. He doesn't look like much here. Ah, looks like a piece of crap. Hey, jump off the wall, stupid controller! Kill it with fire. Isn't that what five-year-olds say when their controllers don't work? <laughs> when Dude, they I'm still, suck I'm still, uh, when I'm they still suck Alright, now here we go for the second half of this battle. He'd actually morph to a moth or a butterfly or whatever. Butterfly man. Yeah. It's after his pixie dust. <laughs> right? <laughs> and home. <laughs> That's the credit, Barry. Jeez, he was so hard. He was at the edge of my seat. Yeah, look who's talking, Mr. Uh, Silver Surfer boss battle. Oh, yeah, hey. All right. You'll never be able to beat that game. I don't want to beat that game. <laughs> on beat exactly. this game, as I acquire the silk shot. Okay. It's like a. It's like a bundle of bricks or something. I don't know. Now, Dr. McCain. it's got all zeros parts. It's going to try and reassemble him. Yeah, Dr. McCain. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Dr. Phil. Yeah. <laughs> you are you need to make a change, Mega Man. Yeah. <laughs> and we'll see you guys in Port Cinco. God bless and take care. Goodbye, oh. See ya, o. See ya. Welcome to Port Cinco of Mega Man X2. This is Ron Moore along with Jman46241 and we got 309. Hey! And they don't have much to say, so. I said hey. Yes, we do. Well, we, we guys quiet. Magnus, you're quiet. 
Yeah, Magus. Hey guys, Magnus Centipede here. <laughs> now this is actually a cool ma uh, Maverick name and a cool Maverick battle and the cool Maverick stage, but the music, eh. The stage looks familiar. Yeah, it's the, um, this is where the uh, X Hunters are at when they were talking. Oh, uh, okay. Now you got uh, yeah. Metal Gear Searchlights. Yeah. What was that noise? Dun, 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 dun. Yeah. <laughs> Kodak. This this should be Tetris Man stage. <laughs> not really. Tetris is four blocks, not just one big single one. Shut up. You just had to ruin. The... Yeah, thanks, fanboy. Yeah, really. Uh oh, it's not a Tetris stage. It's not a sequel. It's a prequel. <laughs> it's a pursuit of sequel, 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 <laughs> sequel. <laughs> Yeah, whatever. There was a there was a WF announcer named Howard Finkel. Ray Finkel? Finkel and Einhorn. Einhorn and Finkel. <laughs> Speed Ventura Man. Yeah. Just 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 the body Ventura Man. Okay, now you're finding a cybernetic link, Master Sword. Uh, uh invisible link. Yeah. It's Master Sword. <laughs> it's Master Sword, yeah. Master Hands can join the Master Sword. Yeah, Master Hands is invisible. And you can only- Ooh. Ow! And you can only shoot the, uh, handle. That's yeah, cool. you need to get a handle on this battle. Yeah, really. I don't know if I can handle this. <laughs> You're trying to fan me? Ow! <laughs> Dang it, stupid dash button and jump buttons close together and I accidentally, didn't, and accidentally hit both. That's pretty cool, like the way the sword is. It looks like mode 7 or something. Yeah. Looks like 64 <laughs> graphics or something. Uh, blast this processing. Game, this game does have a certain distinctive chip built in it. I forgot what it was, but Nintendo Power is talking about it uh, on, this, chip? on this release. Chip Rogers. <laughs> <laughs> World video game programmer, programmer. <laughs> chip Roger. Watch out for the bugs. Wow. Ah. Uh, Uh-oh. Uh, too late. Oh, no. Now here's Tetris. Yeah, this is like, uh, Mega Man 1. Yeah. Ah. Uh. Okay, I forgot what the purpose of that oh. is. They don't shoot you or take energy away from you or nothing. Analyzing. Yeah, someone caught on me. No, we're going analyzing. there. That's the uh, X-100 battle room, but we already defeated all three of them. And we got all zero's parts, so we don't have to worry about them no more. And here's yeah. the mini boss. It's a turkey man. Oh, that's what the scanning was. It's I think examining or taking away my powers and giving it to him or something. Not taking away, but sharing the powers with him or I don't know. Oh, freaking day. Oh, so every time he got scanned, it made him more powerful. Yeah, I think he gets scanned like two or three times. So I think it takes more hits to probably kill him too. I'm not sure. That's not what like I think makes him more difficult. It's like we got Bear's love child here. <laughs> now it's like Bear's and Peter Graves love child. Who's Peter Griffin or Grave? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Some someone Bear's obsessed with, I guess. On A and E. He's an older PC actor. I, I remember remember him on uh, Airplane, older Airplane movies. Oh yeah, Helicopter. <laughs> yeah, helicopter. The sequel? No, that was MASH. Helicopter. Na, 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 this song's boring. I'm glad they make we a need, game of that. We need some Tim Foley in here. <laughs> yeah, really. Oh! Ooh. Come on! Tetris blocks. It's more like they drained the silliest blocks or whatever. Alright, here we go with Magma. Uh, mag magnet, uh, magnet man. <laughs> Liquid hot magma. What the? It's like centipede man, actually. Yeah. Well, it is. It's magnet centipede. Uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, partial credit. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Use the silk shot to knock that armor off, or whatever it is. That like, kind of like a mag. It is a magnet. Actually, I think it pulled me toward him or something. I don't know. I forgot. But dispose of that quickly. <laughs> it's like a ninja. This should be Ninja Maverick or Ninja Man or something. Whoa. Look at it. it's disappearing, throwing Chinese stars. This is a Ninja Man. Shinobi Man. 
Yeah, really. That would been a cool Ninja Man. And that, and that should have been, you know, he should have been the one to get Shadow Blade instead of Shadow Man, a freaking ballerina. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Ooh. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Tell him to quit saying. hanging around. <laughs> yeah. That's all we're saying. Oh, 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 nice commentary there. Oh man! <laughs> that was like nothing. Yeah. Man, your strategy is not working. Yeah, really. I mean, that is the weakness, <laughs> but I think I'm better with the X Buster. Actually, right. I think I should just use a silk shot just to knock off that uh, special armor. Ah, just oh. just to knock off that special armor, and then after that, use the X, the Mega X Buster, whatever you want to call it in this game. Okay. You need to help. Here we go. Yeah, <laughs> here we go, round dulse. I had to pause for a second, and they're just like, bear. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there it is. Uh, yeah, see, it was sucking me toward him, so let me disarm it with the silk shot. There we go. Just like armor number Dillo, use the spark shock to knock off his armor. And then uh, he's a little bit easier after that. Now I'm just going to use the X-Buster. Oh. But not waste it. There we we can't be wasted because you have unlimited. Yeah. This battle is meh. This battle's cool. Look at this. I mean, I think it's the best battle so far in this game. Well, if I was maybe playing, I would be like, cool, but just watching it's kind of like, eh. Well, it's yeah, a lot like better now that you got the, you know, kind of strategy, or better strategy. Yeah. If you don't like it, we got, I want you to just hang up. <laughs> Okay. Ding, ding. okay. Oh no, he's the host! <laughs> oh yeah, thought I was, dang it. <laughs> oh, I'm just kidding. Let's say I got nothing. Love this boss battle music. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It's good. <laughs> it's better. <laughs> but I'm not, I'm not paying this, it's pretty cool. Two more hits. Yep. One more hit. One more shot. Ah. <laughs> One more pause. <laughs> sure. Oh, what? never mind. Why does, pauses. why does this always happen to be for Super Nintendo game? Grr. Oh, <laughs> shout, no, Shadowgate's fine. Rambo's fine. Mega Man X2? No. Maybe you need oh. a program that can, like, I don't know, make your gaming better or something with gaming experience. <laughs> it was, uh, they have a cool sound effects though right there. <laughs> um, oh, now the battle's over, then it stops. Yeah, thanks Capcom or Emulator. This was originally a 10 minute video, but with all the pauses, it's 15 minutes. <laughs> 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 Alright, as he does some exercise bend overs right there, we get the Magnet, magnet Mine. mine. It's a rip off of Magnet Man. No. <laughs> All right, anyway. down to our last Maverick, the That's deadly, right. dashedly dreaded, fearsome Crystal Snail. Looks like a Boomer Kawinger. <laughs> the picture did. Nope, don't look like him there. Snail really? man. Really, Crystal Snail? Crystal Snail is actually not bad. Just the name kind of sucks, but the stage music and battle is pretty cool. Crystal yeah, Man. Little, uh, this is like this is like Gemini Man and Crystal Man's love child. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Yes. The ECW armor. The ECW tank. Whatever you call it. Yeah, you don't have to watch out for the spikes. Yeah, watch out. Those are one-hit kills. They crush you. Well, yeah, I have to get crushed. So one kill. But um, I'll come on, fly higher. <laughs> Grr. Fly higher than an eagle. Yeah, I'm gonna need uh, the armor to get up there. I forgot what's up there. If I get up there, we'll find out. Ah, yes. Yes. There we go. How can so you, hit, like, punch up there and it hits, like, the second set of the spikes first? That's weird. Yeah, that's. I didn't notice that till now. That's weird. There we go. Uh, come on, get the energy. There we go. Well, I gotta let's see. What the hell is I'm, that? I'm, I'm up there. What? What? Like 
Totem pole, man. Okay, I got a... That's that's ice right there, actually, or crystal. So, there we go. I can't comp the wall. Damn. <laughs> Freaking totem pole missiles. Ah, oh, dang it. That's a waste of time. That's... Yeah, that's the expo, ex... Uh, master... Whatever, X hunter room. That was a waste of time. Never mind. <laughs> so you're, you already went there. Oh! oh. <laughs> had to go. Idiot. Uh, uh. Well, oh, that's for nothing. Let's start this again. <laughs> it's wasted two minutes, two, three minutes of that. I should you probably don't. be at Sigma's Fortress or whatever now, but no, I'm still here. He was like, oh no, this video is only going to be 13 minutes. I gotta make it 15. Yeah. <laughs> You have to get the power. Whoa! Actually, I thought there's a secret down here. Somewhere in this stage, there is like a little secret close to the pit. But that's not it. Oh, the camera would started going down further. Yes, we're being filmed live. <laughs> this is a corn shack marathon. And a corn shack marathon. <laughs> Donate five hundred dollars to a charity. And you play all the Mega Max games. Follow me on Facebook. <laughs> Next question from the chat room comes from Wee Guy. Uh, yeah, uh, do you listen to Tim Paul in music? Nah. Uh, not really. I did when I was a kid, then I got Richie Prade. <laughs> <laughs> and Cornshag, uh, has just deleted me from Facebook. <laughs> oh, come on, he can handle just a little bit of, uh, whatever this is. No, he blocks everybody that mentions the word Richie Prade. Uh, well, you're uh, gonna I'm, get I'm, I'm, blocked. Kidding. I'm just kidding. Now you've been oh. double blocked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, from YouTube too. And flagged. <laughs> suspended. Now this oh, boss is a freaking pain. He's getting pwn right there. Alright. No, no, look out. Whoa. Yeah, really you have to hurry up for that thing crushes me. Okay, I think uh I think the uh next Doctor Light power up is yes, this oh. way. <laughs> it almost died. Yeah, really. Should've. I mean, good thing he didn't. Uh, girl. All right. Mega Man, do do. Here's your new weapon. Do 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 do. Yeah. Radar optics. This is not a weapon. It's actually uh, you can like scan where there's a hidden. We can go through walls. Now you can go through walls. Uh, so it's like the X-ray thing on Super Metroid. Yeah, kind of. Yeah, pretty, pretty much same thing, except you don't really, like, aim. So you just use it to where you think there might be a secret, and well, it's going to demonstrate itself right here. See that that extra man is at right there, and tells you right there, there's the opening. The secret passage. Um. <laughs> okay, this thing's broken. <laughs> it lied. There's no secret passage. Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah. You have to use the morph ball. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> No, go back. Yeah, let's use one of Zero's parts. <laughs> All right, there we go. Uh -huh. All right, now let's proceed further in level. All right. Yeah. I always love this music. This music's pretty cool. Now this, well, there's another Doctor Light item that uh, see I can use right here. It's telling me I can use that item to uh like attract energy or something to me i can't really explain i'll get that later on probably like part six or seven or whatever i, I still need like i think two more dr dr light items oh no look out oh, no, no. No. oh hurry up no oh oh, <laughs> oh. Ooh, i had to climb yeah. the ladder like an idiot stupid how stupid are you <laughs> okay so that's the end of part six i mean five we'll see you in part six god bless there we Take go. care. See ya. See ya. Peace. And welcome to part six of Let's Fail at Mega Man X2. This is Ron Moore along with We Got 309, and for the first time in five years, Jeff from Strictly Sega America. Hey, I've had an extended hiatus, and it was fun. I went to DC actually, but anyway, that's a nice down here nor there. Anyway, Joe, see, I'm Joe, sure I'm sure Jeff has played this since this is a legendary Super Nintendo game. No, I played Mega Man X, actually, but I never played X2. Oh, okay. You know, we, I have the best of both worlds, but I'm like Nintendo, so... Yeah, but you know what? They don't have this game on the Genesis. Yeah. No, but they have an awesome name for the Game Gear that you guys didn't get. Suck it. 
We do have Mega Man Dr. Wily's Wars or whatever on Genesis. Yeah. Uh, that's not near as epic as this. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> a good soundtrack, though. Oh! Of course. My, oh. No, I, don't, I don't care. Let, let's forget about the Sega and Nintendo for now. Let's just focus on... This is, Ninten this is Nintendo. This is Super Nintendo. <laughs> yeah, this is Nintendo. I know it's Nintendo. I know that. Now we face the final Maverick in the game, Crystal Snail. Yeah, yeah, Chris, Crystal Slater, Slater, whatever. Okay, that is the most retarded <laughs> idea for a villain ever. What, what we got? We got an idea? Uh, it's gonna be a snail, and uh, crystals on it. Yeah, well, Capcom ran out of ideas by Mega Man 4. <laughs> pretty, pretty much. They, I bet they just sit around and got stoned. They're like, so, you got any more ideas? Um, uh, no. Stone Man. <laughs> you got pot? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they did. Don't be Big Man Bob. What plot Or maybe I got stone right there and just uh, ran out of ideas. Hey, since we're stone, how about Stone Man? <laughs> yeah, they got they got stone they, they, got, they got drunk off Saki and started seeing things. Oh. But Crystal Snail is a cool boss, as you can see. He's using Matrix style te uh, technologies. The te uh, it looks like he's a pain in the ass to kill, but. Yeah, and I, oh, great. Yeah, nice so tank refill there. Um, as I use the magnet mine, the magnet mine's a weakness, but uh, not very good at it. I think I'm, I think the X bus might be more convenient, but I'm gonna try to stick with this. Oh, girl. Well, I guess he's coming out of his shell. <laughs> that's what she said. Turtle power. Oh, oh man. Oh, that's it. Bob die. Snail power. That yeah, whatever. But I remember I had I, I don't remember much about Mega Man X2, but I remember I was uh, sick at home one day with a cold, and I just spent all day drinking uh, Pip. What was it? Yeah, it was Mr. Pip back then, and playing Mega Man X. That was a good time. Yeah, Mr. Pip. Yeah. Why wasn't it called Mr. Pip anymore? It is still called Mr. Pip in other places. No, it is Mr. Pip Extra. Oh. Oh. Still, it's Pip. It tastes like Dr. Pepper. Oh, you died. I love watching this, and we're having a conversation about Pip. Fantastic. Only on the SD2 pay, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Oh, As Ronnie gets pwned. Yep. Oh, there's an ad next to the video. Mr. Pib. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There'll be an ad. We won't see a dime of that revenue, but there will be an ad. That could happen. J-Man ha and his friend has copyright-free music on one of their videos, and yeah, there's an ad next to it. That is copyright ridiculous. We, we yeah. did we did a we did a couple videos called the Mad Yo Yo or Part One or Two and we used uh, I forgot what artist we used but he allows people to use his music he doesn't use it online so it was cool but we had ads like all over the place around it ah uh, it's ridiculous and uh, J Man is going to contest that because he's not going to help somebody else make money off of his original creation yeah exactly so uh then way back to this game as I take on Crystal Snell round two. Move to blimp, people. If you have any decent videos, move them to blimp now. Yeah, really. At least you can make a little bit of money. It's not a lot, but it's better than nothing. Yeah. Yeah, make five cents. Hey, <laughs> I made two dollars last month. Wow, you made more than I have in almost a year. I still have 40-something cents. Really? Oh, it's my interview well, with Stuart. That really, that's really bringing in the money there. Yeah, and Charlie uh, pl uh, plugging it yeah. on his channel. and. Yeah. And Plus, he did a I mean, it turned out better than what we had. I mean, I refuse to use pre-roll ads, and I don't upload all my videos all at, all at once on Blip. I, I kind of like space them out. I mean, so I, I don't use pro ads either. That's that's a that's a no-no for me. Yeah, yeah I, I, I yeah, Star Soldier. I mean, you're awesome, but that's not ECW. Stop using pre-roll ads. Anyway, and it's not like it's not like you're getting ten thousand views a day and you're making a living off of this. I mean, we're not. You know, yeah. I mean, I understand some reviewers who, you know, do make a living off of this crap. Yeah, I, I understand, and I'll suffer through it. I wish I could. If I could make it a living just using a pre-roll ad, then I would do it. Oh, but, yeah. But, I mean, yeah. I'm, but I'm not, so, I mean, I'm not going to do it. You some know? of these basic reviewers make five-figure income. It's ridiculous. Oh, yeah. I don't know how, but damn, I want to get in that market. Because they're ECW. Indeed. Oh, totally. Actually, it's... I've got to work on a uh, 300 subscriber video. It's gonna be big, guys. So watch it. Cool. Can't believe I actually have 300 people who watch my shit. Well, it's only like 100 that actually watch. Other people have yeah, some, yeah, some, some shit. Yeah, yeah. It's like 120 who probably watched, and the other ones just subscribed and never really came back. No, oh, yeah, a lot of people do that. They do sub for sub and just to 
get their oh, channel well, more noticed. Yeah. It's not sub, it's just they subbed and, you know, they never really came Yeah, anyone who does that is a douchebag. Oh, yeah. That's right, you're a douchebag. <laughs> But anyway, uh, I defeat Crystal Snail, get the Crystal something, I forgot, and we head back to, I guess, Mega Man headquarters. His name is X, so I called him Mega Man, make it be mine, Capcom. And it's, uh, I see uh, Dr. McCain here, or whatever his name is. <laughs> oh, I'm John McCain. Vote for me in two Skip Roger, Skip Roger, Dr. Kane. I'm on my way. For John McClain. Remember to destroy the liberals in the Northeast. <laughs> we must return to it. Iraq. <laughs> we must. We cannot leave it now. It is almost all right. Lost. Now this is where I'm going to go back and get all the parts, heart containers, sub tanks, etc. Before we enter the X Hunter stage right there. Yeah, I love how it's an island. Everything else is attached, but the main the main boss is just way over there somewhere. Yeah, the North Pole. Yeah, so now. Here, here we are, Overdrive Oscar stage, we're going to get the heart. Yay, the heart. Oh, yeah, there we go. Yes! Maybe you can no. see the tiger while you're at it, too. <laughs> and, alright, it was worth dying to get that. Now we go back to Will Gator stage and get the next Dr. Light capsule upgrade. The Super X Buster. I love how Dr. Light just goes to these evil villains, like, headquarters, and puts holograms with items in it everywhere. Yeah, no right. wonder it's caught. <laughs> well, he's dead right here. Oh, yeah. He, this, oh, well, he's dead this one? Oh, man. This is hologram. I know it's a hologram, but holograms tend to not talk back to you. They say a couple sentences and they disappear. Well, the, he's At not talking back to him. He's just saying his automated speech and then that's it. Well, anyway, no wonder he died. <laughs> he died because he's old. The, the X series took oh, place so like 30 years after the original series did. did. He did. He wasn't finally killed. Like when Mega Man was off, you know, getting laid or something. I don't think he specified how he died, but uh. Doctor, he just comes in with a handgun and blows his brains away. Oh, I mean, failed right there to get the heart. Seriously, Mega Man, plot holes, plot holes everywhere. Holes everywhere. Oh. That's what she said. He's a speed burner here. You're gonna fail. On uh, yes. Uh, damn it. I mean, good job. Yay. <laughs> Here's a cool way to get this next uh, heart container. There you go. That was really simple. Yep. Kind of tricky though. I had to find that out on YouTube. I forgot how. This. Oh no. Well, not this part right here. But uh, right here, I'm getting the. I think it's the sub tank first, or the heart. Let's see. Uh, heart. This game needs more giant robots. There's not enough. Uh, you didn't see part one. But anyway, yeah. uh, oh, <laughs> no, th this right here is real hard to, get, real hard to get. Try to get the sub tank up here. No, your your final boss should be a Gundam, a giant Gundam. <laughs> uh, actually, it is an X3 kind of. <laughs> oh really? Yeah. Oh. Sigma <laughs> looks like a Gundam character. Oh dear God. Because that'd be random, just had the RX, uh, or, or, yeah, RX-13 from the original gun, and just all of them jumping around shooting. Yeah. It's like, oh no, Bandai and Capcom, wait, if Bandai can't come, have joined forces before. Oh man, now this is another, another hard sub tank to get. So power up my bubble splash to jump higher, to aim higher in life. The bubbles. Oh wait, here we are, that was easy. Oh wait, pfft, man, no. Okay, hold on. I love, I love whenever you do something, you have gas. Very <laughs> bizarre. Oh, where's the sub tank at? I know it's up here somewhere. Somewhere underwater here. <laughs> and the universe. And space itself. Ah, there it is. What, how do you get up there? Grr. Ah, quit hitting the jump and dash button at the same time. Yeah, press them both, they'll make you jump higher. <laughs> you shut your mouth. No, you shut your mouth. No, you shut your poor mouth. Yes, got it. Alright. Now, flame stack stage. To get the, uh, I think the last sub tank. As I already got the heart, if you remember, I kept on dying the fire to get the heart. <laughs> wow. I think we got seen that. Some of, some of these robots in Mega Man, I've noticed how actual retarded they are. Let's make, let's make a robot that just tries to cut him instead of, you know, a giant 
bazooka to blast it. Yeah. All right, now I got all the sub tanks, and now I get the last Doctor Light upgrade, which is useless, but I still like to get it because I feel like it. Actually, it's not the last Doctor Light upgrade. The last Doctor Light upgrade is when you get the Hadouken, I think, in X Hunter Stage Three, but I'm not sure how to get that. I don't really care to get that. So. Into the Mega Man capsule. X, enter the capsule. Why can't he just be Mega Man? I don't know. They can't make it the monies. And the first one is called X. Now it's Mega Man X in this one. I think Capcom messed up. But they, have some, think, new, they have some new programmers that weren't familiar with the storyline. I think the English to Japanese translation just went sour. Yeah. Probably so does like in Simon's Quest. You now possess Dracula's Rib. Possess. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds like a bad medication. Yeah. Da, 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 da. Nice. Super Randy Orton pose. All right, yeah. let's get out of here. And now yeah. we are getting ready to go to the X Hunter Fortress, and that will continue <laughs> in part seven. Wait, so there's a part seven? No! All right, guys. See you later. God bless. Take care. Bye bye. Dramatic effect. Alright, welcome to X2 Part 7. This is Ron Moore, along with We Got 3 on 9 and JMan46241. Yo. Hey. And finally entered X Hunter's Fortress. Huzzah. Kaza. Kaza, no one yeah. uses that software anymore, do they? Download movies and stuff. It's illegal. Uh, yeah. Just like ROM, so if you're using a ROM, you're a sissy. Wait. Yeah. Don't be a ROM mower. Yeah. Alright, and... Yeah, we're fighting yeah, these... Uh, jumping screw... Screw drivers? Screw drivers, whatever they are. Yeah, screw drivers. Hall <laughs> drivers. Q-tips. <laughs> yeah. I thought they were Q-tips, yeah, that'd be weird. Alright, now here's Jeff closing the walls. <laughs> hey, hey, what? <laughs> oh. This is, this is some cool music. Of course, I would know and stuff. Yep. Or, yeah, yeah, I like the stage music. Shows epicness. Oh, yep. Whoa! <laughs> yeah, really. Jeff with the Don't robotic scorpion. Us. Where was that? Ooh, you got stung. Where was that, Maverick? Where was, like, a um, killer scorpion or something? <laughs> scorpion Man. Was there a scorpion, um, Maverick? I don't I didn't know, uh, but... Sting Chameleon. Oh yeah, Sting yeah. Chameleon, but... They could have made Scorpion Man from Mega Man 10 instead of Sheep Man. Or Come Strike on. Man. Yeah. They struck out with that name. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say that. Strike, they're out. But Ron Moore never strikes out with the ladies. <laughs> oh, baby. Right. Anyway. <laughs> well, it's not true, but I still wanted to make uh, a cool... Uh, an algae or pun, not, not an algae, a pun. <laughs> How's that even a pun? Oh, okay, yeah, I get it. An algae. Yeah, okay, make these, a hype uh, totem pole missiles we gotta jump on. Ah! Oh! Kinda waste my time yep. down here. I'm trying to fill out all my sub tanks before I fight Violin again. Violin. Violin! Haha, I see what they did there. <laughs> yeah. He's That's a mix between a violin and being violent, I guess. Violent violin. They should be a heavy metal band. They should have a heavy metal violin <laughs> they should use. I had to start and, over. Oh, right oh, what was that all about? I had to start over because yeah. I was going to get crushed. Uh, well, actually, let me go down here and, uh, okay, that ding you just heard, it builds up the, uh, uh, that system that I got from Dr. Light in part six. The, uh, what, I'll demonstrate it later. I can't really explain it. So I have to start over? I'm trying to fill... No, I, well, see, I was about to get crushed by the walls. Okay. So I'll start, uh, start over later. But right now, I'll come back try to fill up some sub-tanks here. But it's hard. Come on, give me some... There we go. And now I gotta... Well, I'm down low on energy, so I gotta fill that up first. <laughs> you should, uh, uh, grinding. Yeah. Well, I'm not yeah, gonna grind too long, or I would've cut this out, but... I'm thinking about just stuff. giving up. Just giving up and facing violin like a man. Or a mechanic. Be a man! Or be a robot. Be a Mega Man! Be a man, Hulk. Yeah. Brother. There we go, there's a little nothing of energy. 
Yeah, just forget. I'm trying to face him like a man. You can do it. Oh, 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 oh. oh, oh. oh, oh. He done did it. Here we go. Oh, it's on now. Yep. Round two with Violin. And yes, this oh. time he is harder. Well, yeah, he's made of metal and stuff. Of course he's harder. Here's that oh, oh, item oh. Dr. Light gave me. Whoa. The Super Randy Orton pose, which barely did anything. Um, Look yeah, it's, cool. well, you take all uh, the damage you take, it builds up to where you can use it like a big explosion. It's, I think it's mainly used to like defeat too many enemies on the screen at once. The little generic enemies. Uh, so it's Fight. like a like a final attack, kind of. Yeah, I guess bubble splash. I think is the weakness here, and I'm just gonna spam the bubble attack or the bubble splash as much as I can. Use that there we go. Filled up. You got him. Yeah. Come on, come on. There you go. Big Van Vader is defeated for good. Okay. How could I, 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 that's all the Spanish I know of this, right? <laughs> circuit, circuit to toes. I don't know. He goes circuit toes. at the end as Valen is officially destroyed. Well, that was short. What the stage? No, the boss. He was short, but yet sweet. Whoa. Like the freaking one that took forever to beat. I forgot which Maverick. Uh, that might have been uh, Crystal Snail from the last part we did. It was like the alligator or some shit like that. Oh yeah, Will Gator. Yeah. Crystal Saw Snail. Or well, that ninja one, I don't know. I gotta... I oh, I the uh, oh, Ag Guy, oh, the one of the X hunters Okay. Yeah, I, I don't know my Mega Man X history, okay? Yeah, well, you know what? This is X Hunter Stage 2, where the boss is, uh, Surges, or Dr. Wally, whatever his name is. <laughs> okay, no, really. And yes, he's much harder in this one. And he was tough enough, and, and the first time I fought him, if you remember, now this one's like, even more ECW. He went Super Saiyan. So yeah. it, it reminds me of the the Mega Man Two Robot Masters in Mega Man Three. Oh yeah, like they were, yeah, they were pushovers, and then in Mega Man Three, no longer pushovers. Well, Mega Man Three, they fought the same, but they were they were right. just more they harder. Were, yeah. But right here, Much the X Hunters, they, they they fight differently. Or Violent fought kind of similar, except he had those bricks, Mega Man reappearing, disappearing bricks or whatever appear and, and uh, to where he uses ball and chain to bounce off of there but uh, I forgot about Agal but Surges fights way differently this time They're like um, Piston Honda and Ball Bull in uh, Punch Out you oh, fight yeah, the second time they're much more yeah Mike Tyson the second time no I'm just kidding <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, Mike Tyson the second time would be freaking Drago from Rocky you know there is an actual Mike Tyson's uh, boxing on uh, whoa Oh, that Hell. was stupid. Let's just dash to the spikes. <laughs> There's a uh, Mike Tyson's boxing game on uh, PS1. There we wow. Really? Yeah. I haven't heard of that. It sucks. That's why you haven't heard of it. Because it sucks. Because it's, it's Sony. <laughs> it's Sony, that's why. Go ahead. You get to, the, the finishing move, you get to uh, bite people's ears off. I was just about to say that. Is there a code <laughs> to bite people's ears off? Finish him. Yeah, that's racist, guys. I like your ears. Racist. How racist. is that racist? Come on. Yeah, how's it racist, Ronnie? You said it was racist. Yeah, you said it was racist, J-Man. <laughs> sure. Here's what's not. Here's who's not racist. Mega Man. No, I think he is. Yes, he is. Yeah, this game is racist. What what black robot have you ever seen in any Mega Man game? <laughs> black Man? No. Black Man. I mean, yes. there, well, there's, uh, dang it, what was it? Yamato Man. I guess he's Japanese. I don't know. Yeah, they Native American and all that kind of stuff, but no blacks. Or... Yeah. What's, 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 what's with that? I think there, this game is sexist and... Uh, this series is sexist and racist until they Mega Man 9 when Splash Woman came. But still, she was the easiest. But they made her the weakest. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, she was, the easiest <laughs> to dom she was the easiest to dominate. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, that's racist, Capcom. I'm going to write a letter. 
Sexist. Yeah, but they're all robots. So? Why can't ro robots be black? Female robots can be hot. Stuff. Well, they can be black, but I don't, I don't know if they can be female or male. Really. So, well... Capcom has been sexist since the beginning. Hmm. It should yeah, have well, been called Mega Robot. We forgot about Roll. Yeah, but she was a cleaning bot. Yeah. <laughs> cleaning bot. Yeah. Exactly, so... Yeah, cute. they... Pretty sexist. Damn it, Capcom! Have more female robots and stuff. I must have it for my desire. I mean, for the yeah, exactly for the for the, for the view of how they should oh, be. Oh, oh. But that was what stupid. Was I guess I'll about? jump into the spikes. I was trying to use the, the burner to dash across there, but you needed the number two weapon. I got started over at the very beginning. After all that, come on. Well, that's Capcom for you. Sounds like Konami. They won't let you see the end if you beat the game on hard. Well, yeah, well, suck it. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> this uh, awesome music. Yes, but it's not Tim Foley. It's, it's not as, as better than, than Tim Foley. You no, you shut up. No, shut your mouth. Shut yeah. your whole mouth. And there's nothing that you can do about it. That, oh, yeah. Yes, there is, but I'll show you in the future. <laughs> In the future. <laughs> what you gonna do? What are you gonna do when I come for you? Um, run away. Yeah. Run away. <laughs> run away. <laughs> and what you gonna do, brother? As I doggy paddle off the Jersey Trump Towers, brother, or wherever he said they have you. Jersey Shore. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the Trump Plaza, brother, is that doggy paddle. <laughs> the Hulkamaniacs to shore, brother. Alright, let's try this again. Yes. Ah, uh, now I see. Whatever the heck was over there. I don't know what it is. I can't. I have all the items except for the Hadouken, but I don't know how to get that, and I don't care to get that. I think it's X Hunter Stage 3 anyway. Alright, here we go. The ECW battle against Sergey's. Surgery. Surgeries. I'm gonna need surgery after this battle. <laughs> um. Oh wait. Here we go. Nice. Whoa. So you gotta destroy these four things first before you can even hit him. Is that Doctor Wiley in there? Yeah. He's a robot now. Now. Dang, he's bouncing footballs at me. I don't know the weakness. I don't know the weakness, so I'm like, uh... Oh, that seems to be working. I think because I weakened it already with the X-Buster. Yeah, probably. <laughs> I think this works against him, uh, Surges himself. And, yeah, no sub-tanks. You know, now, Zero, this would be a good time to, like, reassemble yourself and help me. Please! Help, help your brother! Oh, uh, you're, yeah. you're gonna get it. No, that's not actually Pro Man's brother. Anyway. God dang it, I don't know my Mega Man history, okay? I'm sorry. Alright, hang up the call. Only people that know about Mega Man can be in this conference. <laughs> Only people uh, okay. that was born when this game came out. <laughs> <laughs> we got was born, like, he's like a year old. Oh. Oh yeah, they helped a lot. Alright, thank you, Randy Orton. I hear voices telling me I'm getting pwned. Use the bubble lead. I don't know. I'm not sure what to use. You know, I just do this. <laughs> Do the best I can. They can tell by the time running out that yeah, uh, you're gonna die. Who's gonna win? You save, uh, you, you save states. <laughs> no, I'm not yeah. safe. I never use any cheats or shortcuts in my LPs ever. You've used shortcuts before, liar. No, I, no, I see. No game doing. genie or anything like that. No oh, way. and there oh, we go. What a surprise! I get pawned. <gasps> As I will oh, try to get and part Ocho. So until then, God bless and take care. See ya. Bye bye. And yes, it had to be high pitch. <laughs> Welcome to Mega Man X2 Part Ocho. This is Ron Moore on with Detroit Lions Fan 93 and Nintendo Wii Points Guy 309. Yeah, go Owen 16. <laughs> go Nintendo. <laughs> All right, round three with Surges, and I mean round three because I also fought him at the 
toward the beginning of the game earlier when I was getting Zero's parts. And then I died against him in part seven, so here we go, in round three. He's gonna die this time. And uh, I went to YouTube to figure out the best strategy to beat Surges because I forgot how. It's been so long since I got to this part right here. Yeah. Oh, good job. We just got flagged because someone's like, hey, You need to walk through to do this? Oh, you're such a noob. I told this when yeah. I was two and a half years old. Yeah, yeah. I beat this when I was four. I need you no know, faggy walkthroughs. <laughs> oh, what do you say? What do you say, Dead Man? YouTube and schedules didn't exist back then. Well, yeah, we know, but just like now, they're gonna be complaining. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah, I know. I'm just saying they're not doing Let's Plays back then. Well, they were. Oh, back then, oh yeah. Okay, I get it. Yeah, when you're doing Let's Plays, you gotta know this shit right off the bat. Uh, stop me. I don't care. I just play whatever I feel like doing. I yeah, mean, too. Play through. Just play through the game. Be funny. Well, see, to me, a let's play is just playing the game. A play through, that's where, you know, you're expected to beat the game. Oh, yeah, that's me. But, you know, I just call let's play a, just a stupid name given to people because of, I don't know, it's, it's just stupid! Well, let's play, to me, can specify it as playing the game, whether you beat it or not. But if someone puts play through and you don't beat it, then I can see people complain about it. Well, I complete my games. That's the point. I always figure a walkthrough and playthrough to be informative and a let's play just for just complete and utter lulls. Well, I take the lulls of the let's play, but I just call it a playthrough because it's what I feel is best. Lulls play. Yeah, lulls play. And I never put... Yeah, lulls play. And I just beat a Surges. Yeah, Surges. Ding! All right, now get ready for X Hunter Stage Three. Oh, no more awesome music. Okay, now why does it always go back to the Maverick section of the map? Be sure to make an X Hunter map. I mean, it always goes back there and it makes it scrolls back up to the X Hunter Fortress. Well, yeah, that's where I'm at. So why'd you have to scroll back up the screen again? But anyway, I guess it had to do like a Doctor Wally entrance thing, where after you be a Doctor Wally stage, it shows a castle, plays the music again, and then. You start again. Yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't question Capcom too much. Yeah, because they're perfect. <laughs> um, yeah. Um, no, Konami's perfect, but, you know. Yeah, you have to be no. perfect to beat their games. No, oh, no. I'm sorry, you gotta beat the game on super difficulty hard to see the ending. No, you can't beat Active Enterprises is perfect. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this stage is a pain. I remember this now. Platforming controls are gonna drive me crazy. Assume Arbor's plat three platforming. It's the Sumo Arbor's three thing that if you face that direction it goes that way. Yeah. Yeah. Oh no, I got yeah, it. Kinda, it's kinda like what it is, yeah. Oh. I was gonna say no I got it. Sunsoft is perfect. Don't <laughs> debate, don't debate with that. I cut you. Moonhard. Moonhard is perfect. Mm, maybe. We got you cutting out. You're cutting out. I'm just kidding. <laughs> you cut it out. You I'll cut, cut it you out. out. Ooh. Ew. You you uh sew it in. No, I don't know. Never mind. Cut the cloth also. We'll have the SC2K knitting time one of these days. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. With this weird weird but awesome music. Eh, standard. You know, it's music. Ah, grr! I start over again. I go back down there and get the platform of death. We guy doesn't care about the music if it wasn't made by Sunsoft. Or Tim Fullen, you mean? Ah, oh, idiot! Ah, uh -huh. get jumping the spikes. <laughs> Ox from Stay by the Bell. <laughs> yeah, no. That fan, I have a love for all video game music. You just, you know, yes, I prefer Tim Fulton and Sunsoft and all that. Goody did this. Yeah, and I don't know why you do. Because it's just good. No, all that. Oh, you like Shadowgate 64 music. Shut up. Oh, you like Shadowgate 64. No. Yes. No, your your baby sister does. Huh, <laughs> that'd be funny. She walks in the room. Please, shout game six. Oh, shut up! I'll record. Start over again with the recording. Laws. 
<laughs> Even though you didn't, she didn't get caught in the microphone. I still want to do it over because lols. <laughs> Let's get these again. Try to fill up the so tanks here as much as I can. Yeah, I got one filled up. Yeah. Come on. Hooray for, ener hooray for energy grinding. Yeah. Should be Mega Man RPGs. Oh. Uh, what was that? It's battle called, Battle it's Network? Called Mega Man Battle Network. Oh, oh. yeah. Oh, yeah. That's... that's that sucks. It just sucks. <laughs> oh, things got my nerves. I don't know. I heard the first Battle Network was okay, but all the ones after that were terrible. Of course. Mega Man Battle of the Network Stars. Yeah, well, I don't know anything. Don't blame me. I just haven't played it, okay? Well, I haven't played it either. I don't really want to. Me neither. I mean... I can't... No. Maybe it's a good game, but I don't... I ain't care to... play it after finding out what kind of game it is and stuff. I mean, Mega Man and RPG... I don't know. Does that really mix? Well, Mario and R RPGs did mix. Yeah, well, your pancake doesn't mix. <laughs> nice. Grr, how you get up there if you can't get the platform up there? I forgot, it's been so long since I got this part. Use the one. Use your Jet Dog Rush to... Oh wait, no, this isn't like the original. I don't have it. That bow splash, I make you jump higher in the water, but would it do it on the air? And no, it won't. Those bubbles around me have voices in my head. Because <laughs> this game is driving me crazy. Let's try this again. This is hard. <laughs> oh, I was just thinking if Bear was here, he'd be like, "Yeah, yeah, yeah." <laughs> this is hard, <laughs> like me. <laughs> yeah. Oh, come on! That's probably gonna kill me though. Crush me right there. Ah, thanks. Someone has to call me during recording, and don't have to answer it later. <laughs> nice. All right. Real it's Megan Fox calling again. No, it's not. <laughs> Real life can't interrupt YouTube. Dang, it's Bear. How come you guys didn't do it? He just sent me IM a few minutes ago. I said, too late. We already started. Damn it, Bear. Too late. Yeah, too late. Hey, I like Mega Man X2. Yeah, but too late. You're too late. By the way, Ghost was on the other night. Ooh, nice. I don't get this. I don't get yeah, it. It's like, what the heck is that to do with anything? <laughs> Patrick Swayze. Patrick Swayze reference. Okay, I am stumped here. I'm about to go back to YouTube and find out what they do. I mean, if you, seriously, you can't fit the platform through there, so, I mean, yeah. Let me think. Um, let's think. Um, Lollos? This is even I am stumped. What are you supposed to do? Wait, wait a second. I think I got it. No, jump up. Yes. Oof. I hate when you realize that it actually is really simple to actually get up there. Yeah. Of course. No, you idiot! D dash jump! You uh, idiot! Don't jump down there! How stupid are you? Uh -huh. Lulz. No, you idiot! <laughs> What? <laughs> oh, that's pathetic. Come on. Oh, Alright, well. there, it's frozen. Hey, hey, hey. What is here? <laughs> that's stupid. In real life, if you pause life, nothing would disappear like that. Oh. Hey, 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 hey. Don't blame the sprite for the gamer's misjudgments, okay? <laughs> no, it is a sprite. I mean, how are you going to break something like that? If you stay on top of it, it won't break, but you barely hit it. Yeah, stay on top Come of it. Come on. Oh. i break it again, so because I, I couldn't... I didn't have in the right position there. Oh, that was walls. Oh, come here, bat. There you go. Yeah, that was bat shit. It's crazy. <laughs> Drop me, batty. I'm Batman. No. That only works in my LP. <laughs> oh, this game's LPing me off. Yeah. LPOS. Or... <laughs> or LPO'd. Yeah, there we go. LPO'd. <laughs> The LPO, NWO, no. Doing your wrestling. <laughs> Points for reference? Coming soon, Mega Man Wrestling. MWO, Mega Man World Order. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
There we go, that works. No, come on! Alright, there's Will Gator enemies now. I don't know. Yes, game has got a few bugs in it. <laughs> Alright, come on, and... Ow! Oh, okay, hey, well, thanks for helping me there. I got maybe invincible for a second. Ooh, it's so anticipating. Don't get in my way unless you want to get burned. Oh, okay. I guess I won't get burned, but ah, I still made it. You, you're a winner. <laughs> yeah. Final boss time yet? Not final boss, but this is the third and final X Hunter boss, Agile. A Agile? Yeah, Argyle from Dahard or Agile, whatever you want to call him, I don't care. <laughs> Ow! And I forgot the weakness to this. And Agile, of course, a uh, totally different form than the first battle. Randy Orton pose! Yeah, that helped a lot. I hope the things from stop falling on you. Yeah. It feels like an I'm gonna be the guy kind of thing. <laughs> No, hit, shoot the thing, don't run into it. Whoa, oh, watch out for the Top Gun missiles. Now on the Super Nintendo. <laughs> now I'm playing oh. with power, Super Power. <laughs> yeah. Ow, now I'm playing with Ponage. <laughs> no, oh, good oh. gameplay there. <laughs> well, hopefully I'll beat it in part 9. Until then, God bless and take care. See ya! Mm -hmm. Welcome to part 9 of Mega Man X2 as I restart this battle where I got pwned last time. This is Ron Warren along with We Got Through Anon. Yep, it's just a me, a wee guy. So yeah, I went on YouTube and figured out a strategy here. Ow! Let's go. Ouch! So, so got, yeah. So who's this guy again? <laughs> Agile. Oh, oh, guy. Oh! Ooh. Got hit with the Top Gun missile. Oh. Look out. So yeah, Guile here, yeah. I got this weirdo. Yeah. What the hell is he in? Some capsule. Yeah. Oh, Mega Man X and their machines or whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Whoa. Oh! Oh! You're getting home. Oh, but he got home. No! This cannot be! Master! Avenge me! Hmm, Master? Master Sword? I wonder who he's talking about. Master Hand. <laughs> no. Master! Master! Master Puppets! Oh. I don't know the words. Master! Master Puppets! No, it's not how it goes. Oh, Mega Man. The Mega Man. Metallica fan, what's he gonna play me now? I don't care. What are they going to do? What are they going to do? Blame. All right. <laughs> now, going to the final, I guess, con no, almost final stage. I guess it is, but you got battle all the Mavericks again, and we are not going to look at that. We're going to skip that and go. So after this, skip that, then go to what happens after that, after be all the Mavericks. Sigma reveals himself. What a shocker as the boss of the game. <gasps> Sigma's alive the whole time. What? Well, that was a... It uh, seems that the X-Hunters have failed, but don't worry. I don't know this how he talks or not. I have arranged for some new toys for you to play with. Sounds like appropriate voice acting, if this has voice <laughs> acting. Good thing Bear's on this video. i play with toys. <laughs> I'll play with myself. <laughs> Alright, now we're back in Magma Centipede stage. Again? Yeah, I guess the central computer stage or something, uh, where... Uh, Maverick headquarters or something's at. So we go through this part like we did last time we were in the stage. Watch out for the Metal Gear Solid searchlights. <laughs> oh, crap. <laughs> Shut up. Dun, 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 dun. Oh. Watch out for the Tetris blocks. Tetris rejects more like it. <laughs> it's Mecha Tetris. That's what this should be. But really, you skipped all those Mavericks and like the... Yeah. <laughs> like, why'd you do that? Oh, I guess, yeah. Well, I mean, because we've seen the battles before. I mean, just watching the same thing. Yeah, well, if you're a true Mecha Man fan, you would have done that. Oh. Mecha Man? Me Mecha Man, oh no. 
And here's Sigma and his new body. Good body. And there's, whoa, Emo Zero. Look <laughs> yeah, what I found wandering around, Mega Man. Look at his face, Sigma's small face. Smirk. <laughs> he's best alone, Smirk. It seems that you let him die, and he's not too happy about that. Who? Cool. <laughs> now I think it is time that he repays the favor. Repays the flavor. Ooh, chocolate. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, we got Pwn. Ah, the real Zero has come to life. Finally. About time. See, if you didn't get Zero's parts, then I would have to fight Zero right there. But I don't have to since I got all Zero's parts, and the real Zero has come to life. Cheater! Oh, wait, that's part of the game. <laughs> <laughs> wait, Zero! I know your secret! You were designed to follow me! Maybe so, but I still don't like you. <laughs> oh cheesy dialogue. Fine. If you will not follow me, then I'll watch you die. You will die. Once again. Welcome to die. Oh, wait. Zero! Sorry to keep you waiting. Mega Man X, the greetings will have to wait. Oh, so he is Mega Man X called Mega Man X. <laughs> We've got to defeat all the Mavericks, including Dirk Nowitzki. <laughs> I'll take out the main computer, and you follow Saigme. Let's go. Let's go. Why are they called Mavericks? Why can't they just call Robot Masters Mavericks or whatever? Make sure the Mavericks don't win the playoffs this year. Ah, uh, it could be like the New England Patriots, but that was like two years ago or whatever. Oh yeah. By the New York Giants. Oh, wait a minute. You said straight ahead is down there. All right, here we go. Whoa, okay, I'm about to die, I guess. Ah! It's like two marbles three after you defeat the airship. Whoa. Yeah. Where's the magic wand? Oh, wait. Cool boss battle music. You are merely a bothersome insect to make him an X. The robot. It's it is about time that I crush you beneath my heel. So he's a heel, not a face. Wolf. Ah, Wolverine now. Yes, Sigma Wolverine. I think the Sonic the Hedgehog Slicer is a weakness. Ow! Mega Minute, what is the secret to your power? It's the Maverick powers. <laughs> Thank you, Jeff. Alright, uh, what's oh, look out. Oh! Wasn't supposed to be him, but whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Sound like him. You know what? This ain't on Genesis because it's not good enough. I mean, we had Dr. Wily's Revenge, which was a remake of the first three, and wasn't even that good. But still. Revenge. Yeah, yeah Revenge. So, I don't know. Ooh. Oh, grr. I think it's a good one. Yeah, where's the Will Wolverine at? They don't see what's up. He's in uh, his own NES game, composed music by Geoff Foyne. <laughs> like Jeff Foyne, uh, yeah. whatever. <laughs> Geoff, Jeff, uh, whatever. I'll call him like Jeff now. Just to please you or whatever. Please you. Ugh, that doesn't sound right. Bear, good thing Bear's not here. <laughs> gonna please him? <laughs> Oh, Pwn! <laughs> right in midair. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Super Swan Dive. Oh. Alright, we have to beat a Sigma once again. Still charging. Yep. Oh, wait a minute. What the hell? Oh, ah, man. Andros! Oh. Fighting the, the Sigma virus now. <laughs> yeah, this, yeah, Sigma virus are like Sigma... You gotta, you gotta equip the Norton antivirus software now. <laughs> Yeah, oh, get, look out. get the AVGN stuff, I mean, AVG. AVG, <laughs> yeah. He's angry video game. Antivirus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but look, it's more yeah I notice he has no energy bar, so... I can tell if he's losing. Well, he's starting to change color. Well, it's because you don't have Slippy, like in Star Fox. You need Slippy to have the life bar for the boss stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Not Star Fox 64, but that looks like an Andros head rip off here, except he's more holographic. Like in the original yeah. Star Fox, where it's all holographic. Red Wolf! Red Wolf alert! Red Wolf <laughs> alert! No. <laughs> well, look out. And yes, the wire sponge is the weakness. Wire sponge? As he throws up all over me. <laughs> I don't think he's doing it. I want to hear that, Ronnie. Anyway, uh... Alright. Oh! Let's turn dark blue now. Let's turn emo. You got the blues, Sigma? Oh, shit. I have the blues when I beat you. You mean black and blue. That's racist. Oh! 
Hey. That's why I can run my Rush's mouth. <laughs> Alright, round two. As he shakes off bugs or something. I don't know what he's trying to do out there. <laughs> he's a wacky head. Yeah. I can't play the ball. I'm feeling... Well, he's using his head. Oh. Yeah, he sure has a... Um, damn it, I can't have a good fun. As Angel would say, he he'll get a head in life. Oh, man. of course. I don't want to butt heads with this guy. Damn it, I can't, how come I can't think of these puns? <laughs> I'm not a punter, that's why. <laughs> oh, he oh, heads up! <laughs> yeah. I was going to say one, but I think it would be lame, so forget it. Forget it! <laughs> it's over! This guy's hard-headed. Hey, Ron, you're making me look bad. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's holographic. Oh, and oh. I win that one. What's up? Ah, oh, I'm getting a headache during this fight. <laughs> yeah, Mega Man. Yeah, this should be Mega Headman X2 or whatever. <laughs> Headman. I wonder if he headbangs. Just shut your head. <laughs> <laughs> I want to like spear some butt head. Okay, that was lame. Uh, I, I ran out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, definitely right there. He's a glowing and orange. He turned head. orange. Yeah, orange. <laughs> and, uh, something. Uh oh, now he's getting mad. Rage. Awesome boss bound music right here. One of my favorites ever. Really? <laughs> yeah. Well, it ain't Bol Tim Bolin. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, Jim Crockett. I think the composer's name. No, I'm just kidding. I just made that up off the top of my head. Um. Oh, no. Uh oh. Now he's really ticked off. Uh oh. Ah, teleportation. Oh. Okay, I'm about to get him. Don't die. I'm gonna sub tanks. Oh, idiot! Stop throwing up all over the place. <laughs> Anorexic. Oh crap! He's got me trapped. Oh, oh, I got him too. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure it was interesting, but it seems kind of weak. Final boss here, if that's what this is, right? Final boss? No way, I, awesome bo final boss battle. No, I'm not saying that it, it's just, it seems like, well, I haven't seen the third one, or much of the first one, I forgot, but this one seems like the weakest. I don't know. Shut your mouth. Okay, I will. Mega Man X, I have lost you again. Each defeat only makes me stronger, and serves to bring you closer to your ultimate doom. Oh, like Ganondorf. <laughs> but... Something is not right. I don't quite understand. What did Zillo? Zillo? He is last of the Doctor's creations. Which Doctor is he talking about there? Anyway... <laughs> Sounds like Bear's Death Cross something. Or go. Sloth. Yeah. Okay, this was a cool boss battle. I'm just... I don't know. Meh. <laughs> hey, shut your mouth. It's I'm a fanboy of this boss battle. <laughs> yeah, sure. You could be a fanboy of a boss battle. Uh, because? Alright. I'm a fanboy I'm a fanboy of this ending music right here, I'll tell you that. Yeah, pretty cool. Uh, looks like Sega CD quality right here. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it is. Watch. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, something right behind Zero conveniently in the certain place. Okay, never mind. Excuse the whole moroticness. <laughs> I'm hinting it. Oh uh, yeah. Joined There's... by his friend Zero, Megman X gazed gazes over the sea. Fail. Dang it! Messed up the dramatic ring theater. Sigme has once again been destroyed. But X, I thought it was Mega Man X, wonders if the fighting will truly end. Was Dr. Dark's dream of a world in which reploids and humans live together in peace really a dream? Was yeah. he trying to rip off Professor X here? Was this Inception or something? What's going on? <laughs> I don't know. I just want to shut up now and listen to music. Price of Peace? Talked over the best part. Dang it, Kevin, stop sending me an instant message during the commentary. I can't see what's going on, okay. I'm getting messages too. What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> Reality? Yeah, I knew it. This is like Inception. Damn it. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Real similar to the ending to X. Awesome ending music, and he stands looking over the sea. 
with Mega Man. They're like a couple. <laughs> that was stupid. The future holds the answers. Or does the past? And, and, and the next 20 sequels await. They only made up to X8. I oh, know, I'm just exaggerating there for effect. Thanks for ruining it, Mr. Technical. Shut up, Mr. Hyperbole, or Hyperbole, whatever. <laughs> anyway, stay tuned for part 10, which will be the less discussed of Mega Man 2. So until then, God bless and take care. See ya later. Welcome to Let's Discuss Mega Man X2. This is the ending credits right here. And oh wait, yeah, that's right. I'm here with We Guy three hundred nine. Mm-hmm. Back again solo. Yeah. So as we take as we take a look at the uh, ending credits here, I guess we can kind of go ahead and get started in the actual Let's Discuss since we've seen the ending. This is just the credit ending. Yeah, I don't get these names. What? Uh, those are like the uh, enemies throughout the whole game. The little ro- little tiny robots and all that. Oh. Because see, they 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 uh, they're afraid. They learned a lesson from the Metroid fanboys, you know, and like, well, we better name each little character and make sure we get the names right on here. We don't want to get flamed for not knowing <laughs> the name of every uninspired character. Fan service. <laughs> Unnecessary fan service. Yeah. For the names of everything. Fish urn. Jelly Seeker? Disc Boy? <laughs> a bear would be like, oh, it should be Dick Boy. Oh. <laughs> Wait. Saber Moon? Silver Moon? Sailor Moon? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, this, now they're showing the uh, stats of the Mavericks. Hmm. It's kind of like uh, Metal Combat, Dark Adventure, they show the stats of the uh, STs. And probably no one, knows, no one knows what I'm talking about because that game is very underrated. Everyone who watches the stats, this, the stats of SCTK? No, ST, stand, standing tank. Uh, okay, uh, anyway, uh... If you grew up and played Battle Clash and Metal Combat on the Super Scope on the Super Nintendo, maybe you would know. Jeez, God, you're such an idiot! <laughs> I was playing games like Mario World, Mario Kart, F-Zero, and Mega Man X2. You I know, mean, those games are awesome too. You just were unlucky to get them. It's X2 like, came out, like, way after Battle Clash. <laughs> what was X2? Man. X2 came out in 94. About, yeah, Battle Clash was 1992. Yeah. Okay, wait, wait, I thought it came out in 91, same year as Super... I thought it was a launch title. Wait, it wasn't a launch title? No. Well, when did the Super Scope come out then? 1992, I think. Oh, yeah, duh, it had to if Battle Clash came out. But anyway. And Zero tells us, thanks for playing. Yay. Presented by... Capcom. Yeah, X2, to say the least, is a real awesome freaking ECW game. Yeah, I played this when I was in junior high, and I mean, yeah, EC freaking W. Um, I mean, the graphics is real awesome. The uh, the background of each Maverick stage, especially stages like uh, Wire Sponge, um, Crystal Snail, and I believe Will Gator. Will Gator, again, reminds me of the of, uh, of Rampage. Well, you're on a giant alligator dinosaur tank or something, and it's like rolling through the city. You see all these buildings in the background. And now this game came with a uh, – I had to do some research because I forgot what it's called. I think Nintendo Power Magazine said that the game came with a certain special – I don't know if it's graphics enhancement chip or something. Some sort of special chip uh, in this cart. Uh, I, get, I think it enhanced the game play experience on uh, like the sound and, and visuals. <laughs> I don't know. I had to... X, the first one. <laughs> What's the I difference? don't know. I don't know. I mean, I had to go do research on that. I mean, that was a long time ago when I read that Nintendo Power magazine, so, I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's a Super Nintendo version of the expansion pack. Heck, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, uh, and the music in this game, freaking awesome. Pretty much uh, every stage in this game has awesome music, except for Magna Centipede. I think that song kind of sucks. Um, well, Gators is kind of eh, all right. Uh, boss battle music not as good as the boss battle music in X. Um, as far as the final battle with Sigma, uh, I mean it's kind of hard to say which is better. X it had a uh, like a ghouls and ghosts type boss battle of uh, the final battle with Sigma, uh, and then this Sigma right here. You fight like a computer virus hologram type Andros ripoff or whatever we gotta call it <laughs> yeah, exactly. of uh of Sigma. Um 
but it was still a pretty cool battle. Cool final boss battle music too. Just like in X, I don't know which one's better, but it was still awesome. Uh, very freaking challenging game. I mean, the game was to me is harder than X, and there's a lot more items to collect. I think. Oh well, maybe it's the same. Uh, no, you got to collect zero parts this time. Uh, you didn't have to do that in X because he was alive until like toward the end where he died. But um, yeah, and yeah, so I mean, this game is freaking awesome. I have to give it a 9.5 out of 10. Let's see who's next. Um, we got. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh gee, yeah. Who else is here? We need to go to them first, though. But uh, no, I have not played this game at all. I uh, wait. Was I in the original Mega Man X? Let's discuss. Uh, don't remember. I gotta go I back and look. Don't remember either? I don't know, but yeah, I, I I have played the first one. I remember having it. Strangely, I do have that memory, but I only played like a little bit. And uh, here, I I haven't played X two at all. The only thing I know is you know the soundtrack, of course. And uh, looking, judging here, you know, the game is looks pretty epic. I could I say that Mega Man X is probably better. A little bit. I don't know. I just have that feeling because I, you know, haven't played this one. But uh, you know, like you know, e- music is ECW, of course. Not as good as original, of course, but still good. Graphics look good, the same as the original. But there's that super enhanced chip thing, I mean, FX chip or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I think it's FX, chi- FX chip. I don't know. Uh, no, that's not. I, mean, I, I got to do research on that, or someone post a comment if you know what the heck I'm talking about. Uh, but anyway. Um, you said you heard people say X and X3 is good, X2 is what was lame. So, yeah, they say X2 is at, we guess. After watching this LP, though, would you agree with him? I don't know. It's, I don't know. I really have to, like, have a marathon. Like, actually get the games again and play them. Like, in a yeah, marathon and just see, then see which one's better. I mean, it's best to play and then have your opinion. Because even though I still yeah. say this, sort of, well, I didn't say that's just what most people say. Opinion still doesn't even freaking matter, even though I still say it, even though I've never played it. Since that's my rule. If I don't play it, or if I haven't played it, then my opinion doesn't matter, but I have one anyway, so... I don't know. <laughs> I'm all confused. <laughs> I'm compuzzled today. No. But, uh... I mean, this game... You know, it has an NA score, because, like I said, I have to play the game in order to give it a score, but, uh... You know, it still looks pretty epic. I'll definitely have to try and check it out. And definitely you two people, do it now. Yeah, do it. Do it now. Alright, what do you say, Star Soldier? Oh, yeah! Star Soldier 1 here again. I'm here doing a special video here for Ron Moore, J-Man, Wee Guy, and Bear, and all those guys, because, yeah, they're talking about the awesome Mega Man X2. Yeah, this cool sequel to the 1994 original. Yeah, it's pretty much the same game as before, but I still love it on its own right, you know? Back then, I was pretty good at Mega Man, so I was kind of hesitant to like drop 60, 70 bucks on a new game, so I always rented the Mega Man X series, but I still have a good recollection of renting those games and having a lot of fun doing it. Oh yeah, you go home, rent the game, try to finish it, try to learn all the secrets about the bosses, all that good stuff. It's what a good Mega Man game should be. <laughs> huh. And, you know, Mega Man X2 is no different. But, at least Capcom tried to make some innovations with the series. Oh man, I remember being such a fan of Mega Man X that I actually drew this when I was younger. Back in 1994. Yep, this is why I did it. Like, pencil crayons and old pencils and all that. See? Yep, look at that. <laughs> See, I'm nuts for these games. I was nuts back then, I'm still nuts for them now. Uh, and Mega Man X2, I didn't do a painting for that, but eh, I still love it all the same because that game introduced something new to it, the special SPS chip to it where it had all new 3D visuals. Yeah, I remember seeing that first boss he completed on that, yeah, first easy stage, seeing how huge it was, seeing how it looked on my 3D, very cool. And, yeah, you could see this sort of uh, line 3D graphics throughout the entire game. And if you look on the bottom of the cartridge itself, those of you who had to use cartridges, I don't know. (laughs) 
you know, rum more. <laughs> uh, I can't get in there. Uh, anyways, if you look on the bottom of the cartridge, it actually has a special chip inside it. Yeah, kind of like the Star Fox or, you know, Yoshi's Island chip where, yeah, it uses some vents, 3D effects that are not standard in most Super Nintendo games. You know, Capcom didn't need to do that, but <laughs> it was nice of them for to add some extra to the standard Mega Man X gameplay. Because we all know what a Mega Man game is. It's going to be the same as last year's game, so to speak. It was like that for the old Nintendo games. And now it's like that for Super Nintendo games. Well, at least, yeah, Capcom adds something new to it, and that's why I love it. Uh, and another cool feature is that you have to rescue Zero's you know, parts from these three unknown robots that are hunting Mega Man X down because now that Mega Man X is a big hero, he's the uh, main Maverick Hunter trying to, you know, crush this Maverick Rebellion and boom, he, he's a real badass and you can't mess with him. But now in this game, yeah, the robots are revolting and going right after Mega Man X. They know he's a big threat. And yeah, make Mega Man look all powerful now. Or X, or whatever it how his name is now. <laughs> yeah, so you felt more like a badass. You had your speed boots right from the beginning. So at least there was some continuity with this new game here. Yeah, you could either choose to fight these three guys went midway through the game, or you could just ignore the challenge altogether and just go after the eight bosses and then challenge the <laughs> main Sigma stages. I guess it's no secret. Yeah, Sigma is going to be the main end boss in this game as well. But it's cool because at least, you know, he changes it up and he actually looks like a virus this time because the whole 3D visuals and what they use with the line vector graphics here. <laughs> I just have it as my website. Plus, I like to do that when it's on here. But anyways, back on topic. Yeah, Mega Man X2 is a short game, but it's a great game. And it does have that replay value where you can replay stages over again to see where now you can get better, finish them faster, go for the free robots that are getting in your way, get the zero parts, you know, and make sure you find all of Dr. Light's special abilities that he hidden throughout the game. Yeah, it's still a great game, again, nothing revolutionary, but if you love your Mega Man, you definitely gotta get it. I still got it on the Mega Man X GameCube Hero Collection. Seven games in one, baby. Highly recommend it. Yeah, you can't go wrong with seven awesome games like that. Battle Chase is not so good, but <laughs> yeah, you got the Mega Man S series. Yeah, a bit more adult than the regular Mega Man games, but still fun as hell. All right, this is Star Soldier One. Thank you guys for letting me join in on this uh, little discussion here because Mega Man S Two deserves it. Yeah. Okay, Star Soldier over and out. Alright, thanks, Star Soldier, for your input. And I guess that is it. We're out of here on Ron Moore. Man, we got three and nine. Star Soldier, just your assistant. God bless and take care. See ya. Welcome to Let's Play Mega Man X Thrace. This is Ron Moore along with J Man 46241 and Bear 13. Did you say Thrace? Yo, yo, yeah. yo. Yep. Red Supre. Did you say Rice? Rich, Rich, you Thrace. Yeah, okay. No, let's play Rich, you pray. No, uh. <laughs> let's um, Rich, you pray. And yeah, Mega Man X3, uh, not my favorite in the series. Uh, I like X2 better, but, uh, this game is still pretty cool for the stuff it has in it. And, um, I mean, here's, of course, the storyline right here. I guess, once again, Mavericks are going insane. And taking over, uh,. Mega Man Land or wherever they're at. Uh, Doppler Town. They're going after the Doppler radar. Yeah, Do yeah. Doctor Doppler radar. Doctor Doppler. Despite the fact that he's been dead for a long ass time. <laughs> <laughs> we want your Doppler radar secrets. <laughs> they're being yeah, Mega Man X3, old guy. <laughs> yeah, so Mega Man X3. Eh, I mean, even though not my personal favorite, still ECW. Like a Dr. Wily robot. 
So I guess apparently yeah. Doctor Doppler, Doctor Doppler is uh the uh, bad guy, <laughs> or the one that created the Mavericks. These these eight Mavericks are about to face. Made a step up from Doppler radars. <laughs> yeah. Awesome now intro they'll, music here. They'll detect the weather and they'll kill you. <laughs> D, Dr. Deucebag. A hey, nice graphics right here. Da, 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 okay, da. let's go. A few hours later, the storyline like... still plays. <laughs> and the doll story continues. It's like the beginning of Mega Man X1, kind of. Yeah, it does. And all action. And mosquito robots. Maverick Hunter headquarters is being attacked by mosquito robots. Queen Bee robots. How about you be quiet? Why are none of those shots hitting any of those robots? Like, they all miss. Because they were trained by the, the Star Wars Stormtroopers. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, here we go with the awesome top screen of Mega Man X3. Made by Capecom. Capecom, apparently there's some kind of company, I've heard, that likes capes and comms. And combs. They like to comb. In socks. <laughs> More horrible shots that miss. Oh, finally! Oh, finally got there one. Go. Oh, there. now they're now they're talking. Evidently, they're also trained by guys in space mutiny who occasionally could take a shot. I'll clear out the enemies out here. <laughs> <laughs> I'll clear them out and put them in there. There you go, go fight the one stage? inside, and then after I get all... Yeah. What? Uh, anyway. No. You know what makes me mad? Is Mega Man gets that big life bar by the end of the first game. First Mega Man X. He goes in the second one, and it's that little bitty life bar again. And then once again, little life bar. Yeah, it's like, keep your upgrades. But you Does know, he it's just like fun. hide him again? You know, he's like, I don't need these. I want to hide them again. Well, you know, and like, he goes off to some kind of remote planet. Uh, well, wherever the ending was. And then he walks. But then he trips. And all of his power-offs fall off down into a <laughs> sewage drain. <laughs> anyway, I guess this is Toby Mac or Little Mac. Paralyzing Mega Man here. And this opening intro music, unlike the first two X games, is not as epic as the first two X games. Still sounds pretty good. Yeah, it sounds okay. Yeah. It's to me, to me, in many different aspects, the music. So it really made me think this game is just anti-climatic compared to X2. What? It's anti-climatic? What? <laughs> <laughs> Sounded kind of like a F-Zero song. Now, this, this is what's real cool about the game. You get to play a Zero finally. Yay. Which one's awesome that? zero. He has awesome intro music. Now, do you have the, the sword attack thingy? Yes, yes, you do. Sweet. Does it come with cheese? See, he keeps his big life bar. Yeah. Take notes, Mega Man. Yeah, really. <laughs> That's because he's not much. Of, he's smarter than Mega Man. <laughs> he knows to avoid sewage drains. But he's always getting, like, almost killed all the time. Oh, now it's Mega Man's turn. Oh my god, it's raping him! There's Mac. Destroy him real quick. Save Mega Man. Took you longer to save Mega Man than it did to kill the guy. <laughs> Stupid game. I'm tired of saving your butt, X. You need to step up the game. I'm sorry, X. I didn't mean it. <laughs> I'll go clear out <laughs> some more enemies. <laughs> T 
All right, here's the the first boss of the game. Who apparently can turn it into absolute darkness. And just like in X2, we fight a giant boss to begin the game. That's freaking easy. It's Doctor Robotnik. <laughs> Looks kind of like a samurai, Dr. Robotnik. Yeah. He still goes down like a pussy. <laughs> yeah. Cool. That explosion did not justify the ease of destroying him. <laughs> I'm here to f- Ah, hell. You already beat him. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go back and clear out the enemies again. <laughs> Don't call. <laughs> call me if you need me. What's your number? Oh, I gotta go. No time. Yeah. You know, all this time when he's supposedly clearing out enemies, he's probably just at like the dive bar. There's a number to call right. him with. No. Uh. All right. So that's D the end of part one. D what? D Okay. Save it for okay, part anyway, two. See you in part two. God bless and take care. Later. See ya. Welcome to Let's Play Mega Man X3 Part 2. This is Ron Moore. I'm on with We Got 309 and Barrett 13. Yo. Mm-hmm. And the first Maverick I'm going to fight is a giant D or douchebag. <laughs> Did you know? <laughs> Here is Bear 13. Bear 13. Did you know that the the dude who came up with cornflakes was a fucking doctor? <laughs> what? Anyway, back to actual <laughs> game. Yeah, that cornflakes. Typically, he was he was the head runner of uh, corn and flakes. Um, <laughs> well, here's a true story right here. Um, this music right here for the stage. I was playing this game over a friend's house, and then his mother walked into the room and yelled, Y'all turn that down! It sounds like a freaking funeral parlor in here! Tuh. I would be like, Screw you, yeah. bitch! It's Mega Man video game music! Tim Foley! <laughs> no, it's Tim not Fallen, Tim Foley, but didn't. he's awesome. <laughs> uh, I mean, this music sounds like, it's like, it does sound like you're in a funeral parlor or something. I'm waiting for Paul Bear to come out, raise his urn, and have the urn taker fight you. Mm -hmm, Paul Bear 13? Yeah. I can't hear the music, so I'm just gonna assume it goes do 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 little do 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 little do do. I'm gonna tell you to mute the entire video. That's not funeral music. That's circus music. That is ice cream truck music. Whatever music. That's the pedophile. It's not Tim Foley music. I'll tell you that. I wish. Foley was a pedophile. You're a pedophile. I know Bear 13. Dear God, I hope Tim Foley doesn't find this video and sue me for slander. Yeah. His YouTube channel is going to flag this channel. And he's going to write some awesome music about how, about how much of a jackass I am. How is that possible? Awesome? <laughs> it's not like an actual song. He doesn't write lyrics or anything. It's just a catchy tune. You're so st it's stupid! STUPID! Anyway, I'm trying to get, uh... A Son. I'm trying to get a Dr. Light power up here. And also a sub tank, and I have to go back and, and try again. Oh, idiot! Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The power up, the power up is down there in the death pit. Yeah. Yeah. He's gonna ask a question, but I'm like, no, it's a stupid question because you know, he's gonna ask, what's so different about this from Mega Man like X, like the original? Because like, I don't know. It's just like I know it's different because you know different Mavericks and stuff, but it's like it's pretty much the same as like X except new Mavericks. Are there really well, different, changes you know, Mega Man game. Different, I mean, every, every Mega Man game is pretty much the same as, like, Star Soldier said and Let's Discuss, but, I mean, it's like, uh, besides different Mavericks and stuff, different stage environments, also, uh, like, different, well, the upgrades are kind of different, too, like, I don't know much about X4, 5, 6, and 7, and 8, but, but X, X2 and X3, you get some, uh, I think some different upgrades, like the, uh, double X Buster and X2, and then on here, um, you get like a different kind of dash jump where you can actually jump higher in the air. Um, and you also get a hel helmet upgrade, which is like a radar detector later on in the game. I think you get it in Tunnel Rhino stage. So 
So, I mean, and then, of course, different boss battles and stuff, different strategies to beat the game. I'm wondering what order to beat the Mavericks in and all that stuff. So, yeah, I mean, it's still kind of some different some different variety there or whatever. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, because some people can mistake this as, you know, the Mega Man X or X2, as, you know, some games are like that. Or, uh, I was well, like, that's... X4, because I'm like, isn't this X X2? It's like, no, it's X3, but it looks the same! Well, that's why they read the title on the cover box. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Ronnie. What? I have an extremely, <laughs> extremely important question about this game. Okay. How do pop tarts work? <laughs> okay, anyway, um... This Dr. Light music right here is even... The lamest one out of all three Dr. Light upgrade songs so far. Sounds like two funeral parlors. <laughs> you can't even hear it, your volume is muted. Yeah. But it, it sounds like... Bedtime music. Hi, X. I want to give you a teddy bear to go to sleep with tonight. I mean, come on. <laughs> Weird. The one in X1 was the most epic one. So Part two. In X2, it was. <laughs> and here it's. Nighty night. Well, that's just that theme, but I take it you like the Mega Man X soundtrack the best out of the three. Yeah, well, I mean, I'm not talking about the whole soundtrack. I'm talking about the Dr. Light upgrade music in particular. Yeah, I know, but I'm guessing that maybe you like the original of the Super Nintendo trilogy here, of X2 and 3. Maybe. Maybe yeah. so. Maybe um, I think, too, this one or the third one, I think, for me, but I don't know. There we go. I get the sub tank now, as I just demonstrated my new power up, where you can, like, kind of double jump. Yeah, double jump in, in the air. Because now I'm going to be the guy on uh, Hosser. Hey, yeah. <laughs> Man, this this stage is hard. Yeah, because it's ice hard. <laughs> Ow! Come on. Yeah, yeah. This stage is cold, man. Watch out. Ah! See? Oh. This stage is awfully frigid. <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Don't be so cold. It's about time you said something that makes sense. Yeah. Shut up, wee guy. Shut up, Ron. <laughs> Just because I'm your son now, don't mean you can boss me around. I want cornflakes now. <laughs> Son, go get me some cornflakes. <laughs> okay. Just try and kick that masturbating habit. <laughs> really? That's... I don't, I don't know. I remember that's reading that. Teacher, that. That's a true story in psychology class. My teacher taught me, taught us, that either Frosted Flakes or cornflakes were created to discourage masturbation. Cornflakes. How? Because of it. Because I don't know. Of, hang on, hang on. Let me explain. It's because sweet and spicy foods invoke passion. Bland food like corn and corn flakes do not. Oh, really? It's based on oh, so it's based on food that we masturbate. That's just great. I don't know. It's all just chemicals. Yeah. And, and to see the new subscribers who are watching this, they're thinking, "Wow, I did not expect to hear about masturbation in a Mega Man vi uh, video commentary." It's SC2K. It's supposed to be random. I know. Yeah, Let the no new members know that. He's anyway. <laughs> right. Oh man, here's a Blizzard Buffalo. Oh. Oh. Oh, wait a minute. Oh. 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 He's oh, yeah. gonna kick your ass before he uh, goes to ship uh, Buffalo Wild Wings. Yes. <laughs> and yeah. you got game over, so I gotta start over. Oh wow. Game over again. Yeah. It's just safe. Yeah, we have plenty more. Up. We have Shut up. more uh, <laughs> time to talk about masturbation. No, but this is new because they're definitely the boss. You know, stage was expanded. It's not just a small screen. Apparently, it's a whole almost stage. Yeah, with the longest intro right there. I know. So where are we now? I know we're the top of the year, but like the place. Uh, 21 XX. I don't know. Uh oh. Um, at the same place. It's the same stage again. No, I'm talking about the setting in the game. I mean, I know the year, but no, I don't know the year. But I don't but like this, uh, the game, the whole game is taking place on a certain island, and uh... Just like every Mega Man game, different parts of the Earth or universe, I guess, I don't know. Who cares? You're the I one that's talking about... Uh, I remember in Doom, you go, oh, who cares about the storyline? It's all about the gameplay, and now you're asking about, where's it take place at? Oh, oh. We got well, it simple just for Doom. Okay. Well, you can have it thought that, you know, in Doom, oh, you're on some kind of hell moon, and that's basic, but Mega Man, it's like, futuristic 3000 XXX or something. And By the way, it was Mars in Doom. Mars, oh. moon, it's all the same freaking thing, you masturbator. Yeah. It's the Bay Area. Oh, Oregon, or same thing. <laughs> Origami. <laughs> oh, it's oh like, wait, wait a minute. Oh, one of down here. 
Well, they can leave. Uh, maybe yes for another time later on the game. Yeah. Uh, shut up with your foreshadowing. <laughs> I really don't know right there. I'm serious. I haven't played this game. F X next two next three. This is the game I really suck at, and I mean I have to, I'm really gonna have to go on YouTube and look at some. Uh, let's play it now. I mean I'm 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 real familiar with X, kind of familiar with X two, and this one is one I really I've, I've beaten the game that was like years and years ago, and it's like the hardest one out of X next two next three in my opinion. Mm, yeah, it's planned around the third time around. Yeah, here we go. That's because I know what to do now. What what to watch out for? And I got all the uh, the power ups in this level. You get killed again, don't you? <laughs> we'll have to find out. No spoilers. That's how we get flamed. Yeah. Oh, flames. No one watches. Ivory face. Thurman Thomas. And Buffalo Bills. <laughs> Whatever it is. Lizard Buffalo. Jeez, come on. Well, how about shut up, Buffalo? Buffalo diarrhea? No. Dump in your lungs. ear. <laughs> Whoa. Alright. Oh my god, he's having a seizure in the corner of the wall. Yeah, come on. Oh! oh. This is probably not the best strategy to use, but this is what works for me! It's still... Oh, no. no, I'm not gonna say it. <laughs> Feels so stupid. We already are, so you're not gonna ruin your reputation. Yeah, I mean, stupider. Oh, it's a fire and ice laser. Yep, fire and ice. <laughs> fire laser. Oh, come on! That's cheating, man. Give me some Leeway. 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 Blu-ray. Yeah, that's I, a new I, software coming out next year. Leeway. And, and now the sc 2 video is gonna be in Blu-ray high definition on YouTube. <laughs> Whatever. Leeway high definition. Yeah, right. It's a high def. Yeah, right. Oh, this is J-Man's LPs, that's it. You don't even make some white screen, that's about it. Yeah. We're pro here because we don't go HD like those other faggots. <laughs> yeah. No. I thought, I mean, we were low tech and cheap. No, we just, not cheap, we just don't have it. You know? We just don't care, I mean. Yeah, yeah I really don't care too. It's not that I'm lazy, it's just I don't care. Oh! Oh, come that's on, no, you almost lazy. got him, come on! Oh! Oh, that's really nice. Can ask HD. Uh, man, ask your mom. I will, but she told me to ask you guys, and my mom's dead, and I want to ask my son. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, He's because on. it's called, uh, Remake. All right, I'll ask my son. We, uh, I'll ask my mother. We guy. No, Damon's <laughs> your mother, remember? No, you are. No, he is. I'll go on Mori and get the paternity test <laughs> to prove yeah. it. Damon's perfect. And I've now acquired the Frost Shield. That's cool. That's probably, probably the coolest weapon screen in the X-Series so far. And with that said, we will see you guys in part three. God bless and take care. See ya. Thank God it's fucking over. See ya. Welcome to Let's Play Mega Woman X3 Part 3. This is Ron Moore along with We Got 309 and... Jimmy four six two four one two four six two four 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 one. Well, yeah. yeah. And the next Maverick we're face dun, dun, toxic seahorse. Ugh. Boy, they were running out of ideas already. Yeah, really. But this stage of music is ECW. Yeah, I like this stage. The toxic seahorse. It's pretty, yeah, it's pretty awesome. Watch out for the Seahawks. <laughs> Yeah, Seattle Seahawk is the next Maverick. <laughs> you would think that toxic water would would kill you, you know, don't touch the acid, but no one here it's not well it's not acid, but it's toxic yeah. water or whatever. You thought they that would damage you, but it don't. Well, Mega Man's in a suit, man, you know. He ain't gonna get No, I know he's a robot, but still, I mean Yeah, he, he suited up. Yeah. <laughs> his power word. Oh, This music is e ah, dang! I try to get in sync, <laughs> sing with the music. I messed up. <laughs> this is this is e e c. Dot, I failed. Dun, 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 dun. Tough. Toxic. Oh, get the heart. 
Heart. Hmm. Okay, like I a guess boss. Yeah. Uh, so I don't gotta... remember. It's been a while. No, well, so that was a waste what of time the... in the room. That was. Uh, this game is tearing me apart. What the hell was, was that? Castlevania <laughs> Two. They pulled the Castlevania Two boss. I think. Now it's been a lot of years since I played this game, but I think like. It's gonna be just like in X2 where you fought those three Maverick Hunters, or X Hunters. I think you gotta fight some, some more of those guys here, too, and... Bob, you uh, know, just my luck, there's no fight in, in this stage yet. So yeah, you, get, you have to I come back have... to the stage later and fight. Yeah, those. yeah. Or it might find me, and there's rooms like that in every stage, so I'm gonna run up, run, uh, run into them, run up against them, what the heck. <laughs> run up against them. Later. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Getting buried here. Uh, that's yeah, really. So you like to bro? Uh, okay. Is this Billy Mitchell? <laughs> okay, I know. Well, is this the Maverick room? What? Or X Hunter room? Or what? Ah, oh, it's a mini boss. Fight I Baxter Stockman. It's like a la think launch an octopus. Thing. Yeah, yeah. A mix of launch octopus and Baxter Stockman from uh, the arcade game. Yeah. even working come on is there even significant the... battle Whoa. that was, that was yep. pretty quick man these big robots like take a long time to blow up I know then, that then they did next next two. yeah that took longer than the actual robot master you know like the actual yeah yeah anyways yeah they actually they actually um Oh. Toxic uh, idiots! Come on, Ronnie. Broken controls. It's okay, Ron. You just failed once. It's... Take, take it easy. Shut your mouth. You <laughs> failed. <it. laughs> you failed. The... Oh, oh, hey. How does it feel to be a failure and failing? Shut Didn't up. that mean that he succeeded? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he succeeds at at uh. Not failing. Succeeding. <laughs> He's a successful. <laughs> Oh. oh! Death. By spikes. Kind of notice how the stage is no longer toxic. There's, you know, it's all cleaned up. <laughs> it's pretty it's long, too. Toxins. What is it? Antioxidants. <laughs> Antioxidants. Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah. Green tea. It saved their body. You almost killed yourself. Yeah, yeah. They really are broken controls. Yeah. Get yourself a new joypad, or stop using the keyboard, or whatever you use. <laughs> that was pretty cool right Here's there. PS2 controller, you douche. <laughs> You're the douche. Okay, well, I gotta fight this thing again. Yeah, this douche. He's all Because I'm too here. lazy to use save states. See, I don't use save states sometimes my LPs, because those are for sissies. <laughs> Bullshit. Whoever uses safe states is a sissy. Hey, Gaming Goose says so. Ask him. He's right. He is right all the well, time. He's, he's just a yep. per, another person of the YouTubes. Uh, he has a lot more subscribers than us, so that means he's better than us on YouTube. Absolutely. Yeah, so are about 1,000 other people that are above him. I mean, we only have, what, 203 subscribers? <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! This were more air. Just did like Whoa, a super rules and ghosts double jump. Yeah, it's part of the upgrade I got from part two with uh, Blizzard Buffalo stage. Yeah, it's like a mega jump. It was like Super Mario Bros. Two. Yeah. Don't oh, you yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let me chase that little piece of energy. <laughs> yeah. I want it. Oh. Oh. I'm trying to ground here a little bit. Not too long. <laughs> it's not an RPG. Well, yeah, but I mean, still got sub tanks. <laughs> Come on, give me a big one. I want a big one. I mean, that's what he, that's what he said. <laughs> yeah, he sounded like a kid too. I want a big one. I mean, I want a big one. I mean, little one's not gonna satisfy me. I need a big one if I'm gonna make it through this game. <laughs> what? Uh, oh, nothing. Just take out if I want to make it through this game, and then you got yourself my laugh, or what I laughed at. 
I'm about to take you out this call. Okay, anyway, you can eat J-Man now as we continue on. But I'm the host. <laughs> Can't drop hey. it. Hey! Oh, okay. <laughs> It'd be funny if we did that, the rest of the video was just silence. And we yeah. uploaded. Just like, just like Green probably would. Uh... <laughs> yeah, I could, I could go in if you did that. There's, we should have... A, uh, no, the, the tagline for S2K should be, We have no shame. Where gamers have no shame. I don't know. <laughs> There's no shame in this game. Yeah. Here we go. Alright, here we go. Toxic Seahorse. And yeah, I don't have that much blizzard power. Use your freeze oh, come power. On. Yeah. Okay, now I guess maybe he's a trusty X Buster. Funga Buster, whatever it's called. Whoa, don't touch the acid. Acid ball. Yeah. I think it's working better. Hey, that's I'll watch it. <clears throat> Oh, I'm going to my throat for a minute. <clears throat> <laughs> I'll say watch out for the uh, acid balls from The Rock, the movie. Watch out for the phlegm. Watch <laughs> out for the green cum. Oh, yeah. Or something. I, I, I had to do it. I, I had to put in a bear. I have to do a bear. I hope you feel, I hope you feel good about yourself. I don't. I did it for this <laughs> bear. Freaking uh, acid balls from the that movie The Rock. I don't get it's like the, bouncing the rock snot. That no, it's, it's a movie snot. called The Rock. I want to say the movie The Rock because people gonna think I talk about Dwayne Johnson. Well, I know the oh, movie, but oh. no. okay. that's all right. Now it's time to be assisted and use safe state. Oh no! Oh, oh. That's time. Now I'm ready. Now what? <laughs> For the first time ever in, in an S2K LP, I use a safe state. CCW. What? CCW. CCW. Yeah. To be safe. Of ECW, it's C it, for C. It, how about STW? Safe. Uh, S S. Safe State Wrestling. Yes. Yeah, what about STW? Oh. STD. Super Terrestrial Destroyer. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah. Rest in peace, states. All right, now. All right, poison sea monkey has been destroyed. Uh <laughs> late on that. Awesome. Whoa, it's like Metal Gear, man. Yeah. Ish. You get acid splash. Acid bubbles. Oh, burst. Oh, oh, burst. 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 Well, whatever. Shut up. Burst splash. Same thing. No, well, maybe to a certain extent. Uh-oh. There's, uh, Dr. Doppler Radar. Dr. Shoulder Pads? <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> yeah, like butterfly Dr., things. Uh, he looks like the guy from the bus fight video. I forgot his name. Epic Beard Man. Yeah, he's stroking his epic beard. <laughs> oh, yes, these are the two guys... Or robots will have to fight in the in those rooms. It looks like the KFC. Fight you in switch. It looks like the KFC Colonel. <laughs> Try my chicken. Uh, yeah. Okay, you got so eventually in this game you got to fight these two right here, Bear and Wee Guy. It's a <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Whoa. That mysterious that, that, that robot looks familiar. Oh yeah, from uh, first Mega Man X. Yep, that's vile. Oh, you spoiled it, damn it. Oh, yeah, you're right. I mean, I spoiled this game uh, that came out like 15 years ago. and <laughs> Too soon. And for those who haven't, who haven't known. Oh, come on. Who Even when you first played this game, you knew that was him. Come on. I wouldn't have. No, just kidding. There are no other uh, videos on YouTube about this game. None at all. Yeah, really. Look at... Oh, now, yeah. there could be some people watching this and not wanting to really be spoiled, but oh well, hey. It's 2K. For spoilers, uh, I forget, I couldn't think of the tagline. Spoiler, spoilers take control. So, alright, so, uh, as we learn more of the story of this game, we will see you guys in part quattro. God bless and take care. See ya. Bye bye. Welcome to Let's Play Mega Man X3 Part 4. This is Ron Moore. Along with we got through a nine, bear thirteen, and J Man four six two four one. Doctor Douchebag. <laughs> yep. Oh.
Bear 13. It's a armored all armored duo ripoff. That felt like a long intro. <laughs> yeah. Awesome music right here. Yeah. So we're on Bear stage now. <laughs> really? ECW. 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 What do you say, Bear? <laughs> bear? Oh, he's gonna. He's, he's, he's pulling a. Well, Bear. <laughs> <laughs> he's pulling a Jason Rosation. No, Jay says more than this. He's pulling a Jeff. <laughs> yeah, so he feels against the uh, Touchman, who? Touchman. Man, I'm surprised they didn't make Touch a Touchman. Man. That'd be weird. <laughs> yeah. You oh, got. Yeah. You got. Uh, touch well, sensitive. Left <laughs> That's wrong. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, you missed something up get there. The, get the tank. Get the sub tank. You're a douchebag. You're a sub tank, you motherfucker. <laughs> there we go. The E barrel. Or E tank. Oh, they respawn. E barrel roll. Nope, shut up. Shut up. All right, let's see if I gotta fight one of these robots. And yes, it's Wee Guy. Ooh. Welcome, I'm a Tim Fallen fanboy. I must destroy you. No, okay. oh, it's funny because his name is Bit, and I like Ape Bit, just like Tim Fallen. Ha! Ah, so you're right, that's me. Yeah, but you yeah, you're like, gonna uh, get Bit. Oh! I'm kind of glad I talked over that. Uh, yeah, he this likes the big okay. uh, uh, Shut up. Huh? Specifically, Tommy Wiseau's. <laughs> what? What about Tommy? Okay, points for reference, I guess. Uh, and oh, throwing these footballs at me to pose me in place. <laughs> this guy's like the 16-bit Pharaoh man. Yeah. Oh, Sonic Boom. Or whatever. Sonic Kazoom. And he's got like a gay purple sword. Yeah. <laughs> What is it with X, the X Games and Swords? Because they ran out of cool stuff. Watch out, Tony Romo now throwing football at me. It's like a hula hoop. No, if it were oh, Tony he choked! Romo, oh! If it were Tony Romo, the football wouldn't even get thrown. Just fall. Okay, he's not that bad. Sure. He's a good quarterback, he just chokes. No, he chokes on. Uh, KFC. <laughs> he chokes on you. On life. Wait. <laughs> oh, 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 choked. Come on. Choked. Now, come on. Come on, Capcom. You can show some leeway there. Let me beat him. <laughs> okay, how about we point <laughs> yeah. at? Okay. Awesome. Maybe that'll help. Oh, hi, Mouse. <laughs> oh, hi, Cursor. Hi, Reggie Prey. Yeah, I was going to say, somebody's <laughs> trying really hard to get Regis right now. You should have used uh, honestly, unregistered hypercam. No, no, honestly, this was an accident. I did not do that on purpose. I got a new emulator, and now, for some reason, it uh, detects the, uh, the, like, it records the cursor. Unlike when I tried to do that on Star Tropics and I failed, it even record the cursor. It shows. It depends on what emulator Star Tropics is game. It shows where you're going to die. Yeah, really? <laughs> here, 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 and here. <laughs> Ugh. End here. Oh! Ah, oh, right, those are hula hoops. Mega Man was hula hooping. Addicting. Whoa. Yes, finally. It. It. Quit is talking about not... your addict. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> uh, forget it. It is not possible. That is not possible, Bear. The next time we meet, the result shall be different. Exclamation mark. I'll die quickly. And nope, he's not dead, he just barely escaped with his life. I can't quit That's looking good. at the mouse cursor. <laughs> <laughs> How do you not notice it there? It's just... <laughs> it's mouse great. cursor. Seriously, it was an accident and I said, and when I went, went back to watch it, I'm like, yes! Leave that in there. <laughs> Leave it in there. Oh. can look like fags. <laughs> or just you. Yeah. But anyway. Uh, oh. Let's well, call it Thursday night. 
It is Thursday. It's Friday. Friday. Tonight's Thursday. Friday. Okay, Points for lame reference. By the time this video's up, we don't know what day's yeah. going to be. <laughs> it's current recording. It'll probably end up being a Thursday, Thursday night. Thursday. Well, yeah. It's Thursday. Damn it, Bear. Shut up. No, I'm not you thirsty. Indiana Jones. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Indiana man. <laughs> J man. J man. J man. Yeah, J -Man, J -Man, J -Man, J -Man. Yeah. yeah. Alright. Yeah. Right. Yeah. NXT. Oh, come on, another. Uh, it's probably the mini boss. I forgot what it was. Oh, it's the boss. Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> oh whoa, what the? Whoa. It's a dick man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I was waiting for Bear to say something first. <laughs> dick bolzer. Like a bulldozer. Wow. I can't. I'm just in awe of him. And it's mighty thick. Uh, yeah, you got he, drilled. He, he drilled me. Yeah, really. <laughs> <laughs> you got let nailed. Me get, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> let me get rid of the first cursor. That's what's messed me up the whole time. Can't stop looking at cursor. I curse you. Stop looking at dick. <laughs> curse you, nice. Oh. Can't you get behind him? On that what? Other yeah, you can. Yeah, but you really won't be able to hit him very much if you get behind him. <laughs> he can't, but I just... Oh, come on. Die. I hit you enough times, man. He wants you to hit him Remember, from behind. Yeah. He wants you to give it to him hard. I'm about to hit that. Yeah, I got him. Come on, Mega Man's charging up to hit him hard. <laughs> oh. Mega Man would hit anything hard, though. EC W EC W <laughs> EC No Maybe Yes ECT yes. Oh. ET ETW Extraterrestrial Wrestling yeah, That'd be interesting And after two minutes of exploding He's defeated Yes Don't worry that happens to everyone Goes flat <laughs> Yeah he exploded Jeez, does he have, did he have like blue balls or something? I'm like, wow. Dang, these ladders are big for the stage. Yeah, no ladders are that big. I mean, more we like, in, uh, Sigma Sports next to? Maybe we are. Oh. I don't know. <laughs> Who are you? You mean, uh, no, never mind. Uh, yeah, uh, I'm you. not, I'm not, uh, I'm not trying to sound like Skip, but this is a hard game. It's the hardest in the series so far. You said that line belonged to Skip. I haven't played it much. I haven't played X4, 5, and 6 that much. I never played 7. I never played 8. Or 9. But so far, I've X, X2, and X3. This is by far the hardest. <laughs> Why don't you just use another save state? I'm not sissy. Uh huh. You know, I used it already one. Would. You shut up, okay? You don't have nothing to say. <laughs> shut <I don't>. up. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Finally, Bear 13. Here I am. Shut up. Drill 13. Drill 13. Well, how, many, how many drills does he have? Let's count. One, two, three. Oh, no. And here comes come. the death. Come on, touch here the ass. Yes. The death. Doo -doo -doo -doo. <laughs> I had a more uh, sometimes I don't think. Oh, oh come on, you can't juke me out. This ain't football. <laughs> You're a robot. It's supposed to be mindless. Well, not mindless, but shut up. Robots have feelings too. Come on. Oh, there it is. Oh, oh. Oh. He doesn't have the spirit of the dance in him. Well, here's the spirit of the safe state. And this time, I have Bill sub tank or an XD tank, just in case I need it. XD. Oh, come on. Oh, oh, X to C. XFL. DX. DX. <laughs> DX. That's where my stash went. I got two words for you. Safe state. What, what about mean? safe country? They got safe state. What about safe country? For the record, this is Ronnie's playthrough, not we guys. I know the, the safe state might confuse you, but... It just <laughs> oh, shut up. <laughs> Oh, look out! Oh, yes! Stop being jealous of my proneness. Hey, Coronas. 
Corona. Your Corona. 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 Corona.
Beavis and Butthead. Yeah. 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 Cool. Yeah. No, wait a minute. They had sex? There's no way. No way. Yeah, man, we scored. Uh, <laughs> scored high on Mega Man X. <laughs> wait, it doesn't have no, sex. It's, it's the same way that Billy got uh, had a child through the cum stains on, uh, on the hotel sheets and the maid. Okay, anyway, oh, um, let's try to get past this thing. <laughs> you can beat it by killing it. Shut up. <laughs> That's Just I do, so. shut up. <laughs> why don't you beat it and get out of this Yeah, why don't, you, mm -hmm. why don't you beat somebody off? I would, but Skip's not here. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, Bird 13, on being married to Skip Rogers. <laughs> Who? He's gay for Skip. <laughs> I'm gay for a lot of things. <laughs> There's a lot of Ovaltine at that wedding. Be sure to drink your Ovaltine. But not enough Take Kodak film. So you well, yeah, see well, the, yeah, so well. See the raunchy side of our uh, honeymoon. We we really are stupid. Um, <laughs> no shit. That's embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, no, Bear's not mentally sane. <laughs> I never said I was. Yeah, well, you're making a <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> uh, another. Uh, that's okay. probably another matchup later. Yeah. Why yeah. Are we, why are we in Metroid now? Yeah, this is Turian. Yeah. Watch out for the Metroids. Yeah. They don't wear ties. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Rid Ridley oh. is uh, subcontracting it to uh, whoever the hell the boss here is. It's your stage. You should... You. You're the boss. Yeah. Tony yeah. Danza. <laughs> I got compared to the great Tony Danza. Uh, no, I, I would, I would more way. compare you uh, to Mona. Mona, and I like to Mona a lot. <laughs> <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Nah, I forgot the opening song to Who's the Boss. Dun, 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 I don't know, but this dun, song is pretty awesome right here. Yeah, it is. I yeah, can't we, hear it, so I'll agree. Yeah, well, it's not simple. Well, turn the volume up. I mean, how dumb can you be? I'm not dumb enough to leave my mouse pointer in the middle of the screen. Yeah, well, I'm not. Video. <laughs> well, I'm not dumb enough to. Um, you save states. Take, yeah, yeah, ha. Huh? <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm not dumb enough. Right, here we uh -huh. go. All right, that's it. I'm gonna finish you off, bear. Run your mouth. Yeah. Hey, Whoa. At least, at least runs funny, bear. <laughs> I'm not dumb enough to live in Texas. Well, you live in Canada. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, good comeback. I can't come back from that. Dan, you got a big ass mouth, bear. You're damn right, you can't come back. Also explains why I have a big mouth. Yeah, you're taking those that missiles like... Look at how look at how that big mouth takes those missiles. It's wild. The big that loads. Big hard. <laughs> He's like, give me more! Whoa. <laughs> whoa, whoa. You're having an elect <sighs> get electromagnetic orgasm. Yeah. yeah. Oh, whoa, watch out. Hey. That missile's going in his ass. Yeah, it's see, oh, like. oh. Yeah, it seems to do more uh, damage when it goes in the ass. <laughs> what doesn't? No, it's a trap. Oh. Come on. Oh. Die. Finish him. Dun, dun, dun. Gotta be one more shot. Yes. Die yes. Hard. You take away my cock, you take away my life. <laughs> oh, I thought you didn't already have one. You've finally been defeated, Bear. Finally! How's it feel? Yeah, big whoop. Fuck off. Yeah, big mouth. <laughs> okay. I like him big. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Whoa. You got my blue balls? balls. I get a common Home. side effect from what you, you get. get the from... Triforce. Yeah, electric Triforce. That's an awesome weapon right there. Triad Thunder. Really comes in use. And that is the That's end. Not at all. Thank God of part five. We'll see you in part six. See ya. Bye. Peace out. Come back next time. <laughs> Bear sucks. Welcome to Let's Play Mega Man X3 part six. 
kitchen this sink. Is Ron, this is Ron Moore, along with some <laughs> idiot, uh, Wee Guy, and J Man. <laughs> yeah, so many Wee Guy. <laughs> You're the idiot, dumbass. <laughs> Crush crawfish. Yeah, the, the idiot is crushed crawfish. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but this stage of music is freaking epic, ECW. Oh, yeah. Well, we gotta be the triad now. Yep. Final thing is great. Mega Man can try for us. This music's a big blows. But it's not Symbolian. <laughs> I don't give a rest butt cheeks. But there is something to see, Dub. Yeah, unlike Bird 13. Uh-huh. You know what? I'm oh, glad dude. this is in Temple Lane. I'm glad. Yeah, keep a push for it, but make it sound like Target and Renegade or something. Shut the fuck yep. up. Take that! This song's better than Temple Lane. No. You never come no. up with yeah. Yeah! That scream was completely worthless. <laughs> yeah. Got something to say. <laughs> we'll have to come back here later. <laughs> You can stay in sync, oh yeah. Why are we singing in Backstreet, boys? Oh no. Bear's the oh, game yeah. one. <laughs> this bear himself is the Backstreet. These songs in this game just make you want to sing to him. I want it that way. Yep. Up the bus. There's the, the, there's the, the Bear down. Street Boys. <laughs> yeah, Bear Street Boys. Uh, but the, the name of this map just makes me laugh. Crush Crawfish. Kind of cool. By the way, if you guys give me a cash advance, I'll sing at a birthday party for you guys. <laughs> no. We will give you a cash advance to please shut the hell up. <laughs> yeah, really. I want it that way. Oh, I'm going to keep singing until I get the money transferred. <laughs> Alright, there. Send you PayPal just now. Shut up. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's, it's only for three cents, though. Yeah. Oh, oh, it's like it's baby do bear, stupid singing. Uh, we're Stop. sorry, I didn't mean it. Shut up. Go back and pull. <laughs> go in the X Factor. Fine, I'm gonna go climb into bed with Skip. <laughs> I wish we would have skipped out this commentary. <laughs> totally. Hey, I'm in hey. really. <laughs> All right. Just. Could have just went down the stairs. Yeah, no, I, I just want to fill up whatever. the sub tanks. Gotta fill up on sub tanks. Sub, sub for sub. Gotta beat this level. Sub tank for sub tank. <laughs> yeah. A new song is called Sub for Sub Up on the YouTube. Or Bear's favorite, Suck for Suck. Oh, oh. <laughs> hey, who doesn't like a Suck for Suck? Suck for Blow. Well, it's good too. <laughs> yeah, well, you blow. I know. Yeah, you know, they got That's Volk the Catfish. They got Volk Catfish, Crush Crawfish. Who's next? Uh, uh, Big Blowfish? I don't know. We have to destroy a, a, a button now? What the hell is yeah, that? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, I don't know the point of that, but anyway. Push the button. That was that was really kind of weird. Right there. Oh, there was a room down there. That's what you could have gone that to fight up one of the mavericks you want to, but uh, room, you're tearing me apart. <laughs> this is tearing me apart. This is Metroid. Go to your room. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, the floor. Yeah, the the floor door. Floor door. Uh, Who All right, here we are with. Yeah. He's not Batman. How about that? How about how about bad? Uh, uh, I don't know. Bad out of hell. Yeah, that's the next Maverick. Oh. Oh, you were getting pwned. Get out of there, idiot! When I, when I hit smash the D-pad like crazy, that means you escape from the grip of a uh, claw grip from Mario Brothers 2 over here. Come yeah. <laughs> yeah. Totally. <laughs> the real crush crawfish. Red lobster reject over here. Space lobster. Got fired from yeah, space red lobster. 
No, it's just space lobs there. Got far from I'm trying to make a joke, and you had to ruin it. Space uh, lobs. I have my own separate joke from Jinzu. That's why well, there's no red lobster where you live at, because you suck. I will. Only two people will get my red lobster joke, so I win. <laughs> well, how about space blue lobster? lobster? Space lobster, not red lobster. Wait, you know what? Red versus blue <laughs> and Mega Man's blue. I mean red! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> And we got fails over and over again. I acquire the spitting blade. Thanks, Wesley Snipes. Original? It's like the double boomerang. Yeah. All right. Spitting blade. Here's a special treat for you in part six, guys. A double dose of Maverick action as we face as a fa as we face Tony the Tiger next. <laughs> we face palm. This game is <laughs> as we double face palm. Alright, get your Who's frosty, the next frosty, bag? Get your frosty flakes equipped, guys. We face the power oh, Wolverine. Neon Tiger. Neon Wolverine. Neon Peon. Awesome, awesome music right here. As we are in a stink chameleon stage at sunset time. Oh, yeah, right? <laughs> da, 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 freestyle. My name's Ron Moore, and, and I'm playing Mega Man X3. I, I fell down, down, down. Like a contra stage or something, the jungle. Uh, uh, take it, Bear. Hey, I'm Bear. <laughs> I'm gay. Come on, I'm on at, least, at least Jason Realization tries to freestyle. And he like, ah, oh, no, that sucks, man. Can't sing. Okay, let me try to get that sub tank up there. Run amongst try our subs. Get, get the sub tank. You douchebag. Dun dun. We got. Okay, uh, no. I was gonna think, but I wanted to say something. Every time Rob gets the sub tank, we should get the sub. Sub tank, we get the sub. Come on, guys, if you're not Um, sub let's think, uh, um, let's think. Astling, um, J-Man. Hey, this is Mega Man. <laughs> I'm trying to jump here, but I can't get up there, so... I guess it's like out of fear. I'm on the S2K. This is gay. Why There's can't I just get the sub tank? There's a train! <laughs> it's in my brain! I still can't get the sub tank! Oh, come on, Bear! Oh, Even the train freaks off! Final... <laughs> that train kicks your ass, Bear. <laughs> you got pulled by train, yeah. We, <laughs> we need train, man. Charge, man! Dun, 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 dun. Charge it up. Dun, 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 dun. You're charged, man. And, dun, dun. You, um, yeah, and, yeah. Um, yeah, lols. Yeah, um, and yeah, um, let's oh, think of the lols. It is green stall. Oh, let's think of the lols. I don't look like green stall. Music is louder than the commentary. Oh, oh, lols, it was my fault. You two messed it up because it fell lols, lols, and I'm actually baby okay. bros. Okay, please, 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 we got um, actually, a uh, weak guy was in his laundry room, and he was beating on the dryer, trying to make a, like, a rap beat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm in the laundry room, so I could be actually loud and not wake anyone up, which is good. It's like the car episode in, uh, Super Metroid. Yeah, but yep. we can hear you a lot better. Yeah. Yeah, remember Wait, when I was I in the car? I think there's a secret right here. Let me oh. see. Yeah, I think this is a secret room. Yep. Oh, penetrated. All right, let's see what is in here. Yes. Uh oh. Now this is J-Man's first time listening. Listen to this song. Drama time. I mean, they get worse this... and worse with each X game of this Doctor Light music. Okay, I think I said it in Mega Man X two, but I'm gonna say it again if I did. But if not, I'm gonna say it for the first time. This totally sounds like Chrono Trigger. Well, I, I, it, to me, it, like, it, it makes me want to go to sleep and have my mom tuck me in because this is like bedtime music <laughs> or something. I mean, is he trying to put Mega Man to sleep? Yeah. I mean... It's like in, enlightened music. You're about to become smarter and stronger. And so yeah, you must really. endure the music because if you get through that, it'll make you stronger. No, it's the music that's supposed to make you go to sleep. It's like the Hammer Brothers in Mario 3 on the map screen. Yeah, you play the music box. 
Now that's the best. Oh, that's pretty fucking awesome there. That was like super Hadouken. That's ECW. <laughs> that's not. That ECW. was not ECW. <laughs> As we would stop right there and uh, do some more freestyle rapping in part seven of Mega Man X3. Till then, see ya. Tap to the rap. This is the J Man signing out. Peace. We got three at nine. Peace, peace, yo. Bear sucks. Welcome to Let's Play Mega Man X3 Part Seven Ante. <laughs> this is. Did you just say like seventeen? So, <laughs> I, oh. so, anyway, Neon Tiger stage again. As we think of some more freestyle raps. But who are you doing this commentary with? Freestyle rap. What? As we, as we think of more examples with? of how this is like. Yeah. One at a time. Oh, maybe the same Let's people have been of... previous six commentaries. Ah, oh, you. <laughs> <laughs> And in each part, Ronnie dies by the spikes. Do the mega jump, you stupid blue, uh, smurf-looking mother... Fucker. Mother what? Fucker. Mother what? He can't finish it, you know that. No, I don't know that. Well, you do now, you stupid fag. Oh. I mean, oh, sorry, I stupid... Don't call him a bundle of sticks. No, that's faggot. Or, uh, no, that's faggot. Bundle sticks or just a fag is a British cigarette. Stupid faggot, faggot. Don't call bear a British cigarette, okay? I mean, that's yeah, good. Call me a shovel. Don't call bear a, uh, a guard utensil. Oh yeah, yeah, ho. Ronnie, he's Wait. making fun of me. <laughs> we gotta stop. Anyway, it. I was thinking of of like how easy it was to compare the first part of that level to uh, Sting Chameleon stage on Mega Man X One or Eight. I forgot all about that. Yeah, really. Steam. Here's the mini boss. Whoa. Okay, Magna Centipede in his true form. You Man. only have one life. Yeah. Oh, Magnus one is. I knew life it. to live. Oh, I knew it. Magnus X1 is back. No. Oh, uh, yeah. Magnus? Yeah. Magnus X, <laughs> Wait, I said Magnus, Magnus X, X1. Magnus. I said Magus. How about shut upness? Or, what's up, Darkness? You missed. Yeah, well, my fish knock gonna knock the mission yes. face. I'll shut up. <laughs> <laughs> you missed. No, I didn't. I got that. Oh, see, what, 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 what? Who went there? K K K K K K. Racist. K K K. What? That's so racist. Right? Uh, uh, that's racist. I don't want to. Oh, oh wait. Ah, oh, damn. Wrong with rhythm. That's so racist. <laughs> Coming soon to the uh, Disney Channel. Uh, I, I don't. <laughs> I don't hear that. I so want to see that. That's so racist. Ooh. Oh. I got his butt. Got on the ass. <laughs> yeah. Let's talk about crap. That is whack. I don't want to hear that in my rap. As you're playing Mega Man X3 for the Super Nintendo, you can't beat me. Entertainment system. It's C equals three. I'm just saying. Like Ray William I'm Johnson. I'm just saying. <laughs> Bitches. Check it out, Forum. What's happening, Forum? Dude, dude, this should have been like a first-person segment. You could have used the Super Scope. That would have been awesome. Yeah. Not really. Yeah, hey, People hey. I don't have the Super Scope because it sucked ass. No, you suck ass, and I oh. the Super Scope is awesome. Oh, oh. I'd rather use the Power Glove. Oh, well, I don't know about that. I, I'd, I'd, rather like use the, uh, I'd rather use the uh, controller that... Active Enterprises was going to make, but it never came out. No, actually, kidding. Game Master. <laughs> yeah, that that big monstrosity. Oh, Another, we're going to have to revisit this stage too. Yeah. No, no, you have to revisit this stage. I mean, but we'll, we'll meet. We'll meet Bite and uh, uh, we'll meet in the, the other stages. More than meets the eye. Transformers. Okay. Come on, let's get to this stage. Just Transformers. Bear likes the brown eye. With Ooh. Ooh, yeah. What's the name? Optical Prime or I forgot. Optical. 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 Prime. optical. Budget Opticals. Yeah. Roll Vision. I don't know. Metroid Prime. <laughs> GMC Prime. Metroid Over the Hills, more like it. No, I'm just kidding. Metroid The Hills. Come on, I know there's something up there. Yeah, you gotta take the ride. Yeah. Take it hard. 
Right. Oh, stay on the dragonfly. Yeah, ride it. it. Ride it. Ride that <laughs> Don't shoot it. I got mad and killed it. <laughs> Stupid are you? Gotta take where I want to go. Die. Oh, he shot his load off. Yeah. What are we load. talking about? <laughs> Unleash the power. Come on, yes. Get the half centimeter raised there. See, yeah, already. <laughs> Just like That's there. That's what we call a boner. Yeah, my first center, job. Center I, I got a. Must be my first job. I got a five cent raise. It's ridiculous. Yeah, that was like a five cent raise right there. How we go, uh, Tony the Tiger? The ECW Tony the Tiger. That's what happens when you do a nickel up at Attica. Nickel back? I want my nickel. Uh -huh. I, I want my nickel back. Nickel crack sucks. I think I get it now. Instead of quarterback, nickel back. That's a genius. <laughs> Oh, but oh. that was not genius. Yep, that was great. Yeah, that was not, that was not Guinness, man. I, I'll tell you, that's ECW Tony the Tiger. It's Wolverine. Now, this is great. What the hell is a Wolverine? Is that Sierra Claus, like Wolverine? Chris Benoit. Chris Glover. He's like a, a Blanca ripoff kind of. Yeah, Blanca. Blanca. Play. Okay, Casablanca. Let's spend the next two minutes arguing about the pronunciation. <laughs> yeah, Blanca. let's just come Ryu, you, you, Ryu, Ryu. Ken, Ken, wait. Yeah. <laughs> Ken versus Kenny. Oh my God, they killed Kenny. Barlar versus Ryu. Blar. I was gonna say Blar instead of Balrog. Blar versus T Hawk. Wow, Neon Tiger sucks. It's actually, uh, Thawk. <laughs> what? Marshall Falk? <laughs> it's your fault. Oh, we do oh, not speak about it's that your Falk. in public anymore. <laughs> Alright, Falker. <laughs> Meet, my Falk. Falk. Meet my Falkers. Meet my Falkers. Don't touch me, motherfucker. Ah, uh, Terry Funk you. Don't tear <laughs> me apart. You are funky. Here you go. Oh, the Heat Man suit. Yep, and as we Heat acquire Man, the, uh, uh, hot saucy. The Constellation. We acquire the... Ready Splasher. <laughs> Contra <laughs> Spread Gun. Yeah, ready. <laughs> Alright, guys, we'll see you in part ocho. See ya. Bye-bye. We'll be bye. See ya. See ya. Welcome to Let's Play Mega Man X3 Part 8. This is Ron Moore, along with Darth Gentoo. Hello, folks. And part A is going to be me collecting a few items. You just used your force power. It's uh, it's it's just what I predicted. He's uh, joining the dark side viewers. I like yep. it. Very for the sake of not wasting anybody's time on YouTube watching too much bat tracking and stuff. He uses more dark side powers. It's amazing. <laughs> And have you ever played this game before? Yeah, I used to have it when the X Collection came out for PS2. Okay. Here's more of this bedtime Dr. Light music. You are feeling take sleepy, X. He says, take this sleep capsule. It'll make you go to sleep while playing Shellgate 64. I can't wait to LP that game. That's going to be fun. <laughs> <laughs> sleep capsule. That game will make you fall asleep on your own. That, is, that game is a sleep capsule. You should have said, take this sleep capsule. It's called Shadowgate 64. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, at least this music is better than the music in Shadowgate 64. They remixed it on the version I had. Because, like, oh. for when I tried to get a Super Nintendo cartridge, they were running up, like, a hundred bucks for oh. X3. Oh. I thought you were about the music, Shadowgate 64. Anyway, here's the new item I required. The, uh... I don't know what you call it exactly. Radar detector. <laughs> it's the hacks of the helmet of hacks. Yeah, it shows it shows the map of the whole stage you're in to see if yeah. there's any items to collect. And as we just seen, there's no more items to collect in Tunnel Rhino stage. Now we go to Toxic Seahorse, or as we got told me, I think uh, Polluted Ocean Pony. I forgot, but <laughs> yeah. So. So there's two items to collect in the stage, but I'm only going to get one and get the uh, other one in Sigma's Fortress later on. 
Uh, Oops, spoilers. Same as behind the whole... Uh, behind uh, the, the evil stuff in this game. <laughs> oh, it's not Sigma. It's Bear that's behind everything. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and now, this trick right here, I learned from somebody on YouTube. I forgot yeah. his name. I... Uh, <laughs> Ah, fully charging, you idiot! Fail charge. <laughs> there we go. Yay! Right, ice. Oh, come on, man! Come on! Watch out! Mm -hmm. There we go. See if you can get it this time. All right, come on. Halo, reach it! Ah, oh, come on. Hmm. I would have, like, done a air dash. Uh, that's what I try to do. I, I think I, well, I did the dash, but, uh, I think you can't do the dash two times in the air and already use it up when I dash the first time. I meant, like, when you first jump, jump straight up in the air. Uh, yeah, that, that, like what I failed to do right there. Yeah. You almost had it. Yeah. There we go. Let's see if you can get All it. Right. Oh, all right, there we go. You just stole Kermit's ride armor. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think uh, now I forgot what that was. I think like you can. There's just like little circle platforms you see in various stages of the game, and I yeah, think that right there. I think it's called the kangaroo kangaroo armor chip. No, it basically gives you one of the ride armors whenever yeah. you see that platform. All right, now I'm coming back to Volt Catfish stage or Bear stage to meet no friend. Oh yeah. Meet old friend. Ooh, are we gonna see Mr. Rogers? Yeah. Oh, I, oh. Had, I had lag there. Emulator glitch. That was on. That was part of the the game, the recording. Yeah. <sighs> capsule Corp capsule. Teleport. Yep. I remember someone uh, 8 bit remixed this on a Mega Man ROM hack. It was pretty ECW. Cool. Gotta check that out. I can't remember which Mega Man uh, 2, Rockman 2 hack it was. Now, if you go to the stage, I think, earlier in the game or in a different Maverick stage, um, this elevator does not work. Uh, did you already defeat Catfish? Because I didn't see. Yes, I did. That was in part uh, 5, I think. I forgot. Then the elevator probably works then, after you defeated oh, okay. him. It's kind of like in uh, other X games or X1, from what I remember, yeah. where... Like you've... <laughs> If you defeat a launch octopus, the water comes to stink a million's level. Yeah, yeah. All right, here we go. Oh my God, it's Christmas! It's Vile from X1, who we saw earlier as the mysterious Maverick, quote unquote. Uh, you can never get enough of Vile. Yeah. Let's have Guile in this game. Guile versus Vile. Why would you be in there? All you do is Sonic boom people. <laughs> He's from Capcom, so it could happen. Yeah. Guile versus Vile. USA. Alright, now, use the uh, spinning blade here to defeat Vile in his armor suit. Yep. That's weird. Next one, when he's in his armor suit, he's pretty much invincible. Because, uh, I mean, you can't. He had no energy bar. Because he, he, does. he doesn't have Boris's cheat codes. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> and back when it's X said uh, Zero and Ham defeated him. I don't recall Zero defeating Vile. Zero yeah, he, pretty... he helped him. Yeah, but that doesn't count. X got the winning kill. Yeah, really. <laughs> so X probably got all the experience and became like a level 80 paladin or something. Yeah. I don't know. Oh, I'm trying to collect the race blaster. I mean, collect it. Use the race to select it. Yeah. There it yeah. is. I'll just select like that then. Oh, that's the symbol for it. What? I thought that was the... Like, I don't know. Anyway, here we go. This vial was a little I bit think, more challenging. Yeah, I was about to say, this vial is probably a little bit more harder than in, than uh, the battle on X1. X8? X8 is a little bit easier. I never really got through X8, so I didn't know he if any of the appearances he made other than X1 and X3. Now, I don't know if he was in X7, because I haven't played that yet. Yeah, the ones I'm really not familiar with is X4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. Ah, you're in for a treat. I'll do X4. I have the X collection. I need to start playing that. Oh yeah. I mean, I, did, I didn't really play all through all the X's like I did X, X2 and X3. Oh yeah. And 
Vials defeated again as he slowly dies. To this day, you die. D-I-E. Dot, dot. Lots of dots. Yeah. Super explosion equals wins. Equals ECW. Yes. Do you hear what I told Skip Rogers? Do a how to win at Shadowgate 64. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he said he wouldn't even touch that game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um. Okay. Wait, now let's play Metroid here as we escape from the planet Mega Man. Oh sweet. Now this is more like let's get to Walmart before everyone else gets Halo Reach. Oh uh, yeah. And let's dress like idiots and look stupid on purpose so we can be on the website of Walmart.com. Hey, there's nothing wrong with cosplaying. It's the best way to show your inner dork, <laughs> inner dork and nerd. No, no, I wasn't talking about that. I'm just talking about people dressing the way they do in everyday life oh. and going to Walmart looking like that. <laughs> ah. <laughs> oh. Air dash. Yep. Fourteen. Yeah, look, you're right there. Uh, All right. <laughs> All right, so that is it for part eight. We'll see you in part nine and see what other Maverick I'm going to tackle. I think there's only two left. So until then, God bless and take care. See ya. Welcome to Megman X3 part nine. Or however you say nine in Spanish. Nine nueve. Uh, nueve. nueve. <laughs> this is Ron Moore along with Darth Gentu. Hi guys, I'm back again. That's what the D stands for. There, Darth Gentu. Yeah, I'm the bad. I'm the bad guy. And there's Bear, Gravity Beetle. No, you have to fight my Pokemans now. <laughs> I like the stage, especially the music. Yeah. All right, let's see what items to collect here. Even though I'm going to get probably one or two of them. Think That's the Skip. I just gave the, the helmet a new name, the Skip Rogers helmet. Yeah, really. <laughs> You're the NES helmet. The NES uh, heads. Headphone helmet or whatever it was that came out years ago. Yeah, my Asian like said fuck and it like killed a ship or something. That'd be the Skip Rogers helmet right there. <laughs> yeah. Hi guys, Skip Rogers helmet on with the B shooter controller. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah, Gravity Jumping Beetle. Um, cool stage, but not as cool as Gravity Man's, uh, his uh, older brother or predecessor from uh, Mega Man yeah. Five, I guess. <laughs> Yeah. Whoa. Now there's Bear. Nice to meet you. Hi, Bear. <laughs> <laughs> I gag on greasy meat. <laughs> Man, Bite has a beer gut. Yeah, him and we got a party in probably, so. <laughs> no, not Frostbite or Frostbite. Frost S, whatever it's called. There we go. The tornado thing. Oh, yeah. Man, I'm getting pulled right here. Oh, oh thanks. yeah. Oh, yeah. Thanks. <laughs> All right. Oh, well, I guess I'm gonna die. No, I like it. Oh, wait a minute. Keep up this rhythm. You'll be all right. Stay with the rhythm, on. Ah, there, I think I got him. Yep, he's gone. Yep. No, how can this great power? Can, what? How how can this great power can be generated? Uh, fail. Grammar fail. Yeah. Well done, X. The victory is your... <laughs> he took his defeat well. X, come on down. You're our contestant for the price is right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the victory is yours. Captain Flam would say something like that, I guess. Yeah. X is going like, man, all I want was a dollar. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, now, oh wait, hold on a second. I think there's something up here. Yes, the uh, F chip, I forgot what that does. It's a froggy armor thingy. Well, how do you do that? Sure, how do you do the air dash again? I forgot. I mean, the, like, the single... Ah, there we go. Yeah, you made your map. Uh, no, oh, I can't. See, I keep forgetting you can't dash and then dash again like that. It won't work. Yeah. Grr. I 
angry rage. <laughs> oh, this music it's almost happened. Sonic, I can. This music sounds like I could exercise to it in a way. <laughs> this would be someone's. It's like Giles, air. uh, a different version of Giles' music, I guess. It's the background, yeah. the color, of the, the sunset background. And then his music is gonna be like Giles' days, like the Army Air Base. <laughs> yeah, he got it. Finally got the F chip. I don't know what it's for, I forgot, but we'll find out later. It's for one of the armors. Yeah, I figured that out. I forgot what the armor looked like. Uh, it has to do with something with a frog, I think. Uh, <laughs> Frogman. Probably. Toadman from Mega Man 4. I heard there was a wrestler named Frogman LeBunk or something. I, I don't know. He's a jobber. Eh. Oh, don't die. Get the energy. Yes. He's got energy. Get the 5 hour energy. Shoot them before they shoot you. Yeah, more energy now. No 2.30 feeling later. It's like 6 o'clock where it's not right now. Yeah. Get more energy now. No, uh, I'm about to lose to a Maverick. Robot Maverick later. There we go. Has energy. Energy. Yeah. Okay, I guess we're in sector 6 or 7 now. It was on the 7th floor. It reminds me of uh, Ninja Turtles 1 where it shows what room you're about to go into with the numbers next to the door. Yeah. Oh man, that level got my nerves. The level was more harder than the boss. Yeah. Feels on the ninth floor. Yeah. Well, lots of stuff with the number nine is at. Nine chicken wings, nine beers, nine beer bottles of beer on the wall. There ain't no more left because I drunk them all. Part nine of this, uh, let's play. Yeah. Nueve? Yep, Nueve. La cero, uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, diez. That's the only numbers I know how to count the I thought, Spanish. I thought ten in Spanish was Siente. I'm not sure. That's seven. Tiente? Siente. No, I said, no, I said Tiente. I thought, a long time ago, I thought ten was Tiente. Nah. Or Picante. I don't know. Picante sauce? Yeah. Let's go with tacos. Okay. Go get saw the twin tacos. You ever see that on Newgrounds? No, I haven't seen that. I don't know if it's still up there, but someone from Baylor University made that. It's like, oh, cool. <laughs> you know, I live near Baylor. <laughs> All right. I have seen a Castlevania parody called Burrito of Blood. Oh, I don't think I might not check that out. Oh, here we go. I'll prove, I'll, I'll prove I'm not Mexican. I'll go to Taco Bell and order a pizza. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, now this is a freaking easy, ridiculously easy battle. Mm, you use your he's not, flasher and then that's it. He's not flowcharting it up. Yeah. Usually flowchart gravity beetles are like serious business. Like the ST2K is serious business. Oh, yep. Oh, headshot. And that's it. That's the easiest Maverick battle in this game so far. What do you say, Drake? Oh, damn. Oh, match sucked. I'll give it a 95 out of... A hundred? Yeah, give it was a hardcore match. He's too dumb. It's not back in the day. Yeah. <laughs> I give it a four out of a hundred. Slap. <laughs> <laughs> I should do that for my next Let's Play, Color a Dinosaur. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's see what I got now. Ah, the gravity well. Make it tame water. Makes you look like Barney the dinosaur. All right, now let's go to the last Maverick. This fearsome Maverick over here. I usually fought him first. <laughs> I'm going in the order. Uh, you know what? I need to plug his channel in the description box. I've been watching his walkthrough lately, and that's how ah. I get through this game on YouTube. <laughs> uh, Blast Hornet. For some reason, I used to get him and Toxic Seahorse confused. I don't know why. Okay, he's using the power of Skip Rogers here. Yep. Mega Man made a map. In his head. <laughs> Literally, in his head. Yep. My Air Force is in my head. All right. Oh, God. <laughs> it looks like Mega Man has voices in his head, all them bubbles around him. Having a, a Beavis, uh... Beavis thing going on, always having voices, all the bubbles popping around his head. Yeah, I think that's when they're like, like, doped up or something. Yeah. 
corner hole to open this. Hey, hey butthead! This dude's a chode smoker. <laughs> ah, shut up, Beavis. Blue <laughs> <laughs> hair on our faces. Like oh yeah. Beard. Oh yeah, beard boys. That episode. I actually did that after watching the episode. No, I'm just kidding. Oh. <laughs> I'm, I'll I'll I won't be surprised this. if some kids did do that. I like the one where they the go. <laughs> I like the one where they steal Mr. Anderson's uh bowling ball, and they think there's like something inside the bowling balls. Just to like, yeah, like, buttheads on the uh, part where the balls come out. And he goes like, Be Beavis goes like, I want to turn. And buttheads are like, uh, okay. But you have to close your eyes. Then butthead rolls a gutter ball. And the ball goes in there and crushes Beavis' private areas. Because <laughs> oh. <laughs> Beavis gets like hit in the crush like three or four times in that episode. Oh, yeah. I mean, Al Snow did that move to people. Yeah. But anyway, I just beat some sort of, uh... Spin off of the final boss battle with Sigma X2. A digital copy shuriken. Yeah. Cyber Ryu. How do you can? Ow. Okay. Oh news. Go down here and uh, get something real quick. I forgot what's down here, but I know it's something because I'm down here. Uh. Come on. Alright, there we go. Ah, yes. This thing. <laughs> hey, look, it's the right armor. <laughs> Yay. Ah, this music is okay. You still don't compare to Toxic Seahorse, in my opinion. Oh, yeah. Alright, I, th I think I need... The whole purpose of getting this, I think, is to collect the heart container up top on these buildings coming up. I think so, yeah. Yes, up here. Uh, there we go. Yes. And he has it. What? Okay, I don't think I find awesome. anything here. No, I don't. Mm. Bit and bite are defeated. Hooray! We got a bear defeated. No, sweet guy! <laughs> if we guys hearing this, I stole your Dr. Pepper. And I'm not buying anymore. <laughs> it's his turn to buy. Oh, shut up, Tim Fallon. Tim Fallon. I remember in the 80s, Tim Fallon did those Dr. Pepper commercials. Remember that? Really? No. <laughs> <laughs> we guys like, oh, really? Oh, Tim Fallon, I'm on YouTube looking for it. <laughs> I think I'm gonna draw some pictures and go like, this is what Tim Fulham looked like when he was in WCW. <laughs> <laughs> he's in music, be some sun soft, sun soft music. <laughs> was it yeah. him or just sun soft music or David Wise? I don't know. David Wise, I think, was really rare. And Tim Fulham was like Tato, LJN, and stuff. <laughs> yeah. Alright, now, the battle with Blast Hornet as I use the supercharged up gravity well. Oh! Ow, that oh. took a lot off. Oh, what do you say, Jay? Oh. <laughs> uh, this game sucks. I mean, it's too hard. It's kind of dumb to use a gravity thing. It's not even touching them. Look. Yeah. Because he's a flying type Pokemon. I think that's why Jay unsubscribed from us. He's got tired of us making fun of him. Oh. Uh, I'm just kidding. I don't think he unsubscribed from us. What do you say, Jay? No, but I'm about to. You guys suck. I'm tired of you making fun of me. I give you guys one out of ten. <laughs> <laughs> one out of a hundred. <laughs> <laughs> one out of ten. That's my rating. That's my skill, or our skill. We usually use on here on the channel. <laughs> That's why Jay hasn't done any uh, less discuss no more with us because we make fun of him too much. Oh, uh, Jay. We still love you, Jay. WWJD. What would Jay do? Mm. Go to Walmart. He would say this game sucks. <laughs> yeah. Uh-uh. Alright. Oh, gold Mega Man? Or I'm, I'm kind of colorblind. The yellow? Uh, kind of yellowish gold, I guess? Hmm. Looks like someone colored them with crayons. Parasitic bomb. And Blast Hornet wasn't even a parasite. <laughs> Alright, now to feed all the Mavericks, I'll go back to headquarters and talk to Dr. Kane. Dr. McCain. After Ronnie and Jintu have defeated the eight robot masters, mostly Ronnie, because Jintu was really smoking a blunt. 
Hey, Robot Masters? It's Mavericks. Turn it right. Do <laughs> my bet. Oh, uh, here we go. Fan boys attacking us now. They're called Mavericks, you stupid idiot. <laughs> hey, I haven't been asleep, so. <laughs> Me either. I need some Hawaiian punch. <laughs> <laughs> Hawaiian punch! Uh uh. Preferably polar blast flavored, please. <laughs> so they're talking about, uh, something. Ah, uh, 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 Dr. Doppler is trying to put together a giant super battle body suit or something. A giant Gundam in Japan. Yeah. Maybe. Uh, let's see. Blah, 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 blah. Blah 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 blah. Yeah, yeah. Sigma? Ah, they kind of spawned it for us this time. We never would have guessed that. Thanks for spawning it for us, Capcom. We never figured Sigma was behind it all. You spoiled it in part eight, remember? Oh yeah. Well, I'm talking about Capcom spawning it for people playing it for the first time when they were kids. Oh. But I guess yeah, they thought unlike the original series, they probably said, you know what? They they're not stupid. They're gonna know Sigma's behind it. Let's just kind of spoil it for them anyway. Alright, and there's Dr. Doppler's laboratory rising from the ground. Uh, in part 10, I think I might collect some more items first before Yay. I actually go into the fortress. So we'll see what happens after that. See you in part 10. Tiente? Whatever it was again, Spanish? Diaz! Diaz, okay. The, wait a minute. Cameron Diaz? Okay. No. <laughs> Alright. God bless. Take care. See ya. And welcome to part Tiente, if I said it right, of Megman X3 Race. This is Ron Moore along with We Got 309. Yo, and it's DS. Dummy. And and I have nothing better to do on my birthday than record commentary for Mega Man X3. Oh, it's your birthday? Yep. You serious? Yep. Well, how come on Skype it doesn't say happy birthday or whatever? Uh, I, didn't, I guess I didn't update on Skype. Maybe if you check Facebook more often, you were known. Um, no, but uh... Just, well, happy birthday, Ronnie! Thank you. Happy Lulz Day to you. Happy Lulz Day to you. No, it's you. ECW Day. Indeed. But ain't, yours was Lulz Day. It, yeah, Sweet um, 17. No. <laughs> that doesn't work. And now in part 10, I'm going to do some more item gathering. And then go to Dr. Doppler's first stage. Right now, I'm trying to get, I think, the heart. I got all the armor chips. Yeah, I missed out on the last two... Parts or whatever. Hey, well, I didn't this, see them, but I forgot. Yeah, and this is an ECW armor number one, or whatever you want to call it. And that's all for a uh, Crush Crawfish stage. Yeah. Oh no, I love that awesome music. Oh yeah, awesome music in this stage, Crush Crawfish, as we did. Well, I think we did that in what part five, or seven. Yeah, how do you how's good riff the stage or the guitar? Yeah. And Blizzard Buffalo, I guess things are starting to warm up in this stage. Oh, the lights are flickering, I guess, you know, horrible pun. But, uh, yeah, I think here all we gotta get is the heart container as well. Yeah, and well, you are the pun mower. Ha ha ha. There you go, that's a new one, pun mower. Now, this is ECW armor number one. I guess the other one was number two or three, whatever. Well, so you can now get mecha robots? Yeah. Uh. Oh, oh, it, yeah. uh, this funeral part of music again. I think Paul Bear is somewhere around here. <laughs> and how how apropos because he did return recently to rejoin the Undertaker, only to turn on him a few days later and join Kane again. But that's another story. Yeah. That <laughs> you don't know nothing about because you don't watch wrestling at all. Cause I don't care at all. Now here's some more back to this awesome stage with awesome music. Mm. What's at the Metroid map there? Oh, that's the uh, that comes from the helmet upgrade, which is like the I forgot what it's called exactly. Uh, radar detector, I guess you can tell if there are hidden uh, hitting hit, hitting what the heck, hidden items in the stage by looking at the map. So I think this is like Sk the Skip Rogers helmet of the future. <laughs> 
awesome. Everyone in the world will own a Skip Rogers helmet. Yeah. Skip will dominate the world! You ever hear the, you ever see the NES headset? It kind of looks like a... Headset? Like a, yeah, like, it's like earphones, really. It came out long time ago. Talk about the laser scope? No, I don't know what the heck was it. By Konami? You around your head and you hear the sound through the, through the headphones? Yeah, that's the laser scope by Konami that had the, uh, uh, had the thing where you could say, FIRE! FIRE! And that one game and... Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, My yeah. friend called the helmet. And I called Nintendo, is there such thing as a helmet that came up with the NES? And that explains to me, no, not really, it's the laser... Scope. Whatever it's called, scope, yeah. Laser scope 6. It's like, it's like the precursor to the super scope. Yeah. That, that like, helmet, I mean helmet, that laser scope is kind of ahead of its time. Yeah, I mean, I don't know, I think it's just pretty cool. Alright, let me use the uh, gravity well. Gravity well? Yeah, to its fullest extent here. Well, you must be well uh, prepared. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> well, well prefer. Uh oh, here we go again. Time to get ready to go to bed. Uh, how can they cut to this music? That's just. <laughs> yeah, it does uh, ruins the whole atmosphere now. Awesome uh, cat, Volt Catfish music to uh, Sleepy Time with Jeff music. <laughs> Whoa, it didn't sound right. Sleepy Time with Jeff. <laughs> oh, man, yeah. I bet I, like, I think Bear would like to take part in that. Well, there goes my capture car. Um, all right, now, <laughs> I didn't even read what he said, so I forgot what he says right here. Oh, yeah, the armor uh, thing. Yeah, it's not like matter. A bunch of X and X2, yeah, when you get hit, it like absorbs the damage and you can use it to your advantage later on or something like that. Whoa, it's cool. Okay, stoned Joey from Blossom. Whoa. Whoa, dude. Oh, whoa! Alright, I'm supposed to get, I think, another item. I think the heart or sub tank. Heart! I think a sub tank, yeah. First, I gotta use ECW armor number whatever. I'm just, I'm just listening to the music, sorry. I, I Oh god, it's such a mute video game music horror. <laughs> yeah, awesome, Why man. Me? ECW music. Oh yeah, whoa. Nice, go Mecha Man, go. Here we go, the sub, that sub-tank, E-tank, what are you going to call it, E-barrel. Now, when I was playing this earlier, I had to, as a, I had to do an outtake because, uh, it's not part of the lost take, so you won't see it here, but oh. I picked one of the armors happens to be like a frog type armor. You hop around, and so I got stuck right there in that narrow passageway, and it took me a long time to get out of there. And I was like, I need to cut that out. I, that's wasting too much time or whatever. I waste a lot of time anyway in some of these LPs, but that one just got on my nerves. And I was like, ugh, cut. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now this one I think I need is a heart tank. Heart tank. Heart uh, thing, and then... I think that'd be it. And so here's this heroic guile type music. It's, uh, Makes me want to play Top Gun. Uh, Top Gun the NES, why? <laughs> but yeah. As far as I made Top Gun for the Super NES, could use a Super Scope 6 for that. <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. Anyway, I think that's the, the, the last heart barrel. And yes, now time to face, or not face Dr. Doppler, but go to his castle in stage one. Here we go, Doppler Castle. Yeah. <laughs> Doppler's Lab. Oh, Dexter's Lab. Alright. And yeah, this music is kind of weird, but that's yeah, okay. It still rocks. Yeah, I don't know. It's mm. kind of weird. Cause sometimes I just listen to music and I'm all like, it almost seems like they just compose it really randomly. I don't know why. And I think uh, you gotta watch out for the spikes here. I think those are one hit kills. Aren't all Ooh. spikes one hit kills? No. Like, I think some Mega Man games you can... No, wait, I'm thinking of... Not Mega Man games, I'm thinking of some other games that they actually... I think there's some games you can actually fall into spikes, and you're invincible for like a second, you gotta hurry up and jump out. Huh. Yeah, Oops. Super Metroid, way, but you have a lot of energy in Super Metroid. Oh, yeah. Uh, that's what I'm thinking of, probably Super Metroid. There are like 15 sub-tanks, you know, you're not gonna die. <laughs> Yes, lots right. of energy. 
Star Souls your energy. Whoa. Oh. That Star Souls on crack. The bullet bill smile. Err. Bunzel yeah. bill. Err. I've come to help you! I'll stop the collapsing ceiling! You destroyed that junk robot! Okay. Oh, where's he going? Stop the ceiling from falling. Or stop it from falling as fast. I guess. <laughs> yeah. X, there's an army of powerful mavericks in Dr. Doppler's lab! Stop yelling at me, I'm right here! <laughs> They've been modified by Dr. Doppler into war machines. Be careful! I'll watch my step, thanks, Zero. <laughs> So no, you talk. I wish you talked like that because better than the girlish, gir girlish, the girly boyish voice robot he has. Yeah, and like all those games where he had voice acting or whatever. Yeah. What am I fighting for? Yeah, I'd rather him just have the kind of monotone voice you were actually doing. Yeah, like in a Captain N, the cartoon. Oh, yeah, I want to say. God, don't remind me of that. Well, at least Mega Man, you know, Mega Man's voice is much better than that one. He sound like an actual robot. Still not much. Uh. Here's ECW armor number three. Still, they fuck it up. How could they do that? Well, I guess it's not bad as Simon, but whatever. That whole show was just bleh. My favorite armor right here in the game. Yeah. You I sure like, are like hard-headed. I feel like I'm using a mini Metal Gear. Oh my god. Mega Gear. Mega Gear, that's what it should be. Wait, There's a special yeah. capsule. You get oh, the, yeah. I think it's called the golden chip. Oh no, not the music again! It's off the ship to enhance all your parts. The situation should now be improved. Good luck, X. Is there like a capsule to improve this music? Yeah, get the Tim Foley capsule. to this capsule, capsule so you can stop. Yeah, the Tim Foley capsule, there you go. <laughs> here we go, a little bit of Tim Foley-ish music here, I guess. No, mm, that guitar sound has to be more, uh, not like this. <laughs> Here we go, Golden Mega Man now. Uh, the Golden Child. <laughs> but there's no Enhance Andy Murphy. Enhance his voice, too. Really? No, huh. I wish. <laughs> hey, Golden Eye Man 64. Wait, Jesus. damn it. <laughs> they mean that 64. <laughs> golden Man, the man with the golden gun. Oh, yeah. Mm -mm. That one riff is very cool. Yeah, you can you can tell this is Capcom Super Nintendo music. Yeah, fits fits the X series perfectly. Oh yeah, man. Number Here 10. we go. Oh. <laughs> First boss in Doctor Doppler's lab. Wait a minute, I thought I killed we got. Oh, it X fought well to defeat Bite. Oh, I, I killed Bite, but not Bit. Bite Bit. He bit the dust, or bite the dust. <laughs> That'd be cool if that was a boss guy. He's right here. <laughs> oh. Combination of bit and bite here. So he's bit bite. Yeah. Well, we're sure gonna tear him bit by bite. <laughs> Let's see if this dog has any bite. Seriously, this is like, this is mega, mega pun next three, because seriously. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> I've been punning all, all this LP. <laughs> ding, ding, ding. Yeah, here we go. It's a more action oriented Super Ow. Nintendo guitaring. Well, this bites? How many oh, mega oh. bites is this game? Yeah, oh my god. You see that? He had a purple sword. <laughs> yeah. So I'm using the gravity well here, or not like a gravity well. I forgot what it's called. I'm using something here. Um. Yeah, I'll make a, a great video game reviewer for a uh, screw attack. Use <laughs> this, use this weapon. Yeah, Skip Rogers of, of the New Millennium is what I am. Use this weapon here. Use the use finger. this thing. Yeah, use this thing right here. Dun dun. Panther. And that is it for part ten. We'll we see you in part eleven, where I guess I think I got all the parts. Uh, in the game, all the items, so I guess part 11, I go to Dr. Doppler stays those. Until then, God bless and take care. See ya, peoples.
Welcome to part 11, Nultra Way. Uh, let's play Mega Man X3. This is Ron Moore. I'm on with J-Man 4641 and some idiot. Potato. <laughs> Mr. Potato here, how's it going? Pretty bland. I got pretty bad. You know, I've got eyes growing out of me where they're not supposed to grow, and I'm gotten kind of moldy. <laughs> but anyway, um, we are in Doppler Castle Stage Dolph. For children, my ass. And the boss at this stage is a potato, by the way. No, I'm just kidding. It's a waffle. If only. It's a waffle copter. <laughs> pew, 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 pew. Yeah, and uh, if you notice, Mega Man's gold. We got all the armor upgrades and stuff. I said he was gold because he changed weapon because it wasn't he like red earlier yeah but uh i got the ult <laughs> ultimate armor x chip or something and now he's he's golden he's a golden child oh i see you're on your uh buster there yeah and i got the, uh now I'm about to one. use zero for the first time since the beginning of this game da -da -da -da. as i power up you're ready to fight this little mini boss here Fighting the uh, we got copter here. It's I don't know. If mosquito, it were the we got copter, copter, it would never shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. Tim Bolin, Tim Bolin. <laughs> G off. Yeah, G off. Need to pee off. No. So yeah, this when thing I grabs you. It like hey, does some off. major damage. What was that? When I think of G off, I pee off. Okay, he's defeated it. Ow! The what hell? the? Wait a minute. And that's supposed to happen. You defeat it, it does that to you. Huh. So you have to fight him as... No, you don't. But if you, fight, if you fight him as Mega Man, you won't get this sequence right here because you must fight him with zero so that this little story, this little scene happens right here so that you can now collect zeros lightsaber because uh, he's dead <laughs> that, that you couldn't use during that battle right now now you use it during the battle but this time Mega Man has it I guess this is the last time you can ever use zero in the game okay yeah it's kind of like Metal Gear Solid I mean we want to play a snake not riding come on right right but anyway I digress hang on which, which Metal Gear Solid do you say it was Oh, part two. That's what I meant. You know. No, I thought you said three. No. Anyway, now we got the Z Saber. We got the Sonic Boom. <laughs> yeah. Sonic Boom. I like the lightning in the background. It's pretty cool. With this uh, kind of a catchy rock type music here. Looks like you're second, Ronnie. <laughs> On what? On dick. I don't no. know. Oh. I thought you stuck on shut up. I will. Okay. Shut up. <laughs> there. Okay, this is going to take a it. while. <laughs> I should probably quick cut for, through this, but oh well. Yeah, he uses his little platforms to the chicken heads trying to move up the spikes here. Whatever they are. What the heck are these things? You notice when I'm standing there, my energy looks like a rape machine. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> it looks like a rape machine. Is this the thing as a shut up machine? Not yet. But you're not smart enough to make one. Yeah, I am. Do do. Okay, Bear's been ejected from the call now, <laughs> and again. <laughs> so if you machine. notice, when, when X is standing there, his energy slowly goes up one notch at a time. That's just part of the upgrade that I got earlier in the game. Oh, there it is. This is so pointless right now. It's like, come on. No, because there's no other way to get up there. <laughs> we don't have rush jet in this game. It needs to be red to create. Oh, oh, that. <laughs> Start over. Oh, my pros. 
Oh, there we go. I think I know what the rest of the video is going to be. <laughs> What's that? That's a 10 minute climb to the top of, the, of this wall. Slash you fall, guessed okay. it! No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I know I show repetitive stuff in my LP, but come on. I'm not going to do that. Yeah, it's going to be a definite, definite time yeah. for a, a save state uh, skip thing. But see, I try to leave enough room for autonomic commentary, but not enough to where it's going to last a freaking long time. To where it's just ridiculous. Hang on, hang on. Five dollars for the premium version where this shit is edited out. <laughs> <laughs> that's, uh, that's PayPal at... No. At, at cloud.com. <laughs> yeah, cloud.com. <laughs> cloud, eight, $8,745, please. I can't believe you guys only gave five dollars. What's wrong with you? This is premium content right here. Yeah. This is I mean, you get, you get to watch me as it gets. And yeah. this is all that it's worth for you? Come on. <laughs> really? I mean, come on. You know what would have been better is if it were like name your price, donate, and you get access. And there would be people donating in equivalents of less than a, an American penny. You know, donating one yen. <laughs> <laughs> it's um it's launch octopus yeah <laughs> <laughs> super a launch of, octopus a mix of launch octopus and um uh, we guy and viper's love child i don't know it's like some uh shadow gate 64 this. going on For those of you who don't know we guy and viper really are brothers well no, brother no, and kidding. sister no, I was kidding. <laughs> whoa, whoa. <laughs> Chudley. Now, I made short work of, of this boss by using the Z Saber. Cheater. That's pretty ECW. That's not cheating. It's in the game. You can acquire it in the game without using cheat codes or anything, so that's not cheating. So? Yeah, but you can also acquire cheats through the game. You can't. Cheater. You grind you no codes in. Zero gave me. Zero gave me the Z Saber. Z Saber. Z Saber. Z Saber. Z Saber. <laughs> Zebra. It's cheated. Zebra Man. You cheated on cheating. Shut there up. There we go. Mega Man 11. Zebra Man. <laughs> oh, man. They can't, I mean, it can't be worse than that. Come on. Yeah, it can. Bear, man. Rawr. Actually, that might be kind Rawr, of cool. rare. <laughs> Guess what stage this is? <clears throat> oh, Boss well, Rush. Just choked on nothing. Uh, this Detroit. is... No, this is where you fire off the Mavericks, hunt Mavericks again, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to... Skip all that because it's the same thing. <laughs> Cheater. Okay, I'll leave the I'll, okay I'll leave the in there. Um, no, no, I can't now. No, the video's already edited. Well, you guys, you know, you guys said, oh, you know, you don't cut out stuff good enough. Well, here you go, I'm cutting all this junk out because we've always seen it. Well, you cut you cut out you kept the boring wait, wait, shit, but you took out the oh, wait, my bad. Oh, stuff. Yeah. Already, uh, that, that wasn't you already seen that though. In the previous parts, I've already beaten the Mavericks. So what what's if the point I've never of watching seen the that previous again? Parts? Huh? What if I've never seen the previous parts? But that's your shit. dumbass fault. W weren't you in them? <laughs> yeah. I don't think so. Anyway, that doesn't mean I was paying attention, fucker. <laughs> but pay attention, Dr. Asshole. And uh, <laughs> oh, here's Dr. Said password. Here's Dr. Doppler <laughs> radar now. He just strokes his beard again. Yeah. That's not the only thing he strokes in a day. <laughs> Yikes. Oh, shut your mouth. Um, when he goes to Chippendales, he strokes guys' cocks. Quit talking you, about yourself, Bear. Funny. <laughs> well, I can't. It was a very big day for me today. I bet it was big. That's <laughs> what he that said. Just... You know about Chippendales is the cartoon. I which uh, which Bear fair. covered both games. I thought that was and the then he, that he, was... he did more than that afterwards. <laughs> All right, here we go. I thought now, they named the, the strip clubs after the cartoon rats. <laughs> so anyway, when you hit Dr. Doppler, when he what was I drinks spaghetti crap, uh, he gets his energy back, so you got to be careful yeah. about that. You got to watch out for the forecast. And try to use Z, Z Saber on him. Z Saber Wolf Tiger. Saber Tooth Tiger. About to get pwned. Hey, tiger. It's not going to rain today. Crap. We're going to suck. I don't know how that... 
Guys, Way to suck. I want you, dumbass. Way to suck. <laughs> Way to suck. He's mad at his, at his boyfriend, Dr. Doppler. Yeah. I thought Ronnie was my boyfriend. No way, he's my child. You're a failure, yeah. Ronnie. You failed at failing to fail. Oh, I think that simple. means he actually succeeded. Yeah. <laughs> Somehow. I did good. He's, he succeeds <laughs> at being a failure to the successfulness of success. Uh-huh. <laughs> as we totally, as perfect. we totally ignore what the heck is going on here in the game, Doctor Doppler, Doctor Doppler has a baby face turn here, and he's now and telling X where Sigma is located. And then stabs X in the head, in the skull. <laughs> and then he'll come back later like Ric Flair. <laughs> yeah, Hulk Hogan, yeah. Uh, yep, right, right. <laughs> you know what I'd like to see? Thanks, Doc. After the first game, Mega Man gets stabbed in the head, and then all the other games are just like... You know how, like, how, uh... Okay, the video's that, over. Yeah, Can hurry you, up. Hang on, Come on. Hang on. Well, I'm trying to, but you guys won't shut the fuck up. You, we know how Saint you want to hurry up? For good reason. You know how St. Elsewhere ended? Uh -huh. That was all just got to... Do. Welcome to part 12 of Mega Man X3. This is Ron Moore along with Darth Vader and PS3 guy. No. Yay. Oh. No. And, and we are now in Sigma's fortress. And right here I am, uh, right there I cut through that because all I did was let my, let my sub tanks fill up. Oh, I'm so excited. We're going to do this. Yeah, it's, yeah. We just can't hide it. <laughs> and here we go with the third encounter with Sigma, the next three. This is the third time X is about to battle the almighty Sigma, the Reploid leader or whatever he is, Maverick leader. The leader of the Dallas Mavericks. Definitely not the leader of the Dallas Cowboys, otherwise they'd be doing better. Um, oh. And, okay, now, this is tricky. Um, this should be much easier now they have the lightsaber. But see, he has that shield, so I got to somehow get it around that. Yeah, and it's exactly. a good thing I have my sub tanks filled up because I'm taking a lot of damage. You can't make it through this without a map. Oh, yeah. You need a well, glowing okay. shield. What's a Sigma's glowing shield, man? It's not yeah. fair. ECW shield. Oh yeah. That's not the ECW shield. It bad is. guys Ooh. don't. Get, bad guys don't get the ECW shield. I gave the ECW a lightsaber. Look at his energy. Damn. Yeah, he's he just depleted. Yeah. Bad guys, bad guys get the WCW 2001 shield. Oh yeah, that's right. But good guys get the uh, ECW slash WCW 1995 shield. Good guys yeah. don't wear ties. Yeah. <laughs> yes, <Ooh. they> do. <laughs> All right, that's the end of the game. Uh, well, that was short. <laughs> and we got uh... <laughs> If those of you know better, that is not the end of the game because you know Sigma cannot die in the first battle, just like Doctor Wally. It has to be a second or third battle. I will never die. I'm far stronger than my previous forms. <gasps> Behold the power of the ultimate warrior. Battle. Oh, he turned into Giga Death. Oh wait, one game. Now we fight a Gundam soldier. But it's Christmas. What? <laughs> it's not Christmas tree. What you talking about? Oh, oh look it's... out for the Blu-ray of death. What <laughs> Blu-ray? That's really frightening. That's wow! You just like wiped like almost half of his HP. Yeah, that's the uh, that's the, how powerful the lightsaber is. Now, other than that, I don't know, don't know what the weakness is, what weapon you use. I forgot, but um, but majority is usually weak to electricity. Yeah. Hmm. Robots uh, uh, weak to electricity. Who would have thunk? Ah, girl, come uh, on, get out there in the face. Not you, Wiga. Because you don't have any electric weapons. You fight with tacos and pizza and Dr. Pepper. Well, I fight the natural way, alright? <laughs> that's not the natural way. You're the natural way. Now, watch out for the blue frosting. Because that's what it kind of looks like. It's just like... Grr, you gotta get right in his face to hit him. And it's, uh, it's all about timing here. It's so frustrating. 
man. He's like an yeah, ST. What, 2K? No, no, uh, <laughs> no, standing tank. Like in Battle Clash, in Middle Combat Falcon's Revenge. You I don't know that. Up. Yeah, yeah, never... Kevin, yeah, you don't play because you noob! You noob! That was uh, I, I never, I never played Battle Toads. Uh, Battle World Clash. Combat Revenge, whatever it's called. Falcon's Revenge hey, I... Combat. Hey, I broke Battletoads, remember that? <laughs> oh, yeah. I didn't see that video. I've watched part of it, but I got uh, distracted or I just didn't care and turned it off. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, my name is Dark Gen 2, and I like to break the shit out of video games. <laughs> I broke American Gladiators for Sega Genesis, because that's how bad I hated it. I broke the right <laughs> mirror. I accidentally broke Super Mario Brothers once because I was pissed off. I didn't get to go to Chuck E. Cheese's once, and I threw a copy of Super Mario Brothers at my mom, and I missed. Whoa! <laughs> Murder! <laughs> okay, uh, Mega Man is awesome, but he has no sword skills. Uh, we need to have Link to come in here and, and uh, train him a little bit. Yeah, I mean, come on, this battle is like, man, rinse and repeat. At least you hit Sigma. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, wow, that was some health. Nice health recovery there. Oh, oh man, I don't know if I'm gonna make it through this one. I don't know either. I mean, look at him. It's just like, ah, oh, this is so repetitive. Pretty much. He's annoying, man. Oh! Oh! Got him. Oh! oh. oh. He's he's combo broker. Broker. <laughs> <Stop broker. laughs> combo breaker. I meant. You stop broker. You're playing uh, the Killer Instinct. Yeah. That'd be a character's name in there. Uh, I don't know. The IRS from the WWE would be in there. C combo broker. No, it can't be. I can't even speak you with this magnificent body. Oh. There seems to be only one choice now. I'll possess you. Oh, and, uh, three, third form? Oh, come on. We're going back yeah, to this fight from X2? It's not oh, really yeah. a fight. You just gotta dodge him and watch out for the fire. Oh, so we're doing a Metroid now. Yeah. Kind of. Uh, oh, for you. Double, oh, oh, double dash in the air. Come on. Yeah, be like I- be- oh. I wanna be the guy! Double jump! Oh, uh, oh, uh, no. <laughs> oh my Don't die god. here, come on! I can go. If that, if that was Flame Stag stage, I would've been dead. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that took off a lot more damage than it did here. Yeah, dude. Uh, you're in a dead end now. Oh, he cussed! Yeah, yeah I just said, damn, it's a dead end! That is so epic! I don't know what I've seen that in the game. ECW. I first seen that, I'm like, whoa, what? Mega Man Squares. Ha ha ha. Give up X. No, I won't give up my Pokemon cards. You will not have them. And everything. Crickets, 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 crickets. Yeah, exactly. Here we go over the third fight right here. Oh, now the. Third oh no! Fight. Wait a minute. Doctor Doppler. Ah, oh, Doctor Doppler. That's who it is. Arrgh! Your Doppler radar. Today's forecast, you're destroyed. <laughs> Today's forecast is a chance of ECW with Wee Guy actually becoming a woman. <laughs> no, 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 tonight's forecast, Tornado Man. <laughs> <laughs> with a chance of ECW. ECW helper. She would rain ECW. As Dr. Dobber turns face here and helps X, he yeah. uh, puts Sigma in a force field or something to keep him in place, I don't yeah. know. They should put him in like a book, like they did with that movie where they put that face in the book, so his face is in a book. Now, I'm making a Facebook joke, okay, yes I was, but then I abandoned it, so, ah, screw it. <laughs> I thought you were trying to make a Facebook joke. Yeah, I was, but then I abandoned it midway through. <laughs> Had to steal uh, J-Man's line and say face palm. Yeah. <laughs> Lost. Alright, and now, uh, Doppler, uh, self-destruction... Destruction is self-destructing here to uh, destroy Sigma, and and uh, as we see many times in Eggman games, X I just escapes of, the exploding I, uh, fortress. I just thought of something when X said "damn" right when he ran into the wall. Why didn't he just teleport when he ran right into the wall? Oh yeah, that's that's a that's a good thought right there. Yeah, I mean he can teleport. You know, it's like get out of there, but you know, it's it's all part of the story. Maybe there's know? a teleportation blocker in the fortress or whatever. <laughs> There's no such thing. Yes, there is. He could teleport through spikes. Remember Mega Man 2, Boatman stage? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> uh. 
So uh, X gazes over the cliff again, thinking about his future and his destiny. Blah blah blah. Nice ending music. Na, 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 don't know how this music goes. <laughs> hey, why must Reploids fight against each other? Because that's what we were built for. Mortal Kombat! <laughs> that's all combat. Mega Man. Dun, 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 dun. Zero. Sub Zero. Get it? Noob. Yeah. Noob. Cybot. Ha ha ha. I get it. <laughs> yeah. Boon Tobias! You Tobias Druckmuller! Yeah. Yeah. What does fate have in store for me, he wonders. Groceries. That's the answer. What? <laughs> I was thinking Mega Man what? X4. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Pretty much. No, because Zero's going to be on that one. Well, oh yeah, well still... Okay, I think he thought he was wondering he was going to be Mega Man X4 on the Super Nintendo, but then it was PlayStation, so... Wah, wah. And Sega Saturn, and PC. Well, who cares about the PC? And Sega PC, Saturn for the win. PCW. PCW? <laughs> yeah. PCW. Yeah, Pissed Championship Wrestling. Did you just read that? Did you just read that? It says he knows... I think he said he knows he must destroy Zero. The only time will tell when and why. You can't destroy Zero, that'll cause a time paradox! No! <laughs> okay. Dun dun dun! Okay, there we go. And as Aww. X runs to find himself again, we see the credits. I'm going, I'm running to find myself! I'm gonna find myself! Space Lobster! <laughs> <laughs> Oh Speaking of Space Lobster, what you feel? How'd you feel about Crush Lobster or, or Crush Crawfish or whatever his name was? Well, if that's part of like... That's, that's not a, a Space Lobster. Yeah, well, it's part of this game which is pretty awesome, but we'll... S don't talk about it yet. We'll just go through all these mind tortoises and meta capsules and walk blasters and... Weird names of the characters. Zeros. Yeah. Uh, yeah, because I bet Angry Fanboys were like Capcom, like, put every single name of the character that we... No, a little customer. Put the names of the customers who bought this game. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Captain. Yeah, and look, Mac. Yeah, because she... yeah, Mac was that robot that Zero destroyed in the beginning of the game. Mm. Oh yeah. Yeah, because uh, I think they got a lot of fanboy responses saying, "Capcom, you need to start putting the names of every single uh, character." <laughs> Goliath. Yeah, I wonder Goliath who that was. On See, this show, I mean, I, well, obviously, they don't, probably couldn't fit all the press disposal. What the heck? <laughs> probably, could, probably could fit we all got, the images on here with, along with the names and the credits, so I don't know who exactly who is as far as these little uh, generic robots are. Yeah, man. So the fan going to get mad at that. Blast Hornet. Blast Hornet. Eh, he's all right. I bet he's having a blast in this game. Ha, ha, ha. Blizzard buff. His power's over 9,000! They yeah. are! <laughs> 9,002. I should say 9,001. Then that'd be perfect. Gravity Beetle. Cool music. Stage's Fair. okay, but the Robot Master... I mean, the Maverick is so freaking easy with the Neon Splash... Ray Splash or whatever it's called. Yes! Yeah, everyone likes to ECW talk about Yeah, everyone likes Polluted to talk Polluted Pony! Yep. Polluted Pony! <laughs> <laughs> Polluted Ocean Pony, yeah. Oh yes, awesome stage music. Bull catfish. Shocking. Bull, cat, bull catfish king. I don't know if you have that restaurant in your area. Anyway, no, uh, we have uh, we have the uh, crawfish. Space <laughs> lobster fish. Space lobster crawfish. <laughs> Lobsters in space. Tona Rhino, the oh, ECW yeah. wrestler. Yeah. Neon Tiger. Ah, he's all right. Wolverine He's got speed hacks. It's over 9,000. Real name, Tony. <laughs> nice. It's, hey, it's me! Oh my god, my speed is hacking and my power is over 9,000! I am the ultimate master! It's bitch! <laughs> it, it's bitch. Oh. oh, bye, there's Bear. Yep. <laughs> He's got a lot of power. Look at his big belly. <laughs> yeah. His mouth is mostly the power. <laughs> Whoa, what the heck? God, what? come... God car machine, oh, near I, I near I. <laughs> Whatever that means. Oh, vile. Looks like Boba Fett. Boba F yeah, I was gonna say, yeah. it looks like Boba Fett. <laughs> Boba Fett! <laughs> he was for UCW. Dr. Doppler Radar, today's forecast, I'm dead. 
<laughs> but it needs to turn the face and help out the end, so ECW. Sigma with lots of stuff. Sigma and Von Kaiser Sigma? No, just Kaiser. Kaiser the Coven! <laughs> oh, Sigma Virus making his return for Mix 2? With no uh, pins of power or speed. He is pathetic. <laughs> no, that's how mysterious oh. he is. Uh, oh, more mysteries too, look at that. Yep. That's well, zero was not a zero in life. <laughs> the answer's 42. 40, and oh, you? And me! Yeah, me! No, me! No, me! Like, no, oh, I'm me! Like, I recorded it, shut up. <laughs> All of us, shut up! <laughs> It'd be cool if you could customize it. And Rombo, where she put that, yeah, I'm gonna put that in annotations. Uh, uh, thanks for playing. I wasn't even playing the damn game! Yeah! <laughs> thanks, for, thanks for commentating. I just lost. I just lost. <laughs> <laughs> what the story, right. Gentoo? <laughs> cool story, bro. I mean, cool story, sis. Shut up. <laughs> cool story, sis. Riveting <laughs> <laughs> tale, chap. Right. Yeah, ah! right. That by Capcom. There you go. Just in case you can't follow what uh, you're supposed to read on the screen. Uh, I can't. <laughs> All right, so that is it uh, for the game. Uh, stay tuned for Let's Discuss. Make a minute. I class. lost! So until then, God bless and take care. See ya! Oh, wow. Uh, Space Lobster! Failure. Welcome to Let's Discuss Mega Man X3. This is Ron Moore along with We Got 309 and Darth Jinchu. Yo. Again. So yeah, uh, Mega Man X3 is uh, pretty ECW even though I like X2 better. Um, X3 though has some uh, weird but awesome uh, Mavericks. Uh, Crushed Crawfish, uh, Volt Catfish. Toxic Seahorse is pretty ECW. Um, Gravity Beetle was pretty lame. Uh, I can't. Uh, Tunnel Rhino was, was pretty awesome. Buffalo Bill, whatever his name is, Blizzard Buffalo yeah, was. Buffalo. His stage, that's that funeral part of music. Um, nice. I guess that stage. Yes, yeah, that stage is all right. Um, I forgot Neon Tiger. Eh, it was okay. Uh, and who else is next? Um, is that it? Blast Hornet. They have two or three more. Who? Blast Hornet. Blast. Yeah. Uh, Neon Tiger, Tony the Tiger. Oh, and that. Uh, no, we already said that. No, it's that. Uh, it's that fish thing. Yeah, Volt Catfish, Crush yeah. Crawfish. Yeah, there we go. Volt Catfish. That's the final one. Yeah. No, I said that one already. Uh, oh. Pfft. And I know there's about two more. I think I can't think of uh, any more, but that's okay. Uh, overall, I think the game was uh, pretty good. I like the music better in X2. Um, however, Part 3 offered the option to play Zero, which is pretty cool. Um, even though you didn't get really using that much in the game. Um, and let's see. Uh, so, yeah, I mean, overall, uh, as far as the storyline, you know Sigma was going to be behind it again. And they had this Do Dr. Doppler radar, whoever he was. He also got to fight Vile. Again, that was pretty cool because we didn't see him since the first X game, and so he returned to try to get revenge. Awesome power power upgrades in the game, such as the armor chips and the the ability to get zero saber, and and, and the golden chip and all that stuff. That that was pre pretty awesome. Pretty awesome power ups in the game. Um, overall, real good game. I would have to give it a uh, I say 8.5 out of 10. We got. Alrighty then. Yeah, I haven't played Mega Man X uh, 3, but, you know, I, it, it looks pretty cool, like you said. Uh, definitely, the music is awesome, because, yeah, my usual video game music thing. Uh, but I would say, mm, I don't know, I think I like this actually better than X2, but that's just my own taste, of course. I just need to re-listen in both, like, back-to-back -back for the first three. But either way, the music is like ECW. And the, yeah, the uh, you know, gameplay looks is pretty much looks the same as the others, just, you know, new stuff added, like you said, all these new power-ups, which probably enhances it a little differently than the previous one, I think. I forgot if you said that gameplay is better than the previous, but I don't know, I'm not paying attention, really. Uh. Well, uh, X3 definitely has better power-ups. Uh, yeah. I just, I just overall, my overall experience in X2 is just better. Yeah, uh, yeah. And the, yeah, let's see, gameplay looks, you know, pretty usual... Mega Man or this Mega Man X, pretty cool. The controls look pretty, guess solid because it seems CW? like at times you were 
Yeah, I guess it looks like at times you were kind of like struggling at some points. I don't know if it, yeah, the controls. We're using emulator and controllers, so it was really it. the uh, the emulator controls is what it, yeah. what it was, and uh, it it wasn't like that on Super Nintendo. Ah, yeah, of course, real thing is much better and a little bit easier. And, yeah, and of course, sound that's like the same as music, whatever. And uh, yeah, overall, this game looks pretty ECW. Of course, I haven't played, so I get an N out of A. But now. I forgot if I did this with X2, but I'm now going to give, like, a pre-score. Like, if I did play it and gave it a score, I'd say this would be about a mm, 7 out of 10. Gen 2! Gen 2! First played it, it was kind of a challenge because I didn't know what to do and stuff. Then, um, it was a good game. The Like I said, the gameplay was great. It was... A good way to go out with a bang for the Super Nintendo, for for it being the last uh, X game for the Super Nintendo, before moving to uh, 32-bit era, and the music was good, and the ability to get the ride armors was actually pretty cool, and the it was I liked it. It was pretty great. So I'm gonna give the game uh, an 8.1 out of 10. I think awesome. that battle with Sigma was pretty good. Yeah the, yeah, the Sigma battle was a little bit pain in the ass, too. I like the virus battle with NX2 better, though, really. I mean, I don't know why. I guess because the music, boss battle music was better. And, uh, and you, know, you can I, kill it in two hits with the Shuriken. Yeah, I never got the sh- Shuriken uh, thing in uh, X2. I decided to get all the power-ups in X3 after watching... Uh, I forgot his name on YouTube. That I've been watching the playthrough of Zan Xanax. I'm not sure. Xanax. Uh, uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> Those are good kills. Credit goes to him for me helping beat this game because I was never really that good at it. I beat it when I was a like young teenager, but that was like a long time ago, and I never got all the power ups. And the only X games I was truly familiar with is like X and X2, or especially X. Um, I had to go through a tutorial and get help on X2 a little bit as well. But X3, really challenging game. And uh, overall, yeah, pretty ECW. Yeah, another oh, yeah. good X game. Yep. What about you, Star Soldier? Oh, yeah, Star Soldier. Thanks for having me in next. Let's discuss. Oh, yeah. I have to give it a, a 8 out of 10. What do you say, Jay? Yeah. All right, thanks, guys. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's it. We're out of here. Uh, I'm Ron Moore. We got 3 or 9. Da, chin, two. God bless and take care. Gentoo. I lost the game. Indeed you did. You lost everything. Especially this recording. Oh wait, I'm recording.